How excited are we? Happy birthday, happy oh. birthday. Altered images. Altered, it was that yeah, it was? Yeah, yeah, lovely Claire Grogan. That was, gosh, that's back in the day, wasn't it? Back, it, back yeah. in the day. My favourite is, I think it's the Stevie Wonder one. Oh, yeah. Happy, happy birthday, birthday to, to you. Yeah. It's all um, very subdued in here. We think, we think something may, may happen a bit later. Oh, there's definitely something, Some, something happening. Is, something is being planned. For those of you that don't know, it's Jewelry Maker's 12th today. birthday today. today. And of course, we like to milk it. We do Absolutely. like 12 days <laughs> of it, don't we? But Just think when we're 60 years old, we'll, we have two months nearly of, of celebrations. That'd be amazing. Can you imagine? You and, you and oh, I'll be literally we're walking on. on up there. <laughs> it's our birthday. <laughs> well, here's hoping anyway. Oh, yeah. my goodness me. Mark, it oh, is going to be amazing today. It's going to be it? amazing. I can't wait today. So I'm really excited. So much, so much planned. Um, I don't even know where to begin. I, I genuinely don't know where to begin. It's it's literally, we're going to be oh. giving things away. We've got we've got some of the best, most exciting auctions coming up. Well, the, the early bird, that's going to fly, that's going to disappear in seconds. I, I think got, so, too. Yeah. We've got 200 oh. of each. Okay. Um, okay. And, and just so you know, that is a sticker. You peel it off and it becomes all mm. lovely and shiny. So every time that you see our beautiful recordings of, well, not every time, but most of the time, Aww. you see our beautiful recordings of strands and yeah. loose gemstones. They are actually photographed um, and recorded on these. So now imagine doing it with your creations. It's amazing. We see so many beautiful photos on Wall of Fame, don't we, yeah. coming through. These have just been that little thing a few, with lots of people have set up websites, haven't they, through lockdown and uh, selling on Etsy and little stores Can and things imagine? like that. Can Being you imagine your mix on Etsy and actually imagine. having a moving image yes. on Etsy? How good that's going to be in all your Facebook pages. Well, you haven't got long to wait for these. They're coming up within this hour. Um, as, as we've just mentioned, there are 200 of each. 200 of each and very straightforward. It's literally three buttons. Even I can figure Which that out. Which colour would you have? Oh, I don't know. I know, that's the predicament I'm in. See, well. it, it, is it a case of, I'm going to, um, and I meant to ask you this, Adam, before we came on air, would you choose a black over a white and a white over a back, black for certain strands? And gem Yes, he says. Ah. Okay, so yeah, that makes sense. So there's going to be certain gemstones which would look would be more favourable mm. on the black, and vice versa. But if you wow. want to single it out, then obviously that's your preference. Like for here we go. For example, here's an example. This is emerald. That's on a white turntable. Oh, okay. Right. And then aha, wow. and that's on the black. So it's literally preference, I think. Mm. Um, bring, it brings out different qualities, says that. We should get Adam out here for this, shouldn't we? <laughs> we totally should, because he's the one that's really knowledgeable about the turntable. So they're coming up at 8 o'clock today as your early bird. Then at 9 o'clock... We've got these amazing... For the first time, we've got Mookite. And you may say we've had Mookite on quite a few times recently. Not with these drill holes. Look, two millimetre drill holes. And I'm going to show you a demonstration in that nine o'clock hour using one of these <laughs> household implements. Ooh, an earbud. Yes, that's what okay. I know. Like. So I'm going to be showing you how to make jewellery using an earbud this morning. That's interesting. Mm -hmm. I'm excited about space. that. Yes. Most households have got <laughs> earbuds within, well, haven't they? Well, that's what I thought, yes. Um, so the, the benefits of having a true, uh, two mil drill hole? This leather. Normally, our, our, gems, our genuine gemstones are far too small for using with leather, the gemstones. Yep. So we've, these have been specifically drilled for us. No one else, no one else that are, these gemstones are provided for. These are, these are specially drilled for jewellery maker for work with leather bracelets. Amazing. And we've, we've got Father's Day coming up, haven't we? Yes. So one oh, for, for gents leather bracelets. And, um, and that's with the Mookite, so perfectly coordinated. Yes, yeah, so we've got Mookite jade eye. Jade eye with two yeah. millimetre drill holes. You've got to imagine yeah. us saying to our, our, our jade eye supplier, yeah. can you drill a whopping two <laughs> mil drill, a drill hole through the mm. centre? They can almost gasp, yeah. aren't they? They can yeah. be like, you understand why it's quite, you know, not really it's something mm. they ever actually see. And then we've got it, some lovely jaspers too. So those are coming yes. up at... Um, nine o'clock, and you're really excited about I those rondelles. Wait. They're, too, they're aren't amazing. They? They're, they're so, I think the green is my favourite. Yes, can you they're see that? Amazing. You It'll, get like a flash of look at that. Yeah. Peridot green. Beautiful. Um, very zesty. I totally I mean, agree. Got red and a blue. Oh, I love those kits. They're coming up at nine o'clock today. 
Your deal of the day today is something extra, extra special. No, I think, I think you and I have done really well not to look in this. Yes. So it's going to be as much as a surprise a for us as reveal. the viewers as well. Look at the box, firstly. I think it's so Joe. <laughs> it's so Joe Malone. Yeah. You know, I, I mentioned that didn't, to you, didn't yeah, I? Yeah. You know, you would. <laughs> you, you'd spend fortunes on the box on yeah, its own. It kind of opens up. Um, very luxurious. This is your deal of the day. You have your 12th birthday celebration within, which includes some of your absolute. Wow. Favourites, including jadeite, including labradorite, including lots of sterling ah, silver, including tanzanite. There it is. Look at that. Ah, look. There it is. Wow, wow, wow. Um, well, it's worth in excess of two hundred pounds, and I can tell you the price that what that I've seen written on the star buy sheet. I would expect to pay for the box. Oh gosh. Mm. Okay. It's going to be amazing. We've got wow. a big quantity auction of those as well. Um, then we've got a fantastic collaboration with Connoisseurs. First time this year. Yes. I love Connoisseurs. Me too. And love it's so important, them. isn't it? You know, yes. you know, we work of when you're creating your pieces or wearing your jewellery, it's so important to mm. keep them looking brand Absolutely. new and sparkly. Absolutely. And um, so this is the perfect, perfect box exclusive to Jewellery Maker. You will not find this anywhere else. You can get the individual items of course but oh, it's our branding look so that yes. it's just for us just for jewelry wow. maker um so this is going to work for all of your creations but not only that all of your jewelry mm. that you already have within your collections at home you know um i'll be the first to admit i need to maybe clean my engagement ring a little bit more often than i do <laughs> um but yeah this is perfect it, it's it, like i said exclusive here at jewelry maker and again an amazing collaboration saving wow. for you also now, then we've got the lovely Debbie you joining have. us as I've well. I've seen her photos on Facebook. Yes. They look amazing. They do, don't they? Yeah, yeah. I hope we're all expecting to really yes. treat ourselves today because it's the birthday. We should be, but we're going to start the birthday the most perfect way uh, to launch your 12th birthday celebration, and that's by giving Wall money Wall away. Wall it's the Wall <laughs> of Fame. Starting us off this morning is Vivian. Vivian, your number 478. Talking of photography. Perfect. Good Amazing. Right. Look how beautiful that is. Hi, all. Yet another make uh, from Hematite. Endless strand I bought from JM a while ago. I still have lots left. Love the hearts uh, that tessellate together. Happy 12th birthday, JM. I have been with you um, nearly all that time. And Jewelry Maker has certainly helped me be more zen, she says. Best wishes <laughs> to all. And that's from... Uh, uh, Vivian, from times, um, uh, times, yes, I need, I mm. need help being a bit more zen. Mm. Number four hundred and seventy-nine is from Christine Salcombe. Beautiful, Good Christine. Lads. Amazing. Wow. Happy birthday, jewelry maker. This is my first waff. Uh, lace necklaces and a sun catcher with Eslon with sea beads and labradorite rounds on memory wire, and a wire chain from jewelry maker. Um, what's that? Gutterman sewing threads and DMC number five multicolored thread were added from my stash. Good luck to all. Good luck to you, Christine. They're absolutely That's fabulous. Amazing. Oh, look. Number 480 is from Kim Hopkins. Look at that. That's amazing. That's Isn't hours that? of work. Amazing, amazing, yeah. amazing. Please find attach my entry to this week's WAF. Uh, it's a CB necklace inspired by Monica, all from Jewelry Maker. Good luck to everybody entering. Great shows and inspiration this week. Stay safe, says uh, Kim. And to follow suit, of course, is number 481, and that is Alan Hopkins. Amazing, amazing, amazing. Please find my entry to this week's WAF. It's a selection of different chainmail bracelets, uh, which Kim has taught me uh, to make. Good luck to everybody. Aww. And uh, he says, great to see Zena this weekend. Stay safe, everyone. Good luck to you, Alan. I'm going to pass over. Thank you. Pop there we go. On. So next we have number 482, and this is from Jackie. Hi, everyone. Here is my entry for this <coughs> week. And it's a pair of rose gold-plated sterling silver earrings with lepidolite and phantom amethyst quartz. Beautiful. The findings and gemstones are from JM, and the seed beads are from my stash. Hope you like them. Number 483 is from Bronwyn. Bronwyn. Oh, very nice. 
A very happy birthday to jewellery maker. This week's wall of fame is made with two strands of graduated blue magnesite and pearlized seed beads with silver accent seed beads in the cross. Wow. All components were purchased from jewellery maker. Good luck to everyone in the draw. Best wishes. And that's from Bronwyn. Bit of quick kiss cross. It's lovely. Yeah, graduated. Amazing. I went a bit Welsh then. You did go a bit Welsh. <laughs> 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 Number 484 is from Sandra and Sandra says while sorting through my stash I came across these amethyst rice beads which were shouting out to go with freshwater pearls. I've teamed them up with rose gold plated sterling silver spacer beads with a magnetic clasp. Everything is from yourselves. I hope you like them as much as I do. They're, love, I love those. They're, they're amazing aren't they? Julie Dudley is number 485. Oh, well, again, photography. Hello again, everyone. This week, my entry for the Wall of Fame is a new design of earrings I've created to go with a bridal necklace I made last week. I've just used rose gold plated copper wire with shell pearls and everything is from Jewelry Maker. Good luck to everyone entering the draw this week. Love and best wishes from Julie. They're beautiful. Number 486 is from Katie. Lovely. Hi everyone, my entry for the Wall of Fame is a simple long line necklace. It features Tiger's Eye nuggets that I bought from JM a very long time ago. Hope you like it. Beautiful. We love, love it. We love Lovely. it. Lovely. Last but by no means least, number 487 is from Kelly Wales. Oh, stunning. Look at that. Hello everybody at Jewelry Maker. Here is my entry for this week's Wall of Fame. I made this necklace and bracelet for my daughter's prom. Um, it's made with pearls, purchased from Jewelry Maker and two millimeter crystal charms from my own stash. Good luck to everybody this week. And that is Kelly. Well, oh. guess what? You haven't got to wait that much longer because... You know, I, <laughs> we didn't have proms in my day. We had, no. we had school discos. Yes. <laughs> Same. No cars, no gowns, oh, no. no suits. There was none of that. No, none, none of that. that. No. I'm dreading it actually now. I've got two girls, got two, two prom dresses. Two to, weddings to pay for. Two weddings, yeah. two weddings, yes. <laughs> oh, wow. Before we, before we do the Wall of Fame, look at this. It was the, it's the uh, listen, it's the Tanzanite that we have attempted oh. to bring to you on two separate occasions and quite literally... <laughs> not had the time. Um, it's too special not to have included in the birthday wow. event. Look at the quality of this Tanzanite. Oh, look at that. It's perfection, Mark, isn't it's it? It's beautiful. Every single stone look is exactly the same as its name. Yeah. That's beautiful. Eye clean, exceptional colour. It's coming up when? <gasps> oh, look. We'll do it in the 12 o'clock hour. Um, so wow. make sure you're with us for that opportunity. But it is that time. And Mark... You can do the winner. No, I want you to do the winner. Oh, really? Yes, I want you to do it this time because you're so wonderful and lovely and you look so handsome today. So you do the winner. Okay. Receiving £100. On a special birthday. It's Star Wars Day as well today. Yes. May the force be with you. Right, then. The winner of the birthday wall of fame is number... 475. That is uh, Jackie Pye. That is, oh, we didn't have it today. Jackie, what did you say? Jackie Pye. Jackie, Jackie Pye. Pye, congratulations, well done. Well you're done. our winner. Fantastic. Amazing, amazing, amazing. Congratulations, though. We, I, I can see everyone frantically flicking through the pieces <laughs> to see if it was today, but I think it was yesterday. It must have been yes, yesterday. Yes, it must have been yesterday. Um, okay, now runner up. Receiving £50, give it a good whiz. I never entered the Wall of Fame. Didn't no, you? No, no, now I can't. No, you're not allowed there. No. Not allowed now. No, no. Right, our runner-up. Have I got one? Yes. Receiving £50, credited to their jewellery maker account. Oh, it might have been yesterday as well. Oh. Number 465. Joan Kerry, well congratulations. You are our runner-up on the birthday well celebrations. Done. Amazing. I almost put that back in there then. <laughs> um, well done, everybody. That's a great way to start your That's Wednesday morning, amazing. isn't it? Amazing. Oh, my goodness me. Now, if you have just tuned in, it is our 12th birthday celebration and we have some of the most amazing, amazing... Well, it's the best show. Best show. The biggest day, arguably, of the entire year. Would you agree? I think so. I think Without so doubt. too. Yeah. I think so too. Start to yes. finish. I can see Dan waiting in the wings. What are you oh. passing me? 
These are the turntables, are they? This is going uh, to be our early bird. I can't quite hear you, Ross. What did you say? That's all right. Um, they come fully boxed, just like so. Um, you can get them in the two colours. Now, just so you know, we have 200 of each of those colours. We've never done these before, I don't believe. No, I've never seen no, them. No, no. no. Um, amazing for your photography. Um, not just if, not just if you sell your jewellery, but you know, if you showcase it, if you do things like. Well, but we've we've had so many beautiful stones from Alex, haven't we? Yes. Just to have them on your coffee table or on the, on, the, on the shelf in a room, just having it revolving amazing. like that. Amazing, absolutely amazing. Yeah. Or if you do things like your artisanal markets, I mean, how amazing oh, would that table, be just literally yeah. oscillating that away? That would draw people in, wouldn't um, it? You could, this is coming up within this hour, so not too long to wait. But Ross has said, for the first time today, um, <laughs> fast and pacey, El, because there's a lot, fast and pacey, fast and pacey. Um, we're going to go straight to Rhyolite. Oh, look at this. Um, we're going to blast through some amazing, amazing early bird deals. Don't see this gemstone that often, no, Mark. No, no. Oh, no. look at that. That's amazing, isn't it? We, well, we, I think it's Alison Tarry's favourite <coughs> I think it is. I, like. I think it yes. is. I think you're right. Yeah. Hello to you. Nikki saying, oh. happy birthday, JM. You have changed my life and I'm so grateful. Sending love to everybody at Jewelry Maker. How lovely oh, is that? You. Thank you, Nikki. She's gorgeous, Nikki, isn't yeah. she? I hope she's spending her winnings today from Friday. Yes, yes. <laughs> You did really well, didn't you? Uh, hello, Alison. Morning, JM team. Happy Good birthday. Um, I'm at oh. work, uh, but at home. So we'll be joining <laughs> for all the fun. Mark, very smart. You look very handsome. Thank you. I said that to Mark when he walked through the door. This, I was is, like, this, you... is, this is, well, from the waist up anyway, because I'm wearing jeans. But from the waist up, I wore this on my wedding day. The oh, shirt, tie, waistcoat. Yes. Uh, but the jeans down looks, it looks, this whole ensemble oh, Thank you. looks very nice. They're very good <laughs> shoes, by the way. Can, does, I, I don't know about you, I always look at men's shoes. Very good shoes. There we are. Uh, hello to you, Ted. Happy birthday, jewellery maker. May the 4th be with you. Looking Bless forward you. to a bumper show. And it yeah. is going to be exactly that, Ted. It's going to be amazing. Out of this world, quite uh, literally. I yeah. like that. Otherworldly. Yeah. Um, I'm trying to think down? of others now. Why are we going down? I'm stumped. <laughs> I'm literally stumped. Yes, we're going to be literally orbiting with Ro Ross's deals. <laughs> I'll stop there, I'll quit while you're ahead. Uh, £4.99, pence, or is it? Totally natural. I love Rylite. And I was about to say to you, Mark, you know, we, we often discuss mm. our love of this country and how beautiful yeah. the UK is. I see that beauty within no, Rylite. Isn't it amazing? Lovely colours, flashes of oranges within, with that mm. faceting. We don't see rhyolite very often. If you were to imagine a gemstone coming from the UK, this would be one of them. I think so. Yeah, it rhymes with the Lake District. And yes. The and it does rhyme with the Lake Rolling District. Rolling hills. So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Rolling hills and beautiful quintessential English country gardens. It's from the USA, but um, we're going to take this to a below cost price. Not even we, Mark, no, given the perks no. that we have. We have the odd perk. Couldn't purchase no, at the price that's on your screen. That's amazing. Two pounds and ninety-nine pence only. Now I'm also thinking, Mark, with some of uh, um, your I've gone blank. What's it called? Paracord like mm. designs. Oh yeah, that'd be amazing. Channel set down the centre of two yeah. pieces would look really cool, wouldn't it? That would be cool. Father's Day's mm. coming up as well. Mm -hmm. But I'm saying masculine, but at the same time, yeah, I would wear yeah. this as well. Um, a bit tweed-esque. It's very tweed-esque, actually. Mm. Yes. I like a bit of tweed, don't you? Um, it's nice to see sort of tweed jackets and things like that. Um, yeah, if that's something that you rock, then Rhyolite is perfect. Hello to you all. Libby, Brenda, hello to you. Daphne, Lynn, Christine, you customer. Ayrshire, sorry, Rosita, uh, Cheshire. You've got to check out your baskets. This is below cost. We can't even physically buy it for what's on your screens. But that's the whole nature of the Jewelry mm. Maker show. Um, during, during, well, we can't do it every single day, granted, but it is our 12th birthday celebration. So do expect lots of savings like this. Um, and I wouldn't be just limiting myself to just one either. <laughs> I'd be multi-buying as well. How many do I have, Roscoe? 65. Um, I have to say there is one little bit of disappointment I had this morning. One, a, a tiny mm. bit, a moment of disappointment I had when Ross turned up this morning. <laughs> no, no, not anything. When he sentence. turned up this morning. <laughs> no, because I love seeing our Ross. He's got the happiest face in the mornings. Mm. Ross, disappointed though that you didn't wear your leather trousers as promised. What happened there? 
He says, I don't know where the rumour came from, but I actually don't own leather, leather trousers. trousers actually. Me too. Yeah. Me too. Yeah. Uh, look, here's a fun fact. Perhaps this could be our theme. Share some, um, some, some. I don't know, information about about the jewellery maker crews that you don't yet know. Um, oh, so, did idea. you know this? Our Ross, stand-up comedian. So we're here. Yeah. I keep nagging him to yeah. be able to go to one of his shows, but at the moment he does. He has the invite hasn't been extended. <laughs> <laughs> he says it's early days. You have not been, Adam. Have you actually been? Oh. Right, best not fall out with you, Ross. It's a very important day. Adam's got this amazing haircut today. He has. He looks very dapper and, and handsome says, this morning. Yeah, Everybody's, yeah. Every, ev everybody has yeah. literally uh, brushed up, brushed up beautifully for the celebration. <laughs> How about some eagle eye? I love this. I Me love too. This. I had disappointment in the cat this morning with what I found in the downstairs loo. Oh, no. I had to clear up before I came to work. What was it? Did it fly or did it squeak? Uh, it did squeak at some point. Mm. Oh, honestly. I know. Did he Breaks eat my it heart. He, he ate some of it. Okay, well, there's a little <laughs> bit of... I mean, that I take a little bit more yeah. comfort in the fact that they've actually eaten it. Mm. It's when they just, just, just killed them that makes me sad. Um, naughty pussy cats. Um, hello to you, uh, <laughs> Kathy saying, I laugh all the time at Ross's prices. Um, yeah, exactly, exactly. <laughs> and also, I've got I've got images of Ross now with talcum powder and a pair of leather, leather trousers. Oh, is that like what you a, do? Is that what you well, do? Well, have you? Do? Oh, you've never seen Friends? No, I've never seen Friends. So yeah. Ross goes on a date and he wears his leather trousers and of course gets rather hot. Right. And then can't pull his leather trousers back up. So he's trying to use all kind of concoctions in her bathroom to lift the trousers oh, up, no. and he ends up making um, a very questionable paste. Out of, uh, oh, no. <laughs> out of various, you know, sort of cream and talcum powders and things. So I've got that image, ah. um, that image now of, of Ross. You should do it, Ross, one day. Um, although, although I did promise that I wouldn't, I wouldn't heckle you if I come and see you. Um, I might have to heckle you if you wear leather trousers. <laughs> uh, 7.99, but that clock is ticking. This would be lovely in Kiss Cross. This would be amazing, Kiss Cross. Yeah, got Go, quite a show on Saturday with Kiss Cross. You have mm. special show on Kiss Cross. Yeah. What colours would you go with? Below cost, Ooh. we still, we can't purchase <laughs> oh, it for this price. I'd, I'd keep it really monochrome. Go for gunmetal. I knew you'd say that. I love gunmetal. Me too. Yeah. Birthday treats all <laughs> day. Keep those messages coming through as well. Hi, Maureen. Oh. Happy birthday, jewellery maker. I've been with you since day one. Couldn't be without you now. And now we have Hobby Maker 2. Loving it, absolutely. Mm. I have to say, Hobby Maker is costing me a fortune. Yes, I did hear you saying you're slightly obsessed. I tuned in for the whole show yesterday afternoon and bought everything. Is that the hunky dory? Yeah. I mean, they are beautiful, aren't they? Where do you have the time to do all this stuff? I know, I've got quite a stash for me. Well, I'm determined this year we're not going to buy, from, from now up until after Christmas, we're not going to buy a single card. We're going to make them now. OK. So, oh, that's, a, that's, so, that's yeah. a good... Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Oh, how lovely. So everybody's going to be receiving... Handmade cards. Handmade and we had, cards. We've had a stamp made that we stamp on the back of the card saying cards from Chestnut Close. Oh! Yeah. That's very special. I love that. Yeah. I love that. Now, if you fancy card making, make sure you tune in. Yeah. Um, to our lovely sister channel Hobby Maker that comes on mm. after the Jewelry Maker celebrations. Right, look at this now. Look at the colour and also look at the wow. quantity that you're getting here. Oh, oh. What have we got here? 250 centimetres. We've got how many left? 14 oh, no. left. Should be £17.99. pence. You know, this is not amethyst, which is pale or no, wishy-washy no, in its colour. Yeah. Amazing. We always describe it as like a chocolate box, don't we? Mm. Do you remember that advert? Or because the lady, lady loves, loves milk tray. You look a bit like the milk tray man without the polar neck. <laughs> um, I like a good polar neck. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like a man in a polar neck, actually. Yeah. 9 should have been wow. £17.99 pence um, to get hold of 380 carats. Uh, and I love a nugget. They create so much texture and movement, and I've seen lots of beautiful tree of lives. One of the chakra colours, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Two and a half metres, wow. yeah, not even just a metre. This would create, um, I, I like to drop these into conversation when I'm in the presence of our lovely Mark. This would be lovely for you, Asterias. It would. 
<laughs> can you remember what I told you about the difference between Japanese and Chinese? See if you remember, see if you can um, I remember you saying about bluebells, and I was looking at bluebells and mm. thought, oh, yes. Mm. Um, um, Japanese, no, I can't remember. Is it how so, they hang? So how it... It's bluebells. Bluebells. No, we're serious. Chinese goes clockwise. And yeah. Japanese goes anti-clockwise. As if. Mm. I heard you needed a male and a female for them to... No. to no, is that untrue? Oh, there we are then. No. Totally wrong. Yeah. Um, hello to you. You can read this yeah. one now. This is from Josephine in Staffordshire. Thank you, GM, for being my best house guest for 12 oh. years. Love you all. We love you too. We love you Bless too. You. How well, amazing is that? How changed lovely. my life, completely changed my life. Mine too. Without a doubt. Mine too. Yeah. Um, you know, the recording that I did mm. with our lovely Alan, um, you know, 10 years. Where did I've been here 10 uh, years? Yeah. And it has been really become part of all of our lives, yeah. really, hasn't it? And, and how yeah. wonderful that we can say that about what is mm. basically a channel. Mm. You know, it's become integral to it us really all. Has, um, yeah. Okay, well done on the verge of selling out. Let's now bring you. What? Yeah. It's just, I just wish that we could please everybody all of the time. Yeah, yeah. But we're never going to be able to do that. No. But as much never as we mind. try. We try. As we much try as very we try. Hard. Yes. Yeah. We can. Yeah. And it's you know sometimes it is it's it's mm. it's hard, it's sad that we mm. can't do that. But mm. we will always yeah. do our very 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 best, of course. Absolutely. Absolutely. Um, yeah. And every everybody. I don't know a single person as part of the jewelry maker family that hasn't got the same passion, that no, shared no, passion. Absolutely not. Yeah. Um, hello, Davinia. Saying happy birthday, oh. JM. Keep on being yeah. you. Isn't here, that here. lovely? Here, here. Isn't that Bless lovely? You. Yeah. It's a very unique, very special channel. Very special. Um, shall we take it to a brand new clearance price? Now, I'm seeing the micro size. Mm -hmm. How about these with your, with your uh, eagle eye? Right. Yes. Oh, that's a nice idea. That's a nice idea. Yes, yep. Yeah. A little, little <laughs> Ross says... happy here's... birthday to us from us. I love that. Yeah. I love that. Happy with that. That would be lovely, wouldn't it? In your kiss glass. <gasps> £1.49. Really? Mm. Not very often we see that price. No, it? no. I mean, does that oh. even cover cover things like the liter of petrol? Yeah. <laughs> do you know? Oh, do you remember? Do you remember when when diesel was cheaper than petrol? Mm. It's the other way around. You're diesel, now. are you? I'm a diesel. You're a diesel yeah, right? I'm diesel. Yeah. Yeah. Now I can remember when it was like 80p. Mm. 80p a liter. Those days are well and truly gone, aren't they? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, well, one pounds and forty nine pence. But one you can, one thing you can guarantee on is the best possible prices from us here at Jewelry Absolutely. Maker. Yeah. Um, again, we can't physically even source it for what's on your screens. I think that That's goes beautiful. without saying. Keep these lovely messages coming through. Again, over to you. This is from Leah in Berkshire. Happy birthday! Happy official birthday! Yes. Oh, I'm forgetting it's our official birthday today, at Jewelry Maker. Thank you. Love Thank you, that. Leah. Love Thank that. You. Love that. And you know what? We'll we'll sort of. We'll, we'll come down from the birthday celebrations. Not today. It, it does extend right the way yeah. up until um, the weekend. Well, past mm. the weekend. Mm. Um, and then we'll get excited about the Jubilee. You and me on Friday yes. next week. The Jubilee is going to be an amazing, yeah. amazing show. And what's even better than... Is it better than the Jubilee? Yes. No, it was not better than the Jubilee, but Saturday the 14th of May, Eurovision. That's where the excitement I've got to be honest, starts. I'm not I'm into Eurovision. Eurovision. Andrew watches for about half an hour and then gets bored and potters and goes in the garden. Yeah. I love Eurovision. Do you? Yeah. I'd like to get behind it, mm. but I have I to say... I think we're going to do quite well this year. Who I've got we a got really good year? song. Ben Ware, I think his name is. It's a really good song. If you YouTube it. Is he actually really good, good, though? Because really sometimes I think we're like yeah, the comedians no, of it the all. The song's really good as well. Is it? Yeah. Well, have a little look at that yeah. then. Top four, they reckon, for us, Ooh! Fingers crossed. Yes, yeah. Um, <clears throat> fingers crossed. Peach. Look at this. We've described it as peach, but let's be honest, this is much more orange. Mm, it's lovely, isn't it? Now, we're going to show you the first price crash, uh, and I'm going to tell you that's not what you're paying. It's lower than what you should okay. be paying, actual fact, from the very get-go. But um, not your birthday celebration price tag. Wow. Oh. That's... that's oh, look. Natural moonstone. I prefer moonstone mm. with colour. It? Yeah, I think it actually highlights the beautiful magic that you find within. Uh, hello, Fran. Happy birthday, jewellery maker, and happy fourth to Mark. Happy fourth to What's, you, Fran. How'd you, how'd you do it? No, that's Star Trek. Oh, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> All these emojis. I don't know. You could send emojis to the studio. I like the ice creams at yeah. the end there. I never know what they mean. 
Uh, no, I don't either. I know what a, f a select few mean. There's that's... one that I've just discovered. There's there's a, a face with jazz hands. Yeah. And that's a hug. Is it? That's a, sending I didn't someone know that. a hug. Look, I would read that as someone being excited. Yeah, it's that sending a hug. Oh, okay. Oh, some more. This I'm not great with emojis this either. Graham and Donna in West Midlands. Happy birthday, JM. Thank Mwah. you. Happy birthday Bless to you. you. Bless you. Straight to the point. Yeah. Hang on a minute. That looks like a cake, a burrito, a <laughs> star burrito, is it? <laughs> Start a burrito. It could be a birthday burrito. What is it though? Will anyone send us an aubergine? <laughs> Apparently that's rude, isn't it? It is rude, yes. Yeah, I didn't know that. It is it is a bit rude. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. Yes. If you don't know what the aubergine means, um, that, well, you're, you're beautifully and perfectly innocent. <laughs> if you do, then, like myself, you're a bit naughty. You're a bit naughty. <laughs> um, you watch now. We're going to have we'll loads get, of well, we'll lots of coming over. in. Uh, £3.49 pence for Natural Peach Moonstone. Josephine, Manchester, hello to you. Fife, Karen, Gabrielle, Pauline, Brenda, wow. Lisa, Patricia, Helen, Denise, Livy, well done to you. How many did I have then, Ross? Almost 100, but there are so many of you there. We don't often see this kind of orange colour. No, never. And it's no. natural. It's it is yeah. natural. Favourite emojis. What's everybody's favourite emoji? I want to see your favourite emoji. Yes, Ross. Are you going to text it in? Oh, you can't. There's text one it. of a yellow face, and the bottom half is green. I think they're feeling poorly. Or oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Being sick. Mm, yeah. That's, That's what that one, one is. Yeah. That is quite funny. What um, I do this, I do this emoji quite a lot. You know the one rolling his eyes. Oh yeah. I do. Yeah. <laughs> 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 I do. I do do the rolling yeah. eyes emoji quite a lot. Yeah. <laughs> it's not always said in in a negative way. No, you know, no. as if it's like, oh, silly you that kind of way. Um, what's your favourite emoji, Callan? Have you got a favourite emoji? Me, sorry. Have you got a favourite emoji? Um, no. No. Sorry. No. Love heart. You can't beat the love no, heart. No, no, Little, little kissy wow. emoji. Um, okay, let's move on to Una Kite. Go on, name the artist. We say it every time. I see Monet. Yeah, um, no, I see Monet. So you're into your art, aren't you? Yeah, I quite like my art. What did yeah. you think about that board thing with Debbie the other day? Amazing. Perfect. Yeah. I hope you got one for I your cross It's really, really good, isn't it? Yeah. With the light board. Yeah. yeah. Underneath. Yeah. Because you could it's do like a you could do like a portrait. Because if you had if you had it underneath when you're with your frame above, you can see all the holes. You see? Yeah. So it's easier to do your threading. I thought of you that when that was on it. I know, absolutely amazing. Yeah. Adore Unikite. Yeah, it's yeah. completely and utterly natural. And and I'm going to say it. I always do. I think it's an undervalued gemstone. You poo. Um, <laughs> I've got a kit on Friday, sexy 68. Sexy si <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Our Alice, honestly. <laughs> she, 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 she comes the innocent, doesn't she? Yeah, it's like yeah. I actually, I said to her the other day, I say, Alice, Alice, what was with the kit called Love Nuggets? <laughs> and she kind of looked at me and just, and she, she went, oh, I didn't even think about that. And I was like, mm. that tells me she yeah. totally yeah, does. Totally. You, sexy 68? Sexy 68. What does it's that? It's a hematite kit. Okay, why 68? So, that's, that, so it's X, it's S-E-X-C 68 is the code of the kit. Oh, I actually thought you meant the kit was called Oh, no, that. no, oh, no, 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 the code. <coughs> oh, I see what you mean. Yeah. I see what you mean. Wasn't there a DVD that was that something there close was to something, that? Something like that. I just we, saw that one on there now, You Poo 9. We need to get out more, the you fact do. that we know, know the codes. Hobnob. Of, hobnob. <laughs> yeah, um, I'm sure there was one. What, one of your DVDs, I think, was that. Mm. Seem to remember yes, it yeah. back in the day. Make sure you check out your baskets, everybody. Wonderful four mil rounds. Um, Iolite. Oh. We had a strand of this the other day, didn't we? We the, did. Um, what and it was flew. the shape? I can't remember what the shape was. Rondels. Rondels, yeah. yeah. Now, yes, yeah. everybody, how often do we see Iolite? I know we had it the other day, but that's, that's got to be really probably good. one of a handful of times that we've actually had it this year. And I can only speak for myself, obviously. I don't know what Carol um, has actually brought to air. Um, but we don't often see it. It's totally and utterly natural. It is that really beautiful indigo blue. It's beautiful. It's like a petrol steely blue, isn't it? It is. I think with the we should have a topaz for this colour. 
Oh, yeah. I think it would fit in the family quite well, wouldn't it? Yeah, because it's not mm. quite as dark as no. what you'd see in London blue. No. Um, it's wow. much more... Yeah, well, the pleochroism gives you mm. um, such a performance from behind. Yes, it's blue, but you actually get your pinks and your mauves and your purples and everything within. Six ninety nine only. Uh, we're not even stopping oh. there, says Ross. Um, it's a beautiful 32 stroke, 34 inch strand, 100 carats of natural, beautiful gemstones. We're at four pounds tonight. Oh. oh, that's my trouser measurements. <laughs> Just saying. You're a nice slim, slim chap. Mm. 34 to 30, uh, 32 to 32 34. 32 waist, 34 inside leg. <laughs> what do you, oh, you're the other way round, says Adam. <laughs> that's not 34 is very narrow. I think, my, I think Tom's 34. Mm, I 30, think. Yeah, 32, my waist. I, I mean, I wouldn't even know. Well. I don't want to know. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't. Yeah, po post yeah. kids, I've stopped. I'd step away from the tape measure. I don't want to know. I don't want to know. But yes, well, you're, you're beautiful and trim and very, uh, and very fit, aren't you? Do well, lots of lovely walk. Well, you do are. walking, yeah. Yeah, you do lots of walking yeah. to keep you healthy. Who's a 26 inch waist? Who is? Nobody. Oh, 30. Still minuscule. I don't think my thigh is 30 inch. <laughs> <laughs> Never been as low as what you're about to see. Ah, meh. One pound and 99 oh. pence only for beautiful Iolite. In terms of, a, 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 oh, I'm thinking Katie Parker. Mm. That crochet, no, crochet design. That'd look amazing, wouldn't it? Would be lovely. So much that you can do with your nuggets. Of course, you were really the, you know, you mm. were the face. I love them. I love the them. The face of nuggets. You've, really got, you've got your Kumahimo, you've got your Rosary Linking, your Tree of Life, um, mm -hmm. Crochet, as you said. Crochet, yeah. lovely. Yeah. Um, um, I think Alison did some uh, nugget embroidery as well. Oh. Was it embroidery? Wow. Kind of like into, into yeah. like a beading foundation. I'm just wondering whether you could use chips on the loom. Maybe that'd be something you could Ooh. try. I, can't, I shouldn't see why not. No. It's going to create texture, isn't yeah. it? You probably have to look for similar sizes yeah. on your strand. but um, And, and some amazing. of the cord or threading material will be exposed, mm. but that mm. can be part of yeah, the design, absolutely. can't it? Yeah, yeah. So many of you there and people really stocking up on this. Very good morning and happy birthday, jewellery makers. There's going to be cake. Wow. It's going to be, do you know when, you, when, when, when the birthday actually <laughs> lands on your shift, how much, how happy you are, because mm. you know you're going to get a slice get of cake. cake. Um, and our cakes are normally pretty amazing. Anthony and Kay, Jane, Mary, hello to you, Mansa, Caroline, Kay, Beverly, Ella. Don't forget, coming up, you have your amazing turntables, which are fantastic. We've got them in the two different colours. They've never been brought to air before. Not long to wait for these. Um, just so you know, we've got 200 of each of the colours, and that has actually got, a protective layer i'll take it off during the actual auction um let you plug it into your laptop and away you go um or you can use your plug sockets as well um so we're going to do what oh, the meter long so chains how are these still available 11 of each okay we'll start with the amethyst you were with me when we I was. these and we had those um ceramic didn't we the ceramic chain well there's 11 11 11 of them left and we were discussing mark the fact that yes we know lots of our lovely viewers can do rosary mm. linking however is it even is it is, is it worthwhile I think, no I, I, work, I think we worked out it's about three three and a half hours isn't it to rosary link a meter I'm sure we worked that out. That's a lot of time. That's a lot of time. And then you've got yeah. to consider you've got to buy the actual the wire. wire you've got to buy yeah. the gemstones as well. Um, these absolutely flew out the door. Yes, you're right. We had them mm, in the uh, right. ceramic. and We had them yeah. in a couple of other gemstones. So these are last in stock opportunities. Straight away, London snaps up um, two of these. For your spectacle glasses. Perfect. for yeah. little Little tennis style bracelets. Lovely, There's just so Chandelier much. Chandelier earrings. Oh, yeah. Do you remember a couple of weeks ago on the show, I had the um, the drop, the chandeliers for earrings and pendant yes. necklaces? Yes, you gave me a pair of those. That's right. You and could, I was you could, wearing um, them. You could use those, this sort of thing for those. Well, look That's at that. lovely. They're gorgeous, aren't they? On the verge mm. of selling out, so I'll leave that with you. Let's bring you the white topaz. Oh, I'm trying to find the end. Let's find the end. It? Not long to wait for the turntable, says Ross. Can I find what the What sort end? of price are they going to? Um, I'm going to show you. Are they good? Yeah, really good. I've got a price in my head. Let's have a look. Yeah. Surprise. I know. Miles off. Amazing, <laughs> isn't 
Amazing. Oh, no. um, oh, I can't find the end, but anyway, here we go. Um, silver plated, beautiful faceted topaz with all that lovely brilliance. Again, you know, be inspired by the likes of Elsa Peretti. Mm, she does designs yeah. like this. You can layer it up. Um, as Mark said, perfect for chandelier earrings, opera length. So somebody has done this by hand, yeah. haven't they? This yeah. wouldn't have been machine, I wouldn't imagine. No, I don't think so. I wouldn't know how it would thread the beads. Yeah. For one. I don't think so. Uh, You've got that wonderful uniformity. You, we we mm. spoke briefly this morning about the Met Gala. Favourite favorite ensemble? Kim Kardashian. Now, I'm not, I'm not a fan of the Kardashians. I just don't understand why they are who they are and what they are. Mm -hmm. But I have to say... It, that her entrance was stunning. It yeah. was incredible. Wearing Marilyn's dress. Yeah, amazing. She did look amazing. Yeah. I, I think she was yeah. upstaged by her sister, though. You think so? In terms of outfits, mm. yes. Right. Um, but, yeah, I mean, the whole history of the Marilyn Monroe dress. Most expensive dress ever bought at auction. Eight million dollars it went Eight for. Eight million. Yeah. Can you imagine the insurance yeah. on that dress? Yeah. Um, have I got what? Jump ring, jump ring, jump ring box. Jump ring box. I don't see a jump ring box. No. Oh, Dan's on it. Dan's on it. I tell you what, we'll do a little bundle of um, three of your big five, shall we? So Ruby, Sapphire, and Tanzanite. Oh, oh, Not three, oh. four, I beg your pardon. Here we go. Oh, look at these. I mean, I know that we've got slider bracelets within your birthday box. Have we? Oh, should I not have said that? <laughs> should I not have said that? But this would be perfect yeah. to go on your um, slider bracelets, or you might have them within your stash. That's genuine tanzanite. That's genuine uh, emerald, genuine ruby, and genuine oh, sapphire. This. Thirty chances. That emerald glowing. Look at it's it. It's gorgeous, isn't it? Wow. And mate, you'd pay that per strand, yeah, wouldn't you? Absolutely. In fact, go back a few years ago. Probably, I don't know, five, six years ago. Maybe definitely when we were under the um, yeah. immediate partnership, they would have been yeah, that per, yeah. per strand. Um, certainly not £10 per strand, certainly not, absolutely categorically not, £5 per strand. How, How many do we have? <laughs> 30. Ah, oh, this is ridiculous. There's a minute on your screens. We're at £5 per £5 for Tanzanite, £5 for Ruby, £5 for sapphire and emerald and we are going even lower no brainer it's an absolute no brainer we'll try and bring some um you know as many of the messages as we can do you want to retake oh, this one this is from yaneth in surrey dear jm i found you nine years ago and you have not left my living room since then oh. happy 12 and that's from yaneth oh Bless you. thank you isn't that lovely that mm. we've been friends for for, for this length mm. of time with all of these wonderful wonderful mm. viewers and truly we do uh you know it, we love to be with you we really do um hello graham and donna um we have these and they're stunning studio doesn't do them justice thank yeah, you graham and donna nice. you're right you're yeah. absolutely right well just single one of those strands out whichever you choose at £20, that's, that would be amazing. But you're not yeah. just getting the one. You are guaranteed to get all four. Um, we've got 18 of these available. Rapidly, rapidly approaching half the stock. Ross, he's been rogue all week, you know. Ooh. You know what we've got in the 9 o'clock hour on Friday next week? I've seen them on the show once before, and I was quite envious because I didn't have them. Ready-made macrame slider bracelets. Oh, yes. We've got them on Friday, Do you 9 know, there's a story to that, you know. Is there? So I, I pitched... I'm going to say it. Yeah. I pitched to Caroline about three years ago, before I had Tiggy, um, to get those, because they're mon very yeah. Monica Veneda, yeah, aren't amazing. they? Yeah, they're um, Anyway, it didn't happen, and, of course, COVID hit and everything, so... Um, and, and literally, I found that we had them whilst watching the show at home. I was like... Oh. <gasps> well, we've got them next Friday. Yes. Yes, they always they're fly. They're amazing. They're so well made. Absolutely. And again, we know yeah. that people can yeah. do macrame, yeah, yeah. but Why? it's so cost effective. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Um, this is on the verge of selling out. Deborah, Merseyside, Pauline, Cheryl, Anthony right. and Kay, Karen, Debbie, Car uh, Carol, Fife, Brenda, Carol and Marilyn. Oh, Marilyn's Marilyn, on the phone. Um, oh, well, no, you've got yours, Marilyn, on the app, rather. Judith, Sandra, Leah, Gillian, Somerset, Karen, Suja, Suja sorry, uh, Lynn, Jackie, Belinda, Joanne. You need to check out your baskets. And Jean, we have the final couple of these. Guess what? Oh, it's sold well out. Done. Well, done. Well, done. well done. Well done. Well done. Well done. Well done.
Um, I have the jump ring box. Was that our lovely Wayne? Scott, Scott. hello, Scott. It's our, it's our leader, our leader. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Um, it's our leader, Scott, manager director, Scott. I knew I was, I knew you were going to step into the gallery today. It's such a special day though, isn't it? Oh. Um, is some messages, <laughs> do you want to take this one? This is from Louise. Happy birthday, I've been with you from the very beginning. So it's my Jay and birthday too. Cake for breakfast, I think. Definitely, I mean, it's, a no, it's all of our birthday. Oh. Yeah, it's not just, not just the everyone here in the studio. That's absolutely mm. extended to our absolutely. wonderful viewers. So it's a yeah. must that you have cake. An absolute must. There is cake, isn't there? I hope so, because otherwise, if not, I'm off. <laughs> I'm off. No, only joking. Um, okay, all your beautiful multicolours of your open oh, jump please. rings. Look at those. Yeah, I mean, again, it's a, it comes within the storage container as well. If you do things like chain mail, um, then they're going to be perfect. But you'd yeah, have to perfect. buy the reels of, uh, yeah. of wire, which is going to be far more than £22.99 if you consider all those different colours. But they're not just for the chain mailers. I would incorporate them with seed beading at Christmas for your baubles. Oh, There's lots of bauble designs that use jump rings to attach tassels and, and panels and things too. So I would I'd grab these ready for Christmas prep. Love that. I, I bet in your workstation as well it is really organised and you've got mm. somewhere for Christmas. Mm -hmm. I admire how organised you are. Mm. I wish I was... We haven't got children. I mean, we've I can got, use we've that. We've got time to organise. I can use that excuse <laughs> a little bit, not all the time. Hello, oh. Mary, saying happy 12th birthday, jewellery maker. I was on maternity oh. leave 12 years ago, and I've been a constant jewellery maker since. My gemstone stash is huge, mm. thanks to you. That's wonderful. That's wonderful. Nice. What a lovely story that is. Imagine the, well, it would be hundreds and hundreds of thousands of pounds of stashes out there in the world. Oh, yeah. Amazing. Yeah, amazing. Yeah. Absolutely amazing. Um, and also, by the way, news about your nationwide birthday oh, bash. Oh, yes, in the next hour. In the next hour. So make sure you stay tuned yeah. for that. £14.99 uh, to get hold of these. Again, comes within the actual container. You are getting a um, hundred. Um, so a hundred of your yellow, orange, red, I've read this completely wrong, sorry, start at the beginning, Al. Red, orange, yellow, green, blue, purple, pink, um, and the internal diameter on these is seven mil, seven Brilliant. mil. We are about to step into <laughs> the actual birthday banger. I will never tire of saying that. <laughs> um, this is exciting. We've never done anything like this before. You know what's wonderful? And we've just heard 12 years there, nine years, you know, our wonderful mm. viewers, which, who are so incredibly loyal. We've also been on that journey and seen, you know, how your talents develop and the fact that we hear the stories of so many of you then going on, not just to, to gift your makes, but to even sell mm. your makes and turn it into a profitable business. Can you imagine being able to photograph or upload even to your Facebook page, your creations, as our amazing directors do, literally with a moving image. Well, that opportunity is about to become a reality. There are 200 of each though, so be quick. Your birthday bang is next. Here it is. It will arrive on your doorstep within the box. That helps. That's which handy. absolutely helps. Yeah, yeah. Do you know what I love? It's, you know, when technology and me don't mix. I'm, I, yeah, I am a bit of a technophobe. Yeah. Um, this has got three buttons, basically. Oh, I could cope with that. I can cope with yeah. that. One's on. One, uh, one says ref, uh, left or right. And the other one basically does an oscillation. Ah. Uh. Oh, Which is re that's really cool. Uh, Adam's like, oh, we so it's like a boomerang then. So it's like a boomerang. Uh, yes, like exactly. Boomerang. So yeah. it kind of goes in one direction and it goes yeah. in the other direction. Well, the fact that I've just heard our senior director say, we need one of those then, because ours doesn't no. do that. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, it literally goes in two yeah. different directions. Um, well, we can get one if we if if we don't sell out of them, of course. Now, within the box itself, I should show you, it comes with your cable, um, your USB, so that can either plug into your computer, your PC, or your laptop, or you can actually get the sockets mm. as well. You yeah, said you've got them fitted in, kitchen, yeah. in your kitchen yeah. now. Um, so literally, really, really straightforward. Now, as I said, on the top here, it'll have a protective layer. 
which I can, I've got the worst nails for taking these off, but I will take it off because, oh wow, ready for this? Something super satisfying. I'm gonna let you enjoy the moment as well. <laughs> ready? Look, oh look. Now imagine your makes. Imagine, can I borrow one of your makes, Mark? What are you going to put on? Um, a bracelet or a ring, maybe? Yeah, let's do one. that. Let's put that beautiful bracelet. Here we go. Now, imagine taking the photograph and... Here we go. Seeing it just like this. So, hang on. Is this the one you... There we go. There we go. Putting that on your Facebook page. Mm. You can see all the way around. One of our talented viewers, um, a, a chap called Sean, Sean Kerr. I know, he, yeah. Yeah, he, he always uses a revolving table and he's popping his jewellery on his Facebook page. It looks incredible. It really just transforms it. It's showing it, every it? single part, yeah, isn't it? That's amazing. You can do yeah. um, big displays yeah. as well. They yeah. will actually uh, so, so support your busts mm. and things like yeah. that. If you're yeah. doing things like um, craft events, your artisanal markets, your school fates, anything like that, just to have something which is actually rotating and moving really does sort of elevate the luxury of your designs. Um, you know, it gets those gemstones. If you've got pleochroism, yeah. you're going to see that ricocheting from the gem. You can see, um, you know, the full full complete piece of jewelry um, now we are starting with the white and then we're going to step into the black and um, in speaking to Adam and Adam really is far more knowledgeable um, about the turntables than, than than any of us here in the studio because Adam you use them on a daily basis so you know if you're taking recordings of say opal or, or loose stones or um, finished designs from our guest designers then chances are 99% of the time it is going to be on one of these turntables we've mm. never done them before they haven't been on pre-order uh, and I'll tell you exactly why they would sold out completely they would sell out. Yeah, now yeah, yeah. we wanted to make it absolutely fair now if you put them in your basket all I can say is you will need to check them out because we have literally 200 of each. Now, you've seen what this is going to, Mark. Amazing. Yeah, I was, it was half of what I thought. Really? Because mm. it's, well, it's a professional Where, where would kit. you buy one from? True. Where would you see them? True. True. It's a professional oh. bit of kit. You know, if you walk along sort of Hatton Garden or, or, or Bond Street, you're going to see this kind of uh, um, display within the sort of usually velvet lined um, windows, etc. The graphics are about to appear on your screens. This is the white mirror uh, videography turntable. You can put, do you want to see it in oscillation as well? How <laughs> does yours work without a lead? So you charge it, right? Here we go, it's got all the instructions, so power on, touch any key. Uh, R, R stroke L, I don't know, you can read this along with me if you want. Uh, R stroke L, uh, switch to clockwise or counterclockwise, there we go. Speed regulation, so you can actually speed uh. it up to two rotations, four rotations or six rotations per minute. Um, ASA is angle regulation, so you can even what? Is that where it literally oscillates back and forth? Yeah, yeah. Um, 45 wow. degrees, 90 degrees, so it's literally going back and forth, power on, power off, um, long press, any key for three seconds. So as you can see, it's also lithium battery, so it takes three AAA batteries, they're not included, but you also do get your charger, your LED charger as well. Um, so amazing. Yeah. Yeah. <coughs> Good question there, Judith. Now, Whilst <coughs> I'm doing, whilst the, the graphics are on your screen for the white, let me also show you the black. Here we go. Uh, there's something super yeah. satisfying about this, <laughs> and I will show you the buttons as well. Ta -da. Shall I turn it on? So this will be brought to you. They will be brought to you. Have we charged this one? Um, literally simultaneously as well. Have we charged? There we go. There we go. I'm going to turn it around so you can actually see how it gets turned on and off. Gosh, look at the call screens. There are so many of you there. They do come with the leads, like as we just said, so you can actually, the USB, you can actually charge that. 
Um, would you like me to measure it? Yes, no problem. Because um, I have a little ruler just here. It's going to be, let's have a little look, five and a half inches diameter. Should I put that on there? Yeah. That one's oscillating. So you can actually see it literally going backwards. 45 degrees, mm. that one is. That's the black that's coming up in a few moments' time. Right now, the graphics on your screens are the white. They are both going to the same price. Um, comes completely boxed. I mean, how professional. How professional um, do these look? I mean, that's amazing, isn't it? Again, it creates, especially if you have it as a business, you know, um, if I was looking, flicking through maybe social media or something like the marketplace, and I saw a piece of jewellery literally in movement, mm. straight away it's going to grab my attention. Well, especially with gemstones, that you think, um, especially for something faceted, you want to be able to see that sparkle, and this yeah. is the perfect opportunity. Isn't if it? you have one of those box, uh, the mm. lighting oh, boxes yeah, yeah, as well, better. That's what Adam does yeah. on, on a, you know, every morning. He literally takes these recordings within a lighting box. Mm. If you don't have that, then just make sure you have a plain background behind. Um, now, we were all completely shocked by this birthday mm. banger saving. Yeah. How, I mean, they are flying out the door at £44.99. Half the stock, in actual fact, has almost gone. That's not your birthday banger deal. In fact, it's no way near. No way near. Oh my word! Not your birthday that's, banger that's deal. That's the price that, that, I would, that I would pay for that any mm -hmm. day of the week. Yeah. And then you were you were flabbergasted mm. by mm. the fact that yeah. we took it even lower, yeah. and not just by a little bit. It's yeah. going significantly lower. All of your loose stones, all of your. I mean, you could do oh, so imagine. much. It'd be lovely, wouldn't it? Loose have stones. your chakra stones all oh. laid out in your, on your windowsill yes. and have them re revolving. I think that'd be amazing. And, and I guess, you know, uh, when, when I had my jewellery business, actually, things been handled regularly. Mm. Unfortunately, you know, it, it, they make, it makes them dirty. It might well damage yeah. them as well. Yeah. This is actually potentially adding longevity to your pieces as well because they don't have to handle no. them. They can Absolutely. actually see right. them in full view. Not... Your price tag, though, there was 200 of these available. I can literally see double rows of names already. The black one is coming up immediately afterwards. And it's just personal preference. Um, Adam showed you a few moments ago the difference between the colorings. Well, I'm going to say this. You'll probably get both. Mm, you probably absolutely. will get both. Um, £19 <laughs> and 99 pence. Happy birthday, jewellery makers. Adam, can we show wow. that again? Because Adam's taken a, a, a photograph um, of literally what looks like a, um, an, a... Well, it is... Is it a Colombian emerald or...? Panchia, mm. um, a Panchia emerald, and you can literally see the difference. It showcases different qualities. With the with the white, you can really see um, sort of the internal beautiful Le Jardin um, and the quality of the faceting as well. And then against the black, it shows you that wonderful luminosity. So. Di it, it, it's down to what you're looking mm. for um, and what kind of appearance you're you're wanting to reveal to your clientele um, or your friends and family. £19.99. There was 200 of these available. It's not just loose, loose stones. Finished jewellery, strands. Do you know the best thing, though? <laughs> Was that ever the birthday banger price? No, that's not the price on your little piece of paper. No, I'm no. getting good at pulling people's leg, aren't I? Mm. <laughs> never, no, that was never your birthday banger deal. No. Did I just hear Scott being quite, quite surprised? Oh, it's sexy boy Liam. Hiya, Liam. That, that's not what he called you when you went into the gallery. Uh, that, by the way, Lee... Piglet? Yeah. You call him Piglet? Oh, it's a term of endearment. No. And by the way, that was Liam calling Liam. himself sexy boy, by the way. Mm. Although, yes, Liam, you are. You are. Um, coming in for a bit of the jewellery maker birthday action, Liam. Can you believe these? 19.99. that's not the birthday banger deal. Crazy, he says. Crazy. We're not just talking about a couple of pounds off either, are we, Mark? No, no, no. This is why I said no, I no. think people will get both. Mm -hmm. I think so as well. Well, didn't we start at £30? Yeah. No, £45. Then it went to £30, didn't it? Mm. So you could, yes, yeah, so, yeah. 
did have change uh, from the initial yeah, price. Absolutely. Happy birthday, jewelry That's makers! Amazing. Never been done before. It's it's unbelievable. Mm. We don't even our our videography turntable doesn't even do no, what this does. No, no. Adam, I love that. you know you were saying you want one for um, for production. I don't think there's going to be left. I don't because yours doesn't do this, does it? Doesn't do no. the oscillation. You have to do it manually. Do you literally? Oh, no. <laughs> That's funny. I can just imagine someone there like this. Pink, 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 <laughs> pink, pink. Behind the actual screen, seeing if they can get it to oscillate. Yours will do it. Literally, it's powered. Um, you've got the USB cable, and it also takes your AAA batteries. But there are so many. Look at the core screens. Mm. Uh, take a little look at how many of you there. Lots of multi-buyers on this as well. Elvira, Cheryl, Jeanette, Alison, Doreen. Jan, Sharon, Marcia. Uh, so one of each, please, says Joe. Yeah, Absolutely. lots of people are doing that, yeah. Joe. I would do that as well. Because yeah, completely. completely. Pearls, I would always go for a white background. Mm. Mm. And then... And then... What, what would you put on a black? Opal. Oh, yes. Opal on a black Labradorite background. would be nice. On Labradorite. Yeah. Um, be yeah. great on your craft mm. stall, says Absolutely. Julian warmly. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah. Absolutely. Because it's going to straight, straight away mm. spark interest. You look, it, it's raising your, you know, your profile as well with the fact that you have such technology. Wow. <laughs> um, and I'm rubbish at technology, so it's basically three buttons. Um, I totally agree. Four pounds and ninety, oh, sorry, fourteen pounds and ninety-nine pence, all under your one amazing postage and packaging as well. Comes boxed, perfectly boxed. That's amazing. What about people that do mm. other crafts? I'm just trying to think. Well, I mean, still, we're talking about crafts, uh, about card making, weren't we? Just have a really amazing card sat on one of these tables, because you you have the, you have the, um, the the matte and layering on the front of your card, and then you have inserts inside, and yeah. then you might have um, something on the back as well. So yeah. just to be able to do your Perfect. returning and advertising, I don't Perfect. think it's great for advertising. Totally, yeah. totally, totally agree. You know, if you've got, a, well, any kind mm. of retail business, really, yeah, yeah. Um, it's going to look amazing actually elevating and, mm. and just showing it off straight I would away. put just a, you know, you can, you can get um, battery-operated fairy lights. Yes. Just get some out of, a, out of a box, jumble them all up and just plonk them in the centre. And you get all the reflections coming off and that look amazing. Now, in Mark, you make, a, yeah. you make a really beautiful Christmas Day table mm. as well, don't you? That'd be amazing, wouldn't it? Can you imagine that? All mm. the lights literally yeah. dancing oh, around. Lovely, wouldn't it? The final 42 of these, we will be bringing you the black in a few moments' time. Keep on mm. dialing through and make sure you check out your baskets. Jennifer, I can see you there. Susan, I can see you there. New York, Aviola, hello to you. Anne, uh, Andrea, Denise, Beverly, hello to you. Alison, Carolyn, uh, Millie B. Sharon, hello to you, Marcia, Janet, Lorna, Penny, I can't, I, there's literally so many names there. So many names. We've never done anything like this before. Mm. Um, hello, Angela, saying Etsy oh. has a function to allow videos. Yes, that's right. Yes. Yes. I will turntable every piece of jewellery. And I just oh, think straight luck. away you're going to jump out, mm. aren't you? Absolutely. Yeah, I think this is what Sean does. We were mentioning him, Sean, yeah. earlier. That's what he turns Who's an amazing jewellery maker amazing. as well, isn't he? Yeah. Yeah. Um, sorry, what was that one? I think I missed that last message. Um, yeah, showcase mm. your pieces. Hello, Janet. Happy birthday to everybody at Jewelry Maker. Oh. Thank you for keeping me company, sending everyone their big hugs. And that's Janet in County Bless Down. You. Bless you, Janet. There we go. Let's do it. It's that emoji, isn't it? That emoji, yeah. That emoji. Virtual cuddles all <laughs> round, all round. Final 18 of these available. Um, so make sure you do check them out. I'm going to wrap this one up because we want to then bring you the black. And of course, we've got Mark's amazing kits um, coming up uh, in the next hour. Now, you know where it's going to. You also know the quantity. There's two. There's 200 of them available. And I think like many, you would, wouldn't you? You'd be treating yourself oh, to the black oh, and the white. Amazing, isn't it? It is, it, you know, different gemstones, mm. different styles, different are they heavy? threads. As a, as a piece of kit, are they heavy? Not at all. Not at all. Oh, my word. Really lightweight. That surprises me. Really lightweight. I don't know. I can't... I... That's amazing. Less than no, half is, a bag of sugar? Yeah, oh, yeah, at least, yeah. Okay. That's really good. Like a... Less than a jar of coffee. Mm. Box yeah, yeah. of tea bags, Box let's tea say bags. that. Yeah, yeah. It's super ultra yeah. lightweight, yeah. isn't it? That's really surprising. I'm not great on weights. 
so I have to use some household items <laughs> as a reference. The final 15, uh, 15 seconds before the graphics actually appear, we had 200 of the white. How, how many have we got, literally, single figures? Single figure quantities left of the white. We've got 200 of the black as well. Um, yeah, literally charges into either your PC, your laptop, yeah, absolutely. Um, or if you, if you're posh mm. like Mark and you've you've actually put <laughs> your. I think I think most I think by law now new build houses have to have. Do so they plug, have to have sockets with USBs in? Yeah. I guess they're probably safer. Mm, yeah. I love USBs. USBs, because oh, let's be honest, it's the way the world's going. I have isn't no it? idea what it means, what it Not stands me. for. Yes, what does USB stand for? Mm. Um, anyone got Google handy? Uh, I bet you Adam would know. Adam, Adam will know. Adam will know. Adam, what does USB stand for? Adam, what does USB stand for? Well, I think it is universal something, isn't it? Universal something. Yeah. Okay. Universal something. something. <laughs> <laughs> um, just, I don't know. Just, just universal serial bus. What? There we go then. Did you know that, Alex? No idea. No, not me. There we go. Every day's a school day, as they say. Not 44 99 and literally already we're on three yeah, rows of yeah. names. Half the stock has gone. We're into double mm. figure quantities. Birmingham, Cardiff, hello to Derbyshire, Belinda, Vanya, Sharon, Manchester, Tracy. Um, I'm thinking about uh, lovely Alison's John. He does mm, model he does, making, he doesn't does. he? Yeah, yeah. Now, if you do That'll painting or pottery. Mm -hmm. Lovely Gemma Crow did some pottery, she didn't did, she? I saw that. Fella. Yeah. Did anybody else have the ghost song ringing through <laughs> their mind? Oh, my love. Um, yeah, her and her yeah. fella doing a bit of pottery. How romantic. These are absolutely flying out the door as well. Again, mm. you wouldn't think it would make that much difference, actually, having sort of the plinth, if you like, for, mm. in a different colour, but it really does. Mm. Well, um, as you know, we, we had native lighting on our show on Sunday. <gasps> And um, as, a, as a company, they sell two-thirds black, one-third white of their products. Do so, they? So black is, is, is more popular for some. I don't know the reason, but, um, yeah. Um, apparently. To find. Yeah. See, I would have gone, mm. I would have gravitated towards the white. Mm. Mm. I don't know, but be, I think Universal mm. Serial Bus. I have no idea. I had no, no idea about that. All. No idea about that. Sit, why a bus? Yeah. There we are. Serial bus. There we are. No idea. I can Strange. remember, but I can also remember the days. I'm going to make myself look really stupid now, but I remember the days when the web was really quite new, and I didn't know what www meant. No, I didn't at the beginning. <laughs> yeah. Genuinely, I remember those days when the web when you used to have that dialing yeah. tone. Somebody told me it was wibbly wobbly web, and I believed them for ages. <laughs> For ages. I prefer Silly. that. The wibbly wobbly Can web. Can we call it the wibbly wobbly <laughs> web? Um, wow. What was the internet called before the internet? Oh, yeah, I remember Ooh, that. Ooh, the yes. information super highway. Yeah, I remember, I remember that, yes. Maybe that's where bus comes from. Could be. Maybe. £14.99. Look at these, all these fun facts. Can you remember when you yeah, used to go onto the computer, you know, when I was living at home with my mum and dad, and they'd be like, I'm on the phone! Oh, yeah. oh OK. Yeah. You can't go <laughs> online yet because your dad's on the phone to your, 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 your auntie Dora. I think, I think what scares me the most is you can take out your phone now and you can you can FaceTime somebody in Australia. Yeah. When I had my first computer, I had this cassette player. You used to pop a cassette in, press play, and you used to get this horrible noise for about 20 minutes. Yeah. Ding, ding, just ding. to play Space Invaders, you know. Just, and yeah. You just think... Oh, Space Invaders. 30 years. Do you remember the happened? tennis one? What's Dink. happened to the world? Oh, I love ping. Dink. Yeah. Ding. Pong. Was it called yeah, Pong? Pong, yeah. I used to spend hours doing that. Yeah. And count, uh, count the uh, yeah. on your Amstrad. On the Amstrad. Yeah. Hey, them were the Technology days, eh? Technology has just completely now, taken over. Now, my one-year-old knows how to swipe. Really? Honestly, it's frightening. They even know. Oh, like, yeah. she'll get hold of the, uh, of the iPad and literally she knows to swipe. It's mental, I know, at the age of wow, one years old. Um, £14.99, pence. it is so close to selling out jewellery makers. These have been um, hugely popular. I guess, I guess that's no surprise. No surprise at all. What are you thinking? Can you eh? swap them around? Just, yeah. just swap their position? No, the, the actual stands. Yes, as in the position? Y yeah, just swap them. Sure. Uh, that is amazing. They're cool, aren't they? I love them. I love them. 
I like the fact that now that you can actually take photographs and see the underside of the piece of jewellery that's yeah. standing on the top. That's so clever. It is, I think they're ingenious. It is literally what you would say. Mm. You know, like, um, you know, all these big, big, I don't know, boodles or I don't know why yes. I've got Julia Roberts yes. in my head yeah. right now. You know, it's those pieces of jewellery that you mm. can imagine those celebrities actually wearing. Absolutely. Yeah. Amazing, wow. amazing. Well done, everybody. Keep on dialing through. Uh, but we've got to move on because... Oh. Um, very, very exciting uh, next hour. Two millimeter Mukai and Jadeite and Jaspers. Hello to That's you, Kathy. True. Say, did yes. you know it takes more time and effort to say www yeah. than World Wide Web? Yes. Yeah. It's more syllables, isn't it? Mm. It's it's a yeah. Mm. I get that. World Wide Web is easier. Yeah. Yeah, thanks. Kathy. Well, that's that's a fun fact. Yeah. Really, fun. keep sharing those. Yeah. Coming up though, these pieces, Mark's amazing oh. pieces, and also your nationwide amazing workshop coming up. Congratulations, Mark, and I'll return after this. <laughs> Hello everyone, I hope you can join me on our actual birthday, Wednesday the 4th of May, where I'm delighted to be bringing you for the first time not only 2mm jadeite kits, but 2mm mukai kits. So that's Wednesday the 4th of May, Jewelry Maker's 12th birthday. I hope you can join me for all of the celebrations. Happy birthday, Jewelry Maker, 12 years, 12 days of fun, it's going to be amazing. Wednesday the 4th of May, it's the big day. It's Jewelry Maker's 12th birthday, and we have a show that is completely and utterly jam-packed. Your deal of the day is your 12th birthday box. It includes some of your absolute favorite items, including a jade donut, South Sea pearls, labradorite, tanzanite, grandidurite, and sterling silver, including a diamond set bail. Plus, at 11 o'clock, Jewelry Maker have collaborated with Tammy from Connoisseurs to bring you a special limited edition box of some of the finest products to care for your jewellery and your wonderful creations. Make sure you tune in this coming Wednesday, the 4th of May. Happy birthday, jewellery maker. Just wanted to wish you a huge, happy 12th birthday. It's been a pleasure to be part of the jewellery making family over the last few years, and I can't wait for lots more exciting shows coming your way. Happy birthday. Happy birthday to you guys at Jewelry Maker. I'd love for you guys to join me. Uh, this showcase is going to be bringing you uh, maybe a variety of jadeite that you've never seen before. It is of course Taipei jadeite, which is uh, the material that is 100% natural from Kachin State in Myanmar, but this time it's lavender. Very, very limited, so you're going to have to be on extremely quick. This material is very, very valuable in the market right now because it comes from the skin of the jadeite boulder, but we'll be talking about that in the show, and I hope you guys can join us. Happy birthday to you guys at Jewelry Maker. This is a very special moment for me. It is the first time ever that I've been involved in the wonderful world of Jewelry Maker. Uh, and the team brought me on side, you know, from Gemporia to help get some incredible deals for you guys. And that's what I've been working on for the past 18 months. You know, yes, you see me on your screen. And yes, I'm excited that it's your birthday. But one of my key roles here uh, uh, in the group of Gemporia is to get you guys the most incredible deals. And those incredible deals always arrive in the birthday. That is the peak, the culmination of our buying year. And some of the incredible deals that you're gonna see across this event were bought maybe six, seven months ago. And I really hope you guys manage to get them into your collection.
because it's our 12th birthday and to celebrate we're giving you the chance to win the week. If you spend £20 or more across any of the days during the birthday event, you'll be entered into a prize draw. Now every day the presenters and designers will be adding all the best products into a hamper and you could win all the goodies inside. Come and join the celebrations on Jewelry Maker. That's a good idea, isn't it? I think we should. Should we do it? I think we should. Okay, we're just waiting on our Dan. Yeah. yeah. And then we'll do it. Okay. I'm not going to steal Mark's thunder. I'll just come up with an idea. Because don't forget, <gasps> one of you is going to win this amazing... Win the week. Amazing Hessian basket hamper full of goodies. And Mark... Go for it. Great suggestion. Yeah. Which colour are we putting in? Oh, I don't know. It's the white. White, perfect. There we go. It's going in the hamper. Marvelous. Hooray! I think we should put something else in the next hour in as well. Definitely. Maybe some jewellery or something. I'll, um, I'll we'll put some yeah. one every hour at least. Yeah, we'll do that. Yeah, at least. Now, Mark, look at this. I love these little rondelles. Never seen them before. They are really cute. That's absolutely mm. beautiful. And look how amazing it looks oscillating away. Mm. Now... You don't just get these gorgeous rondelles, which, by the way, um, are, let me just uh, give you the proper description, silver-plated spaces with your beautiful, they're almost like a tourmaline yeah. green yeah. colour. Um, you're getting 10? Is it 10 of those? 10 of those. Yeah, yeah 10 yeah. of those. Um, I'm going to come leave the, the big one till last. Okay. Then you're getting all of your lovely leather. So look how much... The length yeah, on get, those, You get two metres on each of each colour. So two metres. Meters. I mean, how much do I need to make a bracelet like this? Oh, gosh. Eight inches, eight, nine inches. And that feeds straight through this gemstone. Now, yeah. you've got to consider this yeah. for a second. Say you are a gemstone supplier. We would purchase gemstones from you, not based on per bead or... Uh, or the cart or the strands or anything like that we purchase it by the carrot so when we then go to um, or speak to you directly and say is there any chance that you can put a whopping great two millimeter drill <laughs> hole through the center of one of the rarest gemstones yeah. you can imagine the response um, it's basically probably going to be a no or why um, but actually as jewelry makers you know why it really does open doors, doesn't it? Well, completely. It? We won't be able to use leather, leather brace, leather work at all, or or um, larger gauge wire. I mean, you can get you can get one one and a half mil wires through these holes. I mean, they're amazing. Mark, they're so they're, they're, beautiful. And there's, there's quite a lot of space left as well. So if I just turn it that way, just so you can see, there we go. Yeah. So they could see. almost slide if you wanted yeah, them to. Absolutely. No, yeah. That, yeah. Uh, so oh. To be able to, to be able to, I re I would have loved all of our gemstones to have two millimeter holes. I just think just, just for ease of use and thicker cords and things, it'd be amazing. So this will even yeah. do things like marlers with oh, leather? Oh, absolutely. All, uh, with, with leather or all of your 0.9 S long. But sometimes we can't get through many no. of our beads, at all, only the, maybe the, the agates and the quartzes. But to have jade out here, look, it's amazing, isn't it? It's just beautiful. Ah, oh, fabulous, fabulous. Now, we are going to start. This is type A, yes. natural jade out. We have... Um, your jadeite, we have mookite, and then we have jaspers. They are all brand new, never been on your screens before. So you get the cords, you get the lovely rondelles, and you get two strands, two strands of natural type A. I mean, let's show your amazing pieces, Mark, because that necklace at the top there, I love. Um, oh, what have here. you done with the leather there? So this, this, is, this is what I'm going to demo using the cotton bud. That's beautiful. It's the barrel knotting. That's just one continuous length of, of um, your leather all the way around. It's just a really nice way of, of putting spacer knots in between. Yeah, and those rondelles really, cool. really do lovely. make it pop, don't really they? Really nice. Very yeah. contemporary. Mm. Really contemporary way of uh, you know of working with, of course, a gemstone which is so steeped in history. Um, so, oh, Mark, that, that, uh, I saw it in the bracelet. That's amazing. Mm. Possibly my favourite. It's quite fun, isn't it? So basically, it's, exact, it's the barrel knot which I'm going to show you. But all you do is you cut the ends, leaving a little, a little tuft. And it looks so like barbed cool. wire. It's 
brilliant. It's really it does cool. look like barbed wire. Yeah, it's really cool. So cool. I can imagine Pamela Anderson wearing yeah. that. Yeah. Mm. Literally wearing those. Um, now, you know what to do. Just so you know, jewellery makers, we have... Oh. Oh, no. 78. Oh, gosh. Okay. Again, gosh. Not, to, not to be complacent... It, 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 the, you know, our gemstone trader, and I wasn't part of this conversation, it's me making assumptions here, but would probably go, yes, I'll do it, but I'm not doing it with many. No, no, absolutely not. Um, We've not sold them as separate strands. They're only, they've only been available in kits. Only to, in this to, kit. To work with the leather, yeah. Now, there are 78 chances. Last time we brought two millimetre drill gemstones, they flew out. Yeah, yeah. You went nuts for it. One of the most popular kits of yeah. the year. Um, and then add jadeite, one of the most popular gemstones yeah. of the year. And the new Type rondelles A grade. as well. Oh, those, yeah. those rondelles are amazing, right, aren't exactly. they? Yeah. Are you ready? Plus the leather, don't forget the leather. Three, two, one. Graphics are about to appear. 78 of these, that's it. That's all we actually have. Look at the quality. Look it's how beautiful cool. those drill holes are. Beautiful. I never gorgeous. thought I'd say that. Look how beautiful yeah, those drill holes they are. are. No, they're, they're lovely. But they really do actually add a design aspect to it. Yeah. It makes no sense because you're asking someone to take a big whopping, it's like, you know, like, like, like when you core an apple. But you, instead of it just being something that you don't necessarily has, that hasn't got value and you discard in an apple, that's valuable jadeite. A third of the stock oh. has gone in an instant. Um, Mark, I love the fact that this... Oh. This is kind of, this is kind of going back to your roots. Mm. Your beautiful knotting. No, it's lovely. Sutra wearable. Uh, su sutra. <laughs> Super. <laughs> Super wearable. They're absolutely flying out the door. In terms of your jadeite, you have them in six mil and eight mils, both thirty-eight centimeter strands. Look at that. It, it's, those rondelles are amazing, mm. aren't they? So all I've done here is I've threaded a piece of leather through the beads, and then using my flat nose pliers, I've flattened the, the leather either side, which adds as a stopper, so the beads can't move. So that's no, that's no, that's no jewellery making techniques at all. It's just flattening leather. <laughs> you squidged it. Yeah, yeah. That's amazing. Just using your flat nose. I suppose it's, it, you know, it's a natural fibre mm. leather, isn't it? Yeah. So yeah, yeah. You can. Now, we recently had in February. Um, we've played it also in April and May. Eight millimetre round. Type A jadeite, yes, and it closed at £149. Okay, yeah, this is literally for one strand. Oh, gosh, wow. We are there now. With everything else. With everything else. I can see a pretty big butt coming. Mm. Absolutely nowhere near. That's quite funny. You just said a big butt coming, and look at the code. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yes. Yes. Yeah. Uh, what, Willow's been singing. You, you know that, you know, that's, I don't know where she's picked it up from, from YouTube. I like big butts and I care about that. I don't really? know where she's picked it up from. Oh, you God. know, when you're a little fight, but she walked past, I was like. <laughs> anyway, back to the jadeite, serious auction. We have closed a strand. On its own, individually, without the rondelles, without the four metres of leather, mm. without the six mils, without the two mil drill hole, you know when you are shopping as part of uh, the kit hours, not only do you get the amazing talent and inspiration and demonstrations, you also get a significant saving. This is one of those occasions, uh. under <laughs> £100. It's difficult with a capital D wow. to bring you two millimetre cut gemstones of any variety, but jadeite literally has to be on a whole other par and, you know, level. Wow. Um, you can get that home today for £49.99. It includes those beautiful rondelles. It includes the four metres um, of your lovely leather, which is both in a turquoise and a silver. Gorgeous colour combination. It's beautiful. No, it's absolutely perfect. I love the grey with it. The silver mm. grey with jadeite. It's just lovely. It's that bracelet. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to do that, maybe. Oh, that's perfect. Look how gorgeous that is. And that's just two makes. Mm. So I can imagine this is going to go it a long way, this kit. Forever. It goes on forever. Yeah, what would you music... retail these bracelets for? 
Each bracelet I would probably, what I've done, I've added some little silver spacers, mm. the sterling space around, be, but I would probably go £40. Yeah. 40 pounds £45. Pounds. Definitely. I would expect to pay mm. more, but mm. yeah, definitely. Mm. The only way to get hold of these strands is in the kit. Yeah. Um, we haven't bought any more to actually bring them individually. It is part of this amazing birthday celebration and kit hour. Um, <clears throat> message from Deborah coming through. I have the pearl kits and I love it. These are great, says Deborah. Oh, I know which kits uh, you're talking about. Um, they'd look lovely together, wouldn't they? Yeah, but Can you imagine yeah. the pearls and the jadeite? Mm -hmm. We only had 78, but half the stock has gone. Gabrielle, Sharon, Pauline, Pauline, Julianne, Sue, <laughs> Helen, Maker in London, Hazel and Christine. Um, let me show you that drill hole again. I'll just literally double the strand over once more. What did Ross just say then, Mark? <laughs> uh, he said, I haven't, we've not turned up here today to only sell half of that kit quantity. And for every single one of you that has made your confirmations at 99.99, that was never your birthday deal. Never going to be. Would you like ten pounds back into be your nice. pocket? A bottle of prosecco. What about twenty pounds? Mm. Stepping towards champagne now. We are absolutely. Twenty-five pounds. What? <laughs> are you happy at seventy-four pounds and ninety-nine pence? Oh, in less than a minute. We're going to take this whole You're kit. Joking. You say it. Go and announce no, it. Really? Yeah. Oh no. So in, in forty-five seconds for that price, you could buy two. <laughs> oh, no. We're taking it oh, half no. the price that is on your screens. For natural type A Burmese jadeite with your two millimeter drill holes, I love each and every oh. single one of these creations brand new strands the only way you can get hold of them this uh, jewelry makers is within this kit we don't have two millimeter drilled uh, jade eye outside of uh, mark's kit opportunity in 10 seconds eight seven six five i've told you you know where it's going to Make sure you don't miss out on your opportunity. It's still available on your split pay. Hazel's bought three. Cardiff, well done to you. £49.99. Get all of that at home for £25. Yeah, basically. Ridiculous. And what did you say you'd sell one of these bracelets for? 40 45 So you quit it straight away. Yeah, that's two strands of jadeite there for £25. Yeah. Madness. That's silly. Madness. That silly. You know... If they were two mil and four yeah, mil size, absolutely. that would still be amazing. Yeah. But yeah, no, yeah, they're not. They're six and eight. So they're big carrot weights and completely wow. natural. Completely natural. The only negative is the fact that we only mm. had 78 of these. Uh, but I, I, again, not to be complacent, we have taken one of the world's top 10 rarest gemstones and basically drilled a whopping two millimeter uh, <laughs> oh. hole through the center of it. Um, but that's a real positive for everybody at home because that means you can create with leather you can create with your thicker gauges absolutely. of wire yeah absolutely i've got so many gemstones at home that i'd like <coughs> to put onto leather but we just can't do we just can't do it because the the, the drill holes won't well it no it used to be solely yeah. jaspers didn't it mm. that we used could could maybe feed on yeah. or as you said quartz is potentially yeah, yeah. we've got how many left Less than 20 of these uh, within the vault jewellery makers, so make sure you do check out your baskets. We will bring you the other kits um, throughout the course of the hour, but I'm intrigued. I am intrigued to find out what you're going to do with the cotton bud. Okay. Over to you, Mark. Keep dialing through. I'll keep you posted. As it stands, there's 16 left. 16 okay. left of that kit. Fascinated to know what you're going to do with these. <laughs> okay, so... So we're going to do we're going to do some barrel knotting. So if I if I bring this this bracelet across onto my leather, there we go. Mm -hmm. Okay. So barrel knotting is really cool with leather or with your thicker your hemp cords or or your wax cords, anything like that, because you just make the knots because it looks as though you've made those individual little knots in between the beads and then you've you've had to glue them. Yeah. Okay. So I'm going to show you how to do the barrel knotting. So okay. what we need for our barrel knotting is we need a tube. Okay, now you can buy barrel knot tubes. 
out okay. of sterling silver or silver plated. But if you've got, um, I mean, every household has these, I think, don't they? Oh, really? yeah, they have them yeah. and they just kind of gather dust. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Okay, so uh, your cotton buds, what, what did Ross call them? Q-tips. Oh, I didn't Q -tips. know that. Oh, I didn't know that. I'm actually right. quite nervous of cotton buds. Oh, don't really? like the idea of putting anything no, in No, I never here. put them in my hair. No, no, me. No, no. So first we're going to do is we're just going to snip the ends off. Okay. Okay, so you can use scissors or your um, flush cutters so you can throw those bits away or use them for something else. So we have got a hollow tube now. So first thing we're going to do is we're just going to check that our leather cord goes through the tube. Absolutely <gasps> perfect. Okay, so that's How what... How did you come up with this idea? That fantastic. is genius. I did this demo, it must be about a year ago on the show, and I was looking for a tube and I thought, that we had drinking straws, but they were too big. And I thought, because I didn't even know that a, a, an earbud was hollow. It was no just way. That, and it was, so it was just one of those happy as if, accidents. As if, like, literally to think of that. Yeah. Okay, so, that, so, so just keep, make one of these or a couple and just keep them in your, in your toolbox. So we're going to choose our beads. Oops. Oh, they're going to go on the floor. I think they'll stop with those big holes. So the first thing we need to do is we need to make our clasp, our loop clasp at the end here. And again, this is all made with one piece of leather. So we'll make that first. So the first thing you need to do is you need to make sure that you need to decide if you want a large jadeite or a smaller jadeite to pop through. So if you decide, just make sure that you can put your bead through because that's going to be your that's going to be your stopper clasp, okay? So just make sure, okay? So that, that's gonna be your clasp holder. So, this, so if you've got any allergies or anything with metal, mm. there's no metal, it's just leather and bees, that's, that's all it is, okay? So, so definitely make sure you record this demo or you watch it back on, on YouTube. I'm okay? totally gonna this be is, doing this. It's one of these things that it takes a few mistakes, it goes wrong, it inevitably will go wrong until you get it, and then once you've got it, it's, 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 You're it's away. amazing, yeah. Okay, so choose your, your piece of leather. And what I did is I just took my first, piece, my first two metre piece and just worked off the, co off the cord. Okay. Because you don't know how long or, or short your, your bracelet you okay, want. Okay, so the, you don't cut size. it. No, no, so I, don't, I didn't cut it. I just left it off the reel. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to make a, a fold, okay? So a cut, you need a tail of about three inches and then your, as I said, your, your main piece of cord, okay? So I'm right-handed, so I have my, my working threads going to the right. If you're left-handed, you might do it the other, the other way. We're going to take our tube and we're going to place it in between the two cords. Okay, now I'm going, to I'm going to try really hard not to get my fingers in the way when I'm, I'm demoing. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the long cord and I'm going to wrap it four times around the tube, but you need to make sure that your wraps are to the left which will, it will make sense. Okay, so I've got, I've got that holding position. So I'm going to turn it over, holding that in my left hand and thumb mm -hmm. with a little short tail on the top. So I'm going to take the right cord, which is the long, and I'm going to wrap it over, okay? And then I'll, what you need to, when you do your second wrap, is go to the left, okay? okay? Can you see? So that's my second, that's my third, and that's my fourth. So your wraps need to go towards your thumb and finger that are holding the cords. Okay. okay. You're going to swap hands. You're going to take that knot. And what you're going to do, you're going to, that tube is now prominent on the top. You're going to take your tail <gasps> and you're going to feed it through the tube, like so. Again, there's lots of swapping over of hands. I'm going to swap. I'm going to pull the tube through, take the tube away, and then you're going to slowly pull the long cord. And as I said, it's quite difficult because I can't let go but all the, all the knot is inside here. Okay, just pull nice and tight. And you're going to pull the two ends. So you'll sort, it's like a gathering knot, if you like. Pulling that nice and tight. Okay, pull the two ends and pull nice and tight. Now at this point, okay, that's your knot. If you pull both of your cords, that knot is nice and tight. You can go in and pull the shorter tail to, to decide on the size that you need for your bead to pop through. Now, what I've done at home is I cut that little tail off and I've used my hypo cement that we had on the show a few weeks ago and I just put a little dob of glue inside the knot there, okay? But all I'm going to do is I'm just going to cut the cord like so. But imagine that's nicely glued in, okay? So that's now that's nice and tight and you've left that loop large enough to take your bead. 
So that's, that's the difficult bit over now. So all we're going to do now, we're just going to make lots of barrel knots. So we're going to take our first bead. Let's go for one of the smaller. Okay, so we're going to take our first bead and we're going to slide it down. Okay, and then we're going to start, this is our proper barrel knotting. So we're going to take our piece of, of um, tube. And what I, what I had did in the past was I laid it on top of the, the leather after the bead. But what I've discovered now, and it's a bit easy, if you just go and place it over the bead, about a centimetre's worth, and then hold it. Okay, so the tube is above your leather cord. We're going to do the wrapping again. So one, make sure you go to the left. Two, three, four. Swap hands. So you've now got that knot in your left, in your right thumb and finger. You've got that little tube above your gubbins. You're going to take the long cord. We're going to feed that through. So just feed that through the tube. Okay, and then we're going to swap hands again. And what I've done, can you see we've got this sort of U of cord, is I go underneath and just make sure that I'm holding all of the gubbins together. It's a bit fiddly to show. Pull it through, take off your cord. And then what I'm going to do there is, is you don't want to pull too tight, you just want to gather up those knots and also push down towards your bead. So don't pull too tight until you're happy it's in position. Which that is, and then you can go in and pull nice and tight. Okay, so that's your second knot in position. Now I've done I've done it four times. You can do it as many times as you want. So then we go into our next bead. So let's go for the large one. Okay, hold that in position. Then we take our tube, place it over the bead and our leather. Then we're going to take my cord, so one, two, make sure you go to the left, three, four, swap hands, hold the knot, take your long cord down through the tube, okay, swap hands, slide it through, take the tube off, then pull your longer thread, and then slowly, slowly, scrunch up and pull nice and tight and then that, that then that barrel knot is pushed down towards your bead. Okay, I'll do one more and then I'll show you how we how we finish. Nice and tight. Then we do our next bead. Okay, so push that down to the knot. We take our tube over the top. One, two, three, four, swap hands take the cord down through the tube, swap hands, pull the tube, take the tube off, pull your cord and then just slowly push all the gubbins, pushing it down and then once you're happy that it's near the bead you pull nice and tight. There we go, okay. So I'm really pulling hard on that leather, it is very very strong this leather. So you just keep going now until you've got all of your little barrel knots in between. And then to finish, let's double check. Did we have a long bead through, the, a big bead? or a, So we had a big bead through there. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to take my cord, I'm going to pop my bead on. Then I'm going to feed that through the loop. It's easier to do this before or, or after. So I'm just going to pull that through. Oh, that could be a ring. Right, so that could be a ring. <laughs> and then all we're going to do then is we're just going to tie a single knot. And then use your tube, pop that in the tube, pull it, so treat the tube as a, as a bead all in effect. Pull that through nice and tight. And then I'm going to take a smaller bead. You don't have to do this, but I find it, also, it, it helps if, if with any sort of pill knotting. Is you're going to pop that up against the knot. You're going to slide off gently then you're going to pull that bead so it squidges the knot in between the two beads. Pull nice and tight and take that bead off and then you've got your, and just cut the end, leave a little bit of a tuft for decoration. And then you've got your... That's so cool. Ring. So that's, so that's the, the longer completed version here. So that's the, all the barrel knots in between. And as I said, I've done, I've done three or four in between. You can do five, six, seven, as many as you like. If you want a long barrel or a smaller barrel, 
and then and then all you do then is you've got your little closure with your bead at the end. So no findings. It's all leather. It's all one piece of cord, and we're able to do it now because we've got these large drill hole beads. It's amazing. Mark, that, that amazing. is so cool. It's amazing. As I said, for Father's Day, we've got coming up as yes. well. Yes. You know, big chunkier, thicker. And there are bracelets. a lot of people that can't wear metals. No, absolutely you know, not. That, like, yeah. My mum can't wear, wear certain metals because it you know, gives uh, a, course, yeah. um, a real ra rush. You so could, that... um, yeah, you could probably get five of those out of the out of one of the leather cords, and you've got two in place. I agree, Sean. I totally agree. Mark, this oh, technique this is, Sean. is... We were just talking... Does he know we've been talking about I him? don't know. Your ears <laughs> being burning, Sean, because we were talking about uh, how amazing your makes are. Um, Mark, this technique is genius. Thank you for it's teaching brilliant. us. Just watch it Watch it back after the show. Watch back on YouTube and, yeah. and, and have a practice. The first few will go wrong and you'll get into a right tangle, but it'll yeah, just suddenly click. Severe. And then you'll just repeat it. It's, it's second nature now. Amanda in Derbyshire saying, Mark, your demos are brilliant. You make everything look so Bless easy you. and your jewellery is beautiful. Beautiful. Happy birthday, Happy Jewelry Maker, 12 wonderful yeah, years. Yeah, thank here, you. Here, here, Amanda, totally agree. We're not just, uh, we've got literally five of wow. that kit, by the way. Um, okay, should we do the Mukite? Oh now, Mukite's been incredibly popular lately, and oh. I know where you have seen a few strands of this gemstone. However, not in the two mil round. And never, ever. We've, ne had, we've had Jadeite before in the two mil. Yes. But never Mukite. No. This is, this is brand new. And again, same kind of scenario because we've been discussing the fact one occasional gemstone, mm. only two mining licenses at the moment for Mukite, which means, tells yes. me that it's dwindling. Well, it is definitely dwindling because they're actually having to source it from mm. the river now. That's right. Um, and then again, we have to go, right, okay, Mr. Mr. I can't remember their names off the top of my head, but can you, dr can you drill a whopping two mil hole through the center <laughs> of them? Um, but there it is. I'm going to show you the drill hole first. But it really does open open doors of potential uh, for us all as jewellery makers. Yeah. There they are. Um, more limited than the jade I oh, no. oh. 70 of these. Um, again, same sizes. I love the colourway of that's gorgeous. I love this one. So I've just taken Ooh. all of the mustards. Again, it's the barrel knot that I just showed I you. I love this, Mark. That's absolutely stunning. Somebody's missed the start of the show. What tube uh, did you uh, use? No. So I've, I've thrown the ends away now, but the, the tube I've used is a um, cotton bud. So this is a cotton, cotton bud tube. You just cut off the cotton ends. You need about inch, inch and a half of tubing. As I said, you can buy them specifically for this type of technique, but why? spend money when you've got something in your bathroom cabinet exactly yeah. and it, and collecting it's, and it, dust and it's the perfect drillage for your for your leather that's ace oh yeah capri sun straws would probably work mm, as well wouldn't yes, they yes actually they would probably one. work i yeah. love capri yeah. sun but the, uh, the cotton buds are because they're really it's really strong and sturdy that's no, really cool Love perfect it. clever isn't it and i'd never even think of doing that mm. never in a million years um so you're getting two strands of your gorgeous mukai in your six and eight millimeters then look at these colors oh your rose gold uh with your siam red mm. they would be nice as well with the jade eye i'd be yeah, mixing these yeah, kits up yeah. And then a lovely, um, almost like a dusky pink leather. Two meters that you're actually getting of your leather. More limited than the jadeite kits. Uh, just 70 of these available. There's another, you get, you get two lots of leather. <laughs> oh, do you? There should be another one as am well. Am I missing a yeah. color? Yeah. Oh, I am, yeah. Here it is. Sorry, that's oh, there my, we go. There we that's go. totally yeah. my fault. Sorry, for some reason I'd left it on that's the board. That's a lovely kit. Oh, gorgeous, I love that. Mm. Oh. Forty-nine pounds and ninety-nine pence. Essex, Julianne, Amanda, Lisa, Susan, London, Cardiff. You're all there. Um, I'm wondering if that's Sean because Sean very successfully sells mm, his uh, his creations. Yes. And these, I think, would absolutely fly, yeah, wouldn't they? Yeah. That's not oh. your price tag, by the way. <laughs> we are going even lower because definitely. I mean, if I'm looking at this, I think Tom would wear that. I'd wear that. Mm. Willow would probably really, wear that. Really easy wear. No, really no. easy wear. Yeah. Love it. So contemporary, and actually probably one of the most traditional styles of jewellery mm. making. As I said, this this bracelet here, which you can also replicate with any of the kits here, it's, it's, it's just so simple. So all I've done is I've I've made the, the barrel loop at the top, which I've just shown you how to make at the end. So as I said, just make sure that you, you pop your bead through before you seal the loop. Mm. And then all I've done is I've popped on a bead and just used my flat nose pliers. I've just squidged the leather in between so there's no knotting and uh, obviously that that's probably now three or four millimeters and the beads 
You know, it's, there's na na anywhere. natural little stoppers, so you don't you don't even have to knot. You love just it. You can just squidge the leather. I love it. They look like they're floating. Yeah. Are you ready for your yeah. price? We've matched the jade out, but again, we were going lower. More limited, more exclusive. Ten pounds off. Oh. For birthdays, uh, birthdays, good. JM's twelfth birthday celebration. <laughs> I've got a feeling. No, I knew you wouldn't, Ross. I knew Ooh, you wouldn't do ten pounds off. He's That's a rotter, amazing. he says. That's a brilliant price. That's ace. Ross, ro Rogue Ross. Yeah. Rogue Ross, the rotter. Rock and roll. <laughs> wow. Rock and roll Roscoe. I think there's a lot of wastage as well when they make larger drill holes. Well, absolutely. As well. It's like cracking and all sorts of things. You know, when you cut. You cut must weaken them quite a lot when they crack them. Totally. Yeah. Totally. Yeah. So, and that's, ca that's carrot weight, you know? Yeah. Um, that's right, yes. Yeah. That's how gemstone traders mm. actually retail. Mm. Uh, that it's not by the bead, it's not by the strand, it's by the carrot weight. So, yeah, yeah obviously. That's and and then it is going to cause a risk, actually, during yes. that cutting process, too. You know, if you cut a slice of cake, you don't take a big one through the centre of it, do you? No. <laughs> <laughs> you know, Adam probably would, though, he says. He probably would. Just take a, take a big whopping slice out the middle. Um, it upsets Tom every time I make Willow's lunchbox for school because to encourage her to eat it, because she's not great with her foods, mm. but um, I always cut her sandwiches with cake cutters, so she'll have oh, like nice little hearts or a dinosaur or whatnot. But Tom's like, what about all the bit around the outside? <laughs> yeah. It's like, if she eats that, I'm happy. I'm unhappy. Yeah. But that's basically what yeah. we're doing, aren't we? I suppose it's you can't, you can't put the bread out for the birds, can you? Because the dogs will eat it. Yeah, Brutus will be all over that. Yeah. We'll be all over. We do have green, though, out the front of our garden, so we can throw oh. it out there. Oh, OK. Yeah, right. so it's not wasted. Um, however, what do they do with a yeah. effectively two millimetre tube? Mm. They, I love those rondelles as well. I think they're so beautiful. They're, they're gorgeous. very pretty, aren't they? They're lovely. Would you put these away for your Christmas? I think I would actually. They're quite I festive, aren't they? I think yeah, particularly yeah. the red mm. um, yeah, is looking quite. Yes. You watch it, it'll be here before you know it, as if we're in May already. I know. Um, this is the quantity that we have available. Ah, yeah. Jean, Yvonne, Jean, oh. Miriam, uh, Pam, Anne, Anita, Hazel, Helen, Samantha. Terry, Brenda, London, Susan, Lisa, Cardiff, Amanda, Yvette, Julianne, Maker, and again, there's names off the bottom of the screen that I can't see. Um, still got Marie, Lynn, Jean, Claire, Sandra, Joseph, Susan, Louise, uh, another Jean, Susan in Warwickshire, new customers, I can't, uh, there's, they are going to be an on-screen mm. sellout for sure. We're going to Derbyshire for a few days. Beautiful week, week Derbyshire, after next, isn't it? Yeah. Where We're, are you going? We've got a cottage in the Chatsworth Estate. Oh! Very exciting. Is there an occasion? No, it was it's our May holiday, because we left it too late to book a week anywhere. Yeah. Stupidly. Um, and, then, um, and then the lake's in, in um, July, which is, I'm looking forward to that. Lovely. Beautiful. Mm. Really beautiful. Mm. We're off to, because um, I was meant to be in, well, just were, coming back from right. Bali, but yeah. never mind, that yeah. didn't happen. <laughs> um, so we're, we're doing sunny Spain, but we've also, I've also just booked, because Willow's been nagging to go to the, um, to the seaside. Mummy, mm. I want to go to the seaside. So I was like, right, okay, fine, fair enough. Um, yeah, I hope she's not quite expecting to be able to swim in the UK seaside, but you never know. Mm. Um, so I've just booked a long weekend at a really it's a sort of traditional British holiday seaside resort. Oh, lovely. Yeah, a caravan and everything. Because oh, that brings back memories yeah, of absolutely. my childhood. Yes. Yeah. So we're off to, um, where is it, Breen? Oh, yeah, yeah. Lovely, lovely. For a long weekend. Last final well few done. of those. Um, let me know if any of you are in the local area so we can say hi. And Not Derbyshire really. as well. Yes. Right then, okay, final few. We've got one more kit to bring. No, I didn't have this one. Didn't it's, you? I'm intrigued to see the colour of the... St look at those stones on oh. those rondelles. Should we start with them? Oh, yeah. Now, Ooh. I'm going to assume this is the most limited then. Pop some on there. Can you, the, the, the hole again is, is really, really large. Oh. That's oh, lovely. Look at this. Oh my word, that's beautiful. Just that, just put that on the leather. Just that, it's just amazing. Now these would also work, by the way, if you got the pearls with Alison the other day. I've used those rondelles alongside mm. those. Yes, yeah. Aren't they gorgeous? So you're getting 10 of those. I think this is the first Jasper that we've had extra long, extra large drilled as well. I th yeah. Maybe, yeah. yeah I, don't I, don't, I don't recall. You have this color of leather. You have a beautiful bronze, two metre lengths on each of those. Then, I'm just going to pop that down for a second. I love this the strand. most amazing strand of Jasper. 
There's a, there's a gemstone called petersite, isn't there? Yes. And this, this is like a strand of petersite where all the colours have been separated and then, and then um, re it re-stranded. It does. If you mix them all together, it would be like petersite, wouldn't it? Yeah, it I does. love these. Petersite for me is like, uh, it, for my, it reminds me of the galaxy, mm, mm, petersite, because yes, yes. you've got that level of chatoyancy. Um, yeah, I totally agree with you there, because you've got your beautiful yeah. bluish colours, the warm red tones. Still not done, because you also have, so this is your ocean jasper, which, by the way, is deplete. Is deplete, I thought that. Yeah, yeah, totally deplete, no longer being mined. They actually lost the location. Oh, did they? Yeah, for a while. Oh, no. Um, lost the location because it was kind of randomly discovered along, uh, as the name suggests, along the coast. Um, and then they couldn't remember exactly where, they, where it was they found it. Um, but, yeah, mind out. African jasper, you get this really beautiful, almost turquoise-esque appearance. What was that? Sorry, Russ. Next price of the, is the price you're not paying, okay? We're still not oh. done. How many did we have? 75, but 20 have already gone. Again, you've got Ocean Jasper in here. Not oh. paying 29.99. We're not? No. <laughs> oh, no. Going even lower. Oh. That's the price of the Ocean Jasper strand in my eyes. Completely. With, yeah. the, with, Completely. with the two mil holes. It's so funny. It's so funny because I'm thinking about my brother and he would go... You get really excited about really large drill holes. <laughs> but it does Andrew's make it... like that as well. They don't get it, do they? No. Totally don't get it. No. But, but no. everybody that's watching right now will go, oh, yes. Yeah. Oh, yes. Those big drill, no, uh, drill they're, holes. They're amazing. They look lovely as well, mm. don't they? Yeah. Oh, look at that one. Look at that colour. I imagine the sort of wire work that Alison and Claire do, where they use, you know, the, 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 um, Rachel Norris, for example, they use, yeah. the, they use the chunkier wire as the frame, and then they do all the weaving and things around it. But now you can actually incorporate beads on the frame yeah. and incorporate that in the weaving. I think that'd be amazing. They're, as you can see, Mark, mm, they're absolutely yeah. flying out the door. I love that blue in your thumb there. I think that's this so one. beautiful. Yeah. It's like a planet, isn't it? Gorgeous. I, uh, yeah, I knew it. I knew. It is like the moon. That's amazing. Oh, they are going to sell out. You've got a depleted low, uh, variety of Jasper, um, <coughs> which that happened some years ago, quite some mm, years ago. Yes. You can get lots of different varieties of Jasper, but Ocean Jasper is uh, widely recognised as, as exhausted, basically, unless, of course, another deposit mm. actually pops up, which hasn't happened to date. They are so beautiful. You do get the rondelles, which I'm almost feeling sorry for at the moment because I haven't mentioned <laughs> and spoken about those, um, those lovely little rondelles nearly enough. They're amazing, aren't they? They're so beautiful. There we go. They're like little forget-me-nots, which are all out yeah, in force at the are, moment. They are, absolutely. You're yeah. seeing those wonderful little splashes of blue yeah. um, across the countryside. Um, of the jadeite kits, oh, no. do you want to know how many you've got left? Two. Of the mookite, there are seven. Oh, my word. And there are 19 currently of this one right now. You didn't get this kit? No, I didn't get this one. No. That's it. That's all we have left yeah. of the two millimetre. Bless them. Alice, who looks after us, who looks after the kit team now, um, she stops sending me all the kits because I end up making lots and lots and lots and lots of jewellery. And so she, she's, she's keeping a kit back from me. So I have to slow down and... Yes, because you, know, so. you do you mm. do a lot. And if it's there, you have to make something with it. Yeah, I bet. <laughs> I bet. I, and I can yeah. understand why, because yes. they're gorgeous. Mm. Totally gorgeous. But So there's 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 pros yeah. and cons yeah, to that, isn't there? Is. Pros yeah. and cons. But yeah. it's, uh, wonderful, Alice, looking after you all. Yeah. Um, OK, now we can do a really, really quick recap. I've not seen these. Um, they look amazing. These, uh, I bought this. I bought this because ultra simple jewellery making. I'm going to start with the bangle. Um, again, you can't buy them separately. <coughs> you have two genuine cultured pearls. I'm going to tilt it that way. With a two millimetre drill hole. Right. Can you also see the amount of nacre that's in mm. there? Yeah, yeah. Really, really good pearls. You can see like, that nacre through the heart. It's not a, a whopping space, a void. No, no. That's four millimetres, I beg your pardon. Into the, the hole is four mil. Right. Do you want L to do a really quick demo? I mean, oh, I was wondering. You unscrew that. You bought this. I bought this kit. 
Oh, look at that. <laughs> and do you know what I did when I got it home? I put a little bit of my hypo cement because yeah. I don't want it to come off. On, on the actual drill, I need to have my nails done. They're getting too long. This is where I've got absolute, even more admiration for our designers. Look, literally, solid sterling silver. You screw it back on. Then you've just made yourself some high-end jewellery. That's amazing. Yeah, I love that. That's solid, precious metal. If you, if you managed uh, to get hold of these when Alison launched them, they are back in stock. We've reordered them, and we've managed to get 100, especially for today's show, uh, due to popular demand. I was actually kicking myself for only actually yeah, getting the yeah. one of them, because how easy is that? And that's solid, precious metal. A big gram weight from what I remember. I don't know if you've got that, uh, those details. That's they're not right, shell yeah. pearls. They're cultured pearls. Look at the size of them. Yeah. Gosh. Uh, it says on our graphics, what, two, 12 millimetres. That's a Tahitian, I know, I'm not saying it's Tahitian pearls, but a Tahitian yeah. colour, more of a peacock colour. They are, I know we've described them unjustly as potato pearls. They're not, though. For me, they're near rounds. They're amazing, aren't they? And it's literally a case of unscrewing. You literally unscrew... Screw it back on, feed on your pearls. You could even put some of the other gemstones. Well, I'm just, I'm just thinking I would keep those pearls for special, but maybe on, as a pendant or something. And I'd make a kiss cross tube and slide it over oh, the bangle yeah. and then do it up. Nice. Oh, look at that. That's not even uh, the price tag. <laughs> uh, Ross, remind me, what's the gram weight? Hang on. That is so clever. Hang on. Mm. Genius, aren't they? I wonder if I've got... I won't go in... No, no, I won't. No, I won't. Go on, what we were no, saying. No, 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 no. Let me see if I can w weigh it here. Oh, look, at there's the stamp. If I've got batteries. Tappity tap. Come on. Come on. Yes. What's the set... I can't get it. It's, there's, there's no joy. What does full mean? There we are. Unit... Um, I've got it on the wrong one. Sorry. This is great TV, isn't it? Sorry about that. I'll do it in a second. Nobody is paying £49.99. Nobody is paying that. Really? For the bangle on its That's own. That's the price of one of the pearls. Yeah. That larger pearl. These absolutely oh, no. flew out the door on the first um, on the first airing, and they're going to do exactly the same. I bought this kit, and again, literally just feed them on, um, and you screw it, and that's perfectly strong and secure. Alison said, "I don't think you need to no. even uh, no. you know put no. any glue there." I did because I've got no intention of changing the actual overall look. Twenty nine pounds and ninety nine pence, and that is solid. You know, if I literally no. show you in this direction, I know it's quite unconventional, but look, that's solid sterling silver. The reason why I'm emphasising solid is because when I've, I worked at the jewel, in a jeweller's some years ago, and if ever any of my customers actually wanted to purchase something like a hollow bangle, uh, be that silver or gold, I'd always try and steer them away from it because they won't, they don't last. They buckle. No, yes, they will yes. buckle, and you, there's no way of repairing it. Um, that is solid precious 925 sterling silver and something that you could see i mean talk bracelets you could find those in tiffany's and co yeah. for hundreds of pounds I mean, even without anything added to it it's a beautiful piece of jewelry yeah um, doesn't claire wear something like this yeah just just like just that. a solid yeah. see that i think that's amazing i think that's lovely think that's you'd lovely. pay more than 30 pounds for that on its own yeah that's beautiful it's gorgeous isn't it yeah. one size fits all and you are also getting those amazing cultured pearls. Not shell, not synthetic, genuine. Mm. I'm going to describe them as near round because they are. That we've been quite unjust, uh, unjust calling them yeah. uh, potatoes. Yeah. With not two millimetre, four millimetre. Would this work with your with your kits that you just Absolutely. had? Absolutely. Yeah, because that leather will go through easily, won't it? You could, have that, you could have that as your statement in the middle of your jadeite bracelet. Ooh. Just have one of those pearls. That'd be amazing. Fabulous, fabulous, yeah. fabulous. Right, loads yeah. of you have that in your basket, so make wow. sure you do check them out. Okay, let's do the multicolours. These are so pretty. So now we're having pearls drilled with the two mil hole. Again. That's amazing. Ha pearls aren't easy to drill. Yeah. Because they're a natural organic material, they're that much softer than many other gemstones, so imagine saying to that pearl farmer. Oh, that's amazing. Can you just put a massive, look, 
two mil drill hole through the center of a genuine cultured pearls. Would it be easier to drill a pearl than a gemstone? I, I've got no Depending idea. on hardness, I suppose. I've got no idea. I guess there's probably more casualties with your, mm, with, yeah. the, with the, I don't know. Yeah. I don't know, to be honest, but I'd imagine there's more casualties with pearls. And that's yeah. what goes then to be made into yeah. makeup or car paints mm. or shell pearl, mm, of course. Yeah, yeah. Um, you get two strands, all with those big drill holes, two millimetres, as you can see on your graphics. What? Yeah. <laughs> £24.99. Oh. And then you're getting these lovely colours. You can see some of the makes yeah. that Alison uh, sort of created on the live show. They're just before me. Um, <coughs> and she did, well, basic knotting. Basic so yes. popular yeah. the first time round. <clears throat> the phone lines have gone mental again. Have they sold oh. out? Oh, oh, okay. I've also got the silvery peacock love colour. I love those silvers. Ah. Oh. And then we're going to bring the nationwide workshop opportunity for you all. If you haven't heard about this, um, stay with us and Mark and I will explain. So, look, pearls, it pearls in your eyes. Love, I love that silver. We don't get silver pearls very often, do we? No, not anymore. No, we used no, to, no. don't anymore. Four meters of your leather. Oh, look at that. They're beautiful, aren't they? You've got your lovely peacock color full of iridescence and then of course that cashmere silver genuine culture pearls with your whopper of a two mil drill hole that will literally just breeze through can you see those bracelets just over on the t-bar um because again you can see the make you know yeah. quite similar not the barrel knot was mm, it mm. but all about the knotting macrame, macrame there, look. they look fabulous don't they because most people would think oh pearls have got to only only be knotted on silk that's amazing. It's taken I've never dreamed of having pearls with extra large drill holes like that. No. The final few of these, though. How many did we have, Ross? Ooh, 70. Oh, 70. Uh, did we reorder these then? Must have done. We had a nice quantity of the multicolour and they sold in, out instantly. We're not even stopping there. Um, I, I guess, I assume, we're going to make quite a lot of pieces out of, out of these kits. Lovely addition to the jadeite and Mukai mm. and Jasper. They would work perfectly with Mark's designs. <laughs> £24.99. pence. I mean, that's the price of one strand Absolutely. of those pills yeah, yeah. and you're getting everything yeah. else. Um, that's beautiful. It is, isn't it? You could just have one, Mark, yeah. couldn't you? One of the pills on your leather. We had 70 of these available. Um, in terms of measurements, your peacock pearls... Um, are six to seven mil, and then your pale silver are nine to ten millimeters in their size. Again, with the two mil drill hole through the center. It's, it's so funny, isn't it? You know, I can remember the first time that somebody, I think, mentioned two millimeter drill holes years back. Um, uh, to, and I was like, oh. Mm. And I didn't get it. I just didn't get why it was so exciting. No, it's lovely. You, would, you were probably the person that mm. mentioned I it think to I me. Will. Yeah. No, I've always wanted to get them. And I think, as I said, j was the first one we had. I'm sure that was sometime last year we launched them. Yeah. But it's lovely. And pearls, though, that's an amazing idea. Because amazing there, are idea. there are gemstones which will possibly, especially if we are a knotter yeah. or a macrame, maybe never see the light no, of day no, for that no, reason. No, absolutely. Yeah, um, yeah. Stay where you are. Make sure you check out your baskets on this. Now, there are still quantity, but there's a lot of you there as well. Um, now, coming up, about quarter past ten approximately, we've got a lot to squeeze in on the birthday show, is your deal of the day. It's the birthday box. Oh no. <laughs> 12 items for 12 years. Let's just hope they're not. Uh, wow. Oh. Um, worth in excess wow. of 200 pounds. You are going to get an absolutely incredible deal. But um, before that, we launched uh, a couple of days ago a very first time ever mm. a yes. nationwide jewelry making workshop which and by the way you will be moving around moving yes, forward absolutely. Yeah, yeah. um but obviously they can only be in one place at one time so would you like to take it from here yeah so obviously because because of the um the covid of over the past couple of years we've had to um we've been had to because i've really enjoyed it and i'm still loving them we've we've been doing zoom workshops doing mm. meeting people online 
and um, we're getting inundated with people who want to see us again. They want to come to person-to-person -person workshops. So we thought as it was our 12th birthday, we'll do um, a sort of a welcome back to person-to-person -person workshops. So myself, Alison, and the lovely Claire, we decided that we wanted to do something really special for 12th birthday. So we, we sat down with, with Sarah, who's the, the coordinator of the workshops, and we thought, why don't we do a day where all three of us, instead of people coming to us, we will dot each other around the country and then have the, so it'll be the same kit that we're all getting in the, in the three um, places. But I would, I would go down the macrame route, so I would have the kit with cords. Yes. And then Alison would be in Liverpool. So I'm going to be in Bracknell near Reading. Um, to, to cover the south of the country. Then the northern territory of the country, Alison is in Liverpool, and she will have the same kit again with seed beads. Yes. And she's going down the herringbone seed beading. So if you want to learn how to do herringbone, the, the flat and the twist, that's the workshop to go on. And then Claire, who we know isn't the most amazing wire worker, again, she's been given the same kit, and she's just down the road so to cover the Midlands in Solly Hull. So we've taken over part of the village hotel group. I Lovely. think there are about 20 or 30 around the country. <laughs> so it's the same hotel. And it's, so the date for this workshop is Sunday the 29th of May. OK. So when we, lo <laughs> we launched the workshop on Friday, didn't we? Yes. And it was all singing, all dancing, all bells and whistles. Unfortunately, we had a huge issue with our technical side of things. Mm -hmm. And the price that we had intentionally wanted this workshop to go to, we couldn't drop. So the people who have bought the workshop already, thank you, um, they've been contacted in the last 24 hours and they've had their cost of their ticket reduced. And today we are relaunching all bells and whistles with Yay! the proper price this time the remaining places on the workshop. So, so that's exciting. Uh, now the that is, so the original price that we, we wanted to drop on Friday but couldn't was 99.99. This was the price. And this price has actually come from our MD, our big, big, big MD, Colin. He, Colin has decided on the price of this one. And this is the price. Am I right in off. saying that everybody, every attendee gets a kit worth 69.99? Yes. And that includes your lunch, and all the use coffee. of your, to your tools. Everything, yeah. You, it, it's at a beautiful, the village hotels are beautiful if you have never yes, stayed at them. Yeah. And you can also book in those hotels, of mm -hmm. course. That's right. Um, that was the whole idea of actually yes. ha having it at That's a right. hotel venue. Yes. So hang on a minute, yeah. you're basically getting your Jadeite kits. Yep. Everybody gets that. Everybody's and getting the kit. And basically, your good selves, lunch, yep. All the experience, tea, coffee, the experience, tea, coffee refreshments, the shops, the swap and stash. Swap and stash for a tenner. For a tenner. <laughs> for a tenner. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, jewellery yeah, makers. Yeah, so massive apologies for Friday. And we were, de we were devastated yeah, we when, were, when, yeah, when yeah. we came off air because we, we knew what the price was going to and we did, the technology wouldn't, just wouldn't allow us to do it. And this is the real price. So um, you're going to be arriving at, I can, I, I can just literally, yeah, timetable mm. for the day, just so you know, arriving at about quarter to 10, mm -hmm. um, kick off about 10 a.m. then uh, via connecting to the nationwide stream because you are going all to three be, of us all are going three. to um, That's say hello to each fun. other. Yeah, so, so much fun. More technology. Oh, wonderful. <laughs> I, hope, I hope somebody's on yeah, hand for each yeah, of you all. Yeah. Um, at quarter past 10 then, um, your jewellery making commences. At 11 o'clock, uh, sorry, 1 o'clock, it's mm. lunchtime. Yeah. So, and um, by the way, if you want refreshments, tea, coffees, all those things, you do it at your yeah, leisure. Absolutely. Um, at half past one, this is fun, mm. shopping time and also a stash swap. Stash. swap. Well, this is another thing that we've heard on, on the Zoom workshops, that lots of ladies have got duplicates of DVDs or they've got lots of strands that they've bought multiple kits. And so if you, there's anything that, that, that you fancy that you want to swap and see what's on offer, then every, we're enticing everyone to bring a few pieces that they want to have a little stash and swap. I think Amazing. it's a brilliant idea. We've never done it before. No, never great idea. Yeah. Um, then at two o'clock, you have quiz time. Um, at 2.30, you continue with your jewellery making. Yeah. And at five o'clock, we say our fond farewell. So it's seven hours. It's a long day. It's a long, long day. day for yeah. basically yeah. what is a tenner. For a tenner. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's, that's paid for your lunch, isn't it? So it's yes. free, really. Yeah, because yeah, you're getting a Jadeite kit. Yeah. So this is the details yeah. for Marks in Bracknell. Um, now, if you would like to join Claire in Solly Hull, 
You can book these online as well if you yes, need to yeah. check your diary or you can call back. You don't have to do it literally this instant. However, there are, of course, limited spaces. Same price tag, same setup, same timetable. Of course, this is all about whimsical wire work. You get the same kit as well, right, don't right. you? So in the kit, you get, you get two st sterling silver topped tassels. Wow. You get two strands of... No, you get one strand of jadeite and you get two um, charms. You get a hamza hand and you get an all-seeing eye wow. with pegs. So you get all of that. So I will be providing all of the cords that you need for the macrame. The, all the wire will be provided and all the seed beads are going to be provided as so well. You just need, to, so just need your good just selves. Just yourself. Just yourselves. Yeah. Uh, so £79.99, that's for you know all three. Yeah. And again, these will be what we envisage is hopefully moving uh, everybody around moving forward. Yeah. So if you are... Oh. Uh, Harrogate. <coughs> I love Harrogate, so lovely. <laughs> I was being discreet. <laughs> it's, it's beautiful, Harrogate. Can we I love, I'll love be your Harrogate. assistant. All right, okay. That'd be fun, wouldn't it? So, um, um, it's been confirmed now. So, on my workshop, I'm going to be joined by Sarah, who is the coordinator. Mm -hmm. um, Alison is going to be joined by lovely Hannah Osborne. Amazing. We're going and, to put Alison's yep. details up now. And Claire in Solihull is going to be joined by Georgia. Yes. Who, is, who looks after all of the uh, the team, so you'll be able to meet Georgia as well. Amazing, mm, amazing. Yes. So, uh, yeah, some of the jewelry maker team yes, on nice. hand yeah, to make lovely. sure everything runs smoothly. Yes. Um, again, graphics on your screens right now are for Allison's um, Northern, or should say more Northern, yes. Uh, yeah. venue that is mm. in Liverpool. They're all at the Village Hotels. If you have any questions or queries, any dietary requirements, any assistance, special, uh, special assistance, at the venue, um, then just give our call centre a team or, or, of course, speak to Sarah Bingham, yeah. who is our coordinator, and she'll be able to help you with everything. If you've never done any jewellery making, don't let that put you off no, no. Um, because... Yeah, everybody helps one another. Um, and book we're, we're really place. excited. We can't wait to meet everyone again. First one of amazing. almost three years, mm -hmm. isn't it? No, it's going to be amazing. Now, coming up after the break, the biggest auction of the birthday celebration. It's the big birthday surprise. Your deal of the day. And I tell you what, a beautiful box full of amazing, amazing goodies. Join Mark and I after this. Happy birthday, jewellery maker. 12 years, 12 days of fun. It's going to be amazing. Happy birthday, jewellery maker. 12 years old. Can't believe it, almost a teenager. Wednesday the 4th of May, it's the big day. It's Jewelry Maker's 12th birthday and we have a show that is completely and utterly jam-packed. Your deal of the day is your 12th birthday box. It includes some of your absolute favorite items, including a jade donut, South Sea pearls, laverite, tanzanite, grandidurite and sterling silver including a diamond set bale plus at 11 o'clock jewelry maker have collaborated with tammy from connoisseurs to bring you a special limited edition box of some of the finest products to care for your jewelry and your wonderful creations make sure you tune in this coming wednesday the 4th of may Happy birthday to you guys at Jewelry Maker. I'd love for you guys to join me. Uh, this showcase is going to be bringing you uh, maybe a variety of jadeite that you've never seen before. It is of course Taipei jadeite, which is uh, the material that is 100% natural from Kachin State in Myanmar, but this time it's lavender. Very, very limited, so you're going to have to be on extremely quick. This material is very, very valuable in the market right now because it comes from the skin of the jade out boulder. But we'll be talking about that in the show, and I hope you guys can join us. Happy 12th birthday, jewellery maker. I'm so excited for all the celebrations and the amazing deals that are coming up. Happy 
happy 12th birthday. How did that happen? 12 years. Here's to the next. Happy 12th birthday, jewellery makers. We're going to have a brilliant time. Jewellery makers, it's our 12th birthday, and to celebrate, we're giving you the chance to win the week. If you spend £20 or more across any of the days during the birthday event, you'll be entered into a prize draw. Now, every day, the presenters and designers will be adding all the best products into a hamper, and you could win all the goodies inside. Come and join the celebrations on Jewellery Maker. As if we are celebrating 12 years of the wonderful company that is Jewelry Maker. I've got so much to thank both you all at home and this fantastic company. It really has become part of my life. I've met so many wonderful people on this fabulous jewelry making journey. Here's to the next incredible 12. Happy birthday, Jewelry Maker. I love you. Hello everyone, I hope you're enjoying our week of birthday celebrations. On Saturday the 7th, wow, it's got an amazing lineup. My nine o'clock kits, the most beautiful sterling silver macrame slider bracelets. Deal of the day are the most spectacular five meter spools of sterling silver chain. And at 12 o'clock, I've got a brand new launch. Two words mermaid quartz so that's saturday the 7th of may continuation of the amazing jewelry maker birthday celebrations see you then hello can i just say aren't i the luckiest girl ever you should no. be in the middle, really. Rose yeah. between two. No, no, no. We've got to have the end. We've, we've got in height order. Yeah, yeah. But <laughs> we'll be more realistic. I'll be more honest, though. Oh. That's the yeah. Uh, that's me taking my heels off. I, yeah. I've known you for a while, Alan. I didn't realise that. that. I'm that short. I slouch see... quite a lot, though. So. <laughs> it's a, it, no, I also it's didn't realise Mark was this tall. I now feel. Oh. Anyway. Scott Hello, Stone, everybody. Hello. Our wonderful managing director. Thank you very much. Well, wonderful. That's true. I'll pay you later. <laughs> now, thank you so much for joining us. And this You're has welcome. to be the biggest auction of the celebrations. Oh, absolutely incredible. So uh, I'll, I'll give a little backstory. So we sat around a table quite a while ago thinking about birthday, thinking about all the amazing things we've already done, things to come as well. And one of the main things that I said is we need something that encompasses everything we've done from the start to now. Mm -hmm. And hopefully this oh. box is it. It's gorgeous. There's a lot in there. A lot. And firstly, can I just say, if if you take it to the price that I've heard suggested, yeah. I'd pay it for the box. I don't have to talk back on, so you're not going to get any of the shenanigans that I'm up to <laughs> previously. Okay. Because I don't know what's happening. And I also reluctantly didn't know where we're going either. So this is all this is all on you two. Okay. I'm coming. I'm I'm going away at that point. <laughs> I'm. I, I'll, I'll I'll happily take ownership of that because the deal you, is unbelievable. Now. 12 amazing years and we were just Ooh. briefly discussing it in the break uh, break as well so many of our jewelry maker family have literally been here since mm. the beginning oh, yeah. yourself yes yeah i was 21 day I one just, i just realized i was 21, 21 when i started here when you started that says a lot about the company doesn't yeah. it mm. and it says a lot about you guys as well mm. so Thanks, to celebrate we have put your absolute favourites in this yeah. box. Yeah, so we wanted to, as the years have gone on, go through the favourites, the things that you've completely and totally enjoyed, the things that guest designers, things that Mark has enjoyed, things that Alice enjoyed, and then added on a, a, a few of the things that have been incredibly popular over the past few months as well. Definitely, so, yeah. and I love that you've done that. You've not just, it's not just now. No. It's, it's the years gone yeah. by. Um, I'm not sure if we've given away anything yet, but the one that I like the most, and I'm sure Mark mm -hmm. probably likes the most as well, is on my list, number four. Mm. See, see, for me, for me, I think the most important one for me is, because, yes. I, because yes. I was on the show when we launched 
yeah. for the first ever time, and that was, yeah. that was a special day. Oh, can I choose a few? Of course you can. Okay, so for me, and I know this is, this is probably t terrible TV Yeah, right this now. is awful TV. Um, it mine, is, mine is number one, yeah. number oh. three, and number 12. Right. Well, we okay. might I'm get going for the high end. We might get somebody <laughs> to come on to talk about number one. Okay. Oh. Um, and then maybe a few other people to talk about the oh. others. I'm trying to get a certain person to come on to talk about seven, eight, and nine. But if I get that person on, that will be an absolute yeah. dream. <laughs> really? Who's they that? don't Who's want to come on air. <laughs> I can guess who you're talking yeah, about right yeah. now, yeah. Sorry, this is terrible TV for yeah, you all. It will mean something in a minute. It will, hopefully, it all hopefully. shall be revealed. Well, let's just start with the actual beautiful box that is going to land on your doorstep. Now, um, this honestly reminds me of something from Jo Malone, mm, it's really which... Fun. Uh, straight away, you only have to set foot in those premises, and you've probably just just literally spent hundreds of pounds. Yeah, yeah hundreds, for what's going to happen? Hundreds of pounds, or something like I don't know, Cartier, where they literally peel open mm. the box. <laughs> it's beautiful, absolutely beautiful. This is your 12th birthday box, and by the way, before we start sort of opening it and revealing the contents. Um, we have a big quantity of these. We do, yeah. We know that we needed enough that everybody who is watching could possibly get one. So we've got a reasonable quantity. Whether Still it is could, enough. So I think it could sell out. Yeah, though. yeah. It could sell out because there's going to be a lot of eyes on Jewelry Maker today, mm -hmm. knowing that it is potentially yeah. the biggest day of the calendar. Twelve years, it is. It's the one that we always, every single whatever the month is, we go birthday, birthday, birth. That would be great for birthday. It's December, guys. Birthday's in May. Why are we going on about? <laughs> we we always talk about the birthday. It soon comes around, though, doesn't it? Right, should we do this? Go for it. It's the, again, there's something in the... You've got to be the person to do the... Sorry, Alan, you've got to be no. the... Shall we? The bow pull. I think you should do Mark it. Mark should do it, really. Let's get Mark to do it. Mark should do it. Come on, then. Okay, a, ready? It could, be, it could be a pretty woman, though. <laughs> it is a bit pretty oh, woman-esque, right, isn't it? I felt like I was part of We're something there. a bit, bit <laughs> magic mic. <laughs> <laughs> Take the turn for the worst. Oh, my goodness. Literally folds over. Look at oh, that. Look. Now, within, I'm just going to bring this back over here so I can reach everything that's uh, included. Now, we do have one which is actually unpackaged, so I should have Yeah, that was that probably one. the right one. Um, should we do that? Should we do the one yeah. that's actually unpackaged? <laughs> that makes sense. Um, because I've already looked within this box. Have you been sneak peeking? I have been sneaky Aww. peeking. Yeah. Now. That's the unveil. Which did you say was your favourite? Um, the one that's dotted around. All kind of dotted around. Mm, number four. Oh, gosh, they are all dotted around. So hang on a minute. Bear with me. This is live TV. It is live TV. <laughs> we have the most amazing Labradorite. Oh, my goodness me, Scott. These are... I know. Incredible. Look at the lot, shapes man. as well. It's widely known and often reference it, referenced just how popu popular oh. Labradorite has been. For us. And, uh, so I remember, again, as producer, as sales manager, as several of the roles that I've had, any time you put Labradorite to air, phone lines lit up, any time that we did a poll on what's your favourite gemstone. I think nine out, of, nine out of 11 years has been Labradorite has won. It was, it's understandable it was though, isn't it? It's yeah. totally understandable because it, it, we are like moths to a flame with this gemstone. And I think the quality has continued to get better. Oh, absolutely. Totally. This year has been incredible. Totally. Because, I mean, I would go as far as to describe that as blue sheen because you've got complete coverage, haven't mm, you? Yeah, incredible. With that. And it's totally and utterly natural. So Labradorite had to be in there. Had to, it had, had to, to be. Um, and this is your, Scott, favourite choice. Electric, yeah, that's yeah, a great description just... there, Ross. Ross saying electric. Where do we go from here? Do you want me to show your favourite? Yeah, yeah, okay. Okay. This is where it all <laughs> began. It is where it all began. It's colour from yeah. that distance. I know, I know. Yeah. Do you remember? It wouldn't be a birthday box without Tans night. No. Giving it away, sorry. <laughs> no, no, absolutely. And, and I, again, I have to say the quality of our Tanzanite has just mm -hmm. go, gone up and up and mm -hmm. up and up and up. We're, no, we're not bringing you Tanzanite, which is pale and wishy-washy here. We have vanadium rich. Wow. If it's going in the birthday box, it's going to be one of it's the best It's got to be tans. good. It's got to be at the top. That Real works cool incredibly flowers, alongside the... Look how they look. I know, I can see it. Literally look incredible. black like this, and then if you turn them forward, you get that flash of blue. But look at that quality of Tanzanite. So you have... An amazing carrot weight of tanzanite within that totals 100 carats. Wow. What next? Pick one of your favourites. Okay. Um, I'm going to go with... Uh oh Ooh. Ooh. No, I won't. <laughs> no, I won't. Do you want <laughs> me to many. wait? Let's, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to go with the... Yeah. 
Stick it. What? Oh, what? No. I didn't even realise this was in here. When you said tanzanite. Yeah, I thought it was just the nuggets. Oh. I didn't. No. That's oh, okay. That was number twelve. I didn't see that one. Now you might get rounds. You may well get pears. You might get octagons, princess. Um, all will be gem quality calibrated stones. Oh my gosh! Look at that. Uh, in the box, they are, they are literally your cut stones. Amazing. So you could actually include these in things like your Baroque pearls um, or within your gemstone settings. So there's one of my favourites. Right, next up. Again, Mark, do you remember, again, we're talking four, five, six years ago where we were talking around going, wouldn't it be nice to get top, top gem quality tanzanite? Mm -hmm. And we just popped it in a box for the birthday right, now. Right. That's, just, that's the level that we do now. We just go, <laughs> it, can go, it can go in a birthday box, it's birthday fine. Box. That's where we've, got, that's where we've that's come from. Look at the grade. Look at that. I mean, that is what you would find in finished mm. pieces of jewellery. Oh, amazing. Singly. Amazing. But you're actually getting a tree out of this example. Where next? Oh, what's this? I think number five, which number is. Number five. Uh, well, uh, yeah. Yes, this. I was trying to subtly, yeah. I realised I mic'd up whilst trying to whisper. Uh, oh, gosh, okay. Sterling silver box slider. Necklace, stroke, bracelet. It could be either of the above. That's amazing. <laughs> Again. Hey? Four sorts. Hang on. It's all. Uh, it's it's kind of going to have to be just picked out as we go because it's no, all kind no, of rolled it's, it's around all, somewhere. Someone shut the box up before it got someone to us. Someone shut the box before it got to <laughs> us, yeah. You get two of those. I believe so. Oh, that's number two. Sorry, no, it's oh, the no, Labrador. There you go. That's why it's a slider bracelet. Here we go. There we go. There's two then, box class in there somewhere, Al. Two box class, so I can see those. Uh -huh. And they are 925 sterling silver and absolutely beautiful. How often do we reference on air the fact that box class, if you go look yeah, at Antiques favorite. Roadshow, it's always box class. Yeah. yeah, by far my favorite. I always, again, I, I don't think we have them that often because whenever no. they're in a kit, whenever they're on air, they're simply not here again. Yeah. So we've sourced them just for this box, pop them in, because again, it, I, I remember moments where Phone lines light up and we talk about it, but they're the moments where we realise that we bought something to wear that you absolutely adore. Absolutely. Mm. So. Well, they're so strong. They're really, yeah. The design aspect of them as well, they're absolutely beautiful. Amazing sterling silver filigree work across those. Well, we showed five um, so far. Is that so, five? Yeah. One, two, three, four, Are five? we doing like a, a kind of like a little bit of a tally in your head <laughs> of what yeah. you think this should oh, be? Oh, I've not even... Yeah. I've not gone there yet. Well, I don't think you should. No, I need to step tally. out at that point. Step out at that point. <laughs> um, should we continue with the sterling silver? Why not? Because what number is this? Eight, maybe. Will it be? Space of beads. Space of beads. Yeah. Forty sterling silver. Should I get them out of those? Yeah. Um, oh, I, we could <laughs> use our magic turntable. Oh, why not? Genius yeah, idea. Everywhere. The white is on the verge of selling out. By the way, the black. There is um, a few, few more. Oh, I'll just put that there um, for now. There are five left of the white. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Wow. Sterling silver, again, precious metal. Sorry, that wasn't a good angle, was it? Pop over. Um, the sterling silver, again, when we bought them to air, I remember every single yes, kit that they were absolutely. in, every single time we popped them on air, we were like, they were perfect as a, as a spacer bead, as a feature in things. It was always, and, all, and still is now, we just never keep them in stock. Never, no. Are they, are they classed as, Scott, essentials? They are on the essentials list, but, but, but these are the ones that we can never keep in essential stock of. Uh, yeah. Stardust ones. You've got there, Stardust in yeah. which as well. Is that intent was that meant to? That's not well, on my list. Yeah, but we haven't seen them in ages, have we, Stardust? But it's not on got the a, list, now. It's. I think it comes under the, the 40 Spacer wow. Beads. We pay a premium for Stardust because they're more technically advanced to actually create that. Again. Yeah. I remember being a producer and going, every show, Stardust Beads, put Stardust Beads yes, in. Customers love, love them. Stardust, Stardust yeah, Beads, yeah. Stardust Beads. Yeah, we're next. Oh, I think you should go 11. I think so too. Ooh. Are you ready for this? So, no, either around. I missed this. I missed the resurgence. I missed the introduction. Yes. I missed oh. this as a gemstone. Mm -hmm. So when I first walked back in about six months ago, everyone was like talking about this gemstone. I was like, what's that? I knew what it was, but... Never seen it in person, no, the same as no. me. I'd never and seen it. No. Yeah. Never imagined we would see this gemstone. I missed the year of this gemstone. We are talking about a gemstone that literally fluctuates in the top, tie, uh, top five of rarest in the world, and also up there in the most expensive. 
completely natural. You guessed it, Ben. <laughs> it had to be in your, and I'm going to move this box out of the way a second because it's sheltering. Um, that is fine wow. quality Grand Digerite. Incredible, incredible. To be able to offer, you said it about Tanzanite, but to be able to offer Grand Digerite of any variety is wow. amazing, but Grand Digerite with translucency? Yeah, yeah. I, I, again, when as soon as everybody told me about Grandidrite, I looked at the previous shows, looked at some of the kind of uh, strands and gemstones that we managed to bring, and every single time there was ones or twos left, if even yep. that, they were it was incredible. Well, so it was really the year again. I get my years mixed up, but in my sabbatical years away from jewelry maker, this was the. Mm. Oh, it was. It was yeah. the headline. Customer's favourite. It must have. Headline. It must have pipped um, Labradorite for being the customer's favourite. I, I thought, uh, probably. I'm yeah, sure. probably. Now I, I bought a single grand digerite cabochon stone not long after it first launched, um, on one of the gem investor shows. I love it, and my intention is to have that actually made into a piece of jewellery. I paid more for that single stone Gosh. than what our customers are going to pay for the entire box. Uh oh. And that's fine. That's absolutely fine. It's all to celebrate your 12th year of jewellery maker. Right, so you have one of the world's rarest treasures in a natural grand digerite. That's seven? Is that seven? Are we up to seven? Can I choose the next seven? one? Of course yeah, you please. can. You and I mentioned this on, on Sunday's show. We had a special bail, didn't we? Mm. Oh. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now, mm -hmm. tweezers, tweezers, tweezers. Tweezers, stay there one second. Just shop cheap off. I've just got to, I've just got to hop, skip, and jump <laughs> just to get my tweezers. Here we go. I've been looking forward to seeing this. Oh That's beautiful. Lord, look. You have a solid sterling silver bale with the peg, and you might be thinking, huh? What do I do with that? Don't you worry. Yeah. Don't you worry, we have the perfect edition for you all. And if you can, in fact, let me just, does that stay there? Yes, there we go. Um, here's the sterling silver chain oh. for you to put it on. That's eight and nine right there. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Is this what you meant, by the way, Mark? But you, you're missing out the, the, the vital importance. Yeah, I know. Can you, can, I you know. See, can you see the little twisty peg? Yes. Well, between the peg and the bale, there might be a little stone. Oh! I am. Am I not you showing it? it the right way round? Yes. I wish. I apologise. <laughs> As if I was showing that back television. to front. Amazing. There we go. There's a lovely diamond, diamond. within there. Yep. A round, brilliant <laughs> cut diamond set into your bail. That's what we do. That's jewellery maker. Amazing. Turn it around the other way. Don't even realise. Amazing. Amazing. <laughs> now to go on. Oh to go on your oh, diamond look. encrusted bale. Oh, you've just gone in there. I have, um, yeah. You've, um, you've jumped to... Have I, have I gone too far? I, 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 I'm not sure I'm worthy of bringing this one to where I think we need somebody else. But anyway, I can't believe you've just done that. Pop Should that I up. not have done no, that? No, no, of course you can. Should you I do not what have mentioned like. the fact that that's a South like. Sea pearl? <laughs> South Sea. We just skipped through and gone to, what's that? That's a, is that 11? No. No, that's I 10. Don't... That would be 10. There's oh, two more in there, isn't there? That would be more. 10. Yeah. South Sea Pearl. South Sea Pearl. Again, another thing in my sabbatical mm. away. Yeah. South Sea Pearls. All yeah. of a sudden, jewelry maker now has South Sea Pearls. I know. What? I know, I know. You know, the days... The, the things the days, you dream of. The days when, you, when, when, when yourself and, and Sheila and Linda and Chloe and, yeah. uh, and Ollie started this company from what was quite literally a cupboard. <laughs> um, quite, were you there, Ben? I beg your pardon, and Ben was there. <laughs> it, was, it was quite literally a cupboard, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. Did you ever imagine that you would be bringing to a oh. Grandidurite, mm -hmm. South Sea Pearls, Tanzanite? No, no, not at all. No, we couldn't, we couldn't have dreamed at that point. And thank you to all of you for being there through that journey and, and everything that you've brought to the TV channel. So to be able to do this is absolutely incredible. Yeah, just a South Sea Pearl, chucked in. <laughs> just chucked into the box Again, for your 12th birthday. You would Enjoy. Pay, you would pay... Oh, outside of this, yeah. I, I really, I, I'm not here for price. I'm staying away from that. All of this already is giving me heart palpitations. Yeah. Quite, I'm going to have to run away. <laughs> outside of these four walls, you'd pay significantly more for that single South Sea Pearl. Job. Now, look at that. Now, Beautiful. it had to be included. It's Wayne's favourite, this is. We were talking about it's my, this. My favourite, Gemstone Family. There you go. I didn't, I, I didn't know it was included. Yeah, Garnet, in your four mil rounds. I love this trans. Yes. That is... 
The deepness. Yeah. The most beautiful natural red garnet. The richness of that colour is absolutely yeah. incredible. Unbelievable. Absolutely incredible. Three to four millimetres. Um, you're getting a 20 centimetre strand of uh, a natural red garnet there. Absolutely stunning, isn't it? And again, so many of us get really passionate about sort of gemstone families or gemstone varieties. Garnet's always been in the oh, limelight. Yeah. Always, always. Again, garnet is always one of those that if Labradorite knocks it off, it's always in the top three or four in, yeah. in every poll that we ever do for gemstones. And has been a staple from the start of Jewelry Maker through to now, 12 years. But again, quality has just gone through, through the roof, the roof. what we've been able to get. And again, why I mentioned Wayne, obviously gemstone buyer, sales manager, Wayne, loves garnet and some of the quality he's managed to get. I think this was one of those ones that we knew we could get amazing <laughs> quality. Let's, let's pop it in. I, I, let's get it in. I have just heard him laugh is in he the there? background. Is he's in, he's there? In, I have, I I'm going to swap and get him there. out here in a minute. Wayne, he can talk price. And, and um, Wayne, I will, I've said this to him before and I feel it's an ideal opportunity to do it right now. He's still tapping away working. <laughs> Look, Wayne, I think, I would go as far as saying I think you're our best gemstone buyer that we've oh, I ever agree with seen. that. I agree with in, that. In, in 12 years, mm, would we all no, agree? Completely. Certainly. I think the customers agree as well. Some yeah. of the things that Wayne's managed to bring to you, which he does mostly always get a name check um has been incredible i just don't like it when he comes on air and does his sales manager bit and takes the prices too low so he gets a phone call from me after that i don't like that part hang on a minute and i'm gonna swap with him in a minute and he's gonna come out here and do this so i'm fairly sure you've done the same we're competing against each other mm. there's a little competition in house yeah <laughs> love that now we've still got more yeah I, I again i'm not worthy of talking about this one it has to be included in the box. Of course. We are to, about to show you, I mean, granted, you're right. <laughs> and natural type A jadeite, but not even just, just, you know, just, I can't never say just jadeite. This is the amazing donut, high goo, pie symbol, whichever way you want to look at it. Oh... Look, I'm hoping this is going to stand up right. Oh, go on. It's got some good balance here. Oh, yes. No, yeah, no, that's got, no, no not, not quite. Going. Not quite. Look at that. Oh, that's a 12 to 7 millimeter, 17, yeah, millimeter type AJ die. This here, you have a river of imperial, uh, imperial green running through. I don't know how through. that's got into this box. <laughs> <laughs> it only feels right to have done it, but again, um, we may have a special guest popping on in a little bit, just to say hello very quickly and talk about what that is, hopefully. Yes. Not giving anything away, but um, wow. Again, another thing that we could have only dreamt of in the past 12 years have been incredible. This year particularly has been some of the jade that we've managed to get has been absolutely, or the jade we've managed to get has been incredible. Well, and, and to reiterate as well what so many of our um, uh, so gem investors have actually mentioned about this, that window of opportunity is closing, mm -hmm, isn't it? Mm -hmm, totally. You know, to be able, we can't, we, sit, we simply can't sustain the, the, you know, the, the, the quantity that we actually are offering mm. currently. So to, to, to actually include that in the amazing uh, um, 12th birthday box is quite something. Now, I think that is everything. That's the 12. Um, and there was a short list of other things that we thought about putting into this. And if this goes well, me, Wayne, are going to India in a few weeks' time, the short list box will come back as the other things and we'll have another box. Um, oh, that's a promise from me to you. So, and we'll talk about that. Christmas? Day. There you go. Perfect opportunity for Christmas it. Christmas Day. That would make yeah. sense, wouldn't it? I've, like asked, I've asked Wayne to source a gemstone for me. It's the first time I've ever asked him okay. to get me something, and he's going we'll to try. try. We'll try. Yeah. Okay. We'll I'm try. intrigued. I am intrigued. Mm. I don't know who's looking after who out there, though. Wayne's looking after me, or I'm looking after <laughs> Wayne. Which one's? Oh, going that's going to be fun. That's going to be <laughs> such fun. What a birthday box! Twelve years of celebrating, and you've put some of the finest, most luxurious that's items right. that we've ever, ever, ever launched. What a lovely there. idea. Really yeah, lovely put idea. Bits from our past years. I think that's a lovely idea. Wonderful. Um, tanzanite, top quality tanzanite, top quality labyrinth, top quality uh, um, garnet, all your sterling silver and your box clasps. Now you have 60 seconds Ooh. to wait until this auction is well and truly open. Now, a, a little bit of housekeeping. How many do we have then, Roscoe? Really? Oh. Oh, I thought we had less. 500? Stick a few more in there, but that is, I, I, that's 
I don't personally feel that's going to be anywhere near no, enough. Well, we had that Zircon stand the other day and that sold out. That was incredible. Mm. If we do a box next year, 13 years, I think Zircon's yeah. that Zircon strand's going to be in Oh, there. yes. That was incredible. Yeah, awesome. Yeah. And some Infinity Chain in there as well. Oh, yeah. Mm. Yeah, that's always mm. popular. Um, oh, but that little recording looks fantastic. Beautiful. Isn't it gorgeous? Every, there are items in here individually that, I, I mean, I, I have an idea of where we're taking this to. I would pay for the jade eye. I would mm. pay for the slider bracelet. Okay. I would pay for um, for the grandid right most certainly. Any of the tanzanites, just sterling silver, it's the incredible. South Sea pearl. Just just casually, casual South Sea pearl. Um, casual South Sea pearl in there somewhere in amongst that bundle. There are 500 opportunities. The moment to dial is right now because that might seem like lots, like uh, like you've just said there, Scott. It's not going to be enough. It's not going to be enough. And um, I'm going to leave you in a second and say thank you so much. Please do enjoy it. The reason I'm leaving is I'll pass over to the person who can, oh. can do things with the price. He's the sales manager. He can, he can stand in front of you and, uh, and see what happens. But well, enjoy. Thank you. Thank you for being with us for 12 years. Thank you for the future. And uh, keep in touch with us. Keep in contact with us. Let us know what you think of this box. Let us know what, what you want me and Wayne to go and get. We'll do well, everything we can. Before you step out, uh, oh Scott, gosh. I want yeah, look at how many people there. <laughs> I want to say on behalf of everybody, thank you. Oh, well, that's well. okay. Thank you. Don't for, thank me. No, no, you no, guys. no, because you, you, you know, you really are the one. You know, the head of the jewelry maker family, and okay, don't make me emotional. You know, don't smoke. <laughs> and you have been, uh, you have been here for for, for many, many years. Yeah, um, we love everything that you do to bring us all together. Um, and it's, here's the next 12. Stop it. I here's love you guys as much 12. as you love Jewelry Maker, so thank you so much. Um, oh. Appreciate it. I'll swap with Wayne. Scott, See everybody. You in a second. Enjoy. Scott, make sure you dial super quick because these are absolutely flying out the door. As we said earlier on, 500. I thought, oh, 500. I have no idea what we're going to with this at all. I do. I'm not going to tell you, though. Okay. I'm not going to tell you, though, because it is. I just mega. think all my highlights. Absolutely. Have you got a favourite? It's, I love the space of bees, the, the, uh, the stardust. I've got to sing about stardust, I just love That's them. That's diamond uh, encrusted yeah. bale. I think the tanzanite for me, yeah. uh, because whenever we bring tanzanite to wear, this, I always say that it started all those years ago. It must be nine years, nine or ten years ago now that we bought. And look what's happened since we bought that little strand of chips, all the amazing cuts and yeah. stones and pieces that we've bought to air on the back of that one strand. It's amazing. It's amazing. Yeah. Those box clasps are beautiful. Isn't it? I, it's hard to choose a favourite, yeah, isn't it? I mean, yeah. you could literally, look, put the bale, secure it into the South Sea Pearl, suspend it from yeah. your 925 sterling silver chain, and you have just, put, uh, well, basically made a very high-end piece of jewellery. We Absolutely. all know the perceived, well, not the perceived, the actual mm. price of a South Sea Pearl. We know that. It's widely coveted as being one of the most expensive locations of pearls mm. that exist, and it's easy to see why. You've got that beautiful golden luster. Now, even if, and it is a really big if, we were to hold this at £699, um, we're not. We are not. Basically, we have to manage the phone calls. Um, our call centre, uh, UK-based, everybody is being answered straight away. All eyes are on Jewellery Maker as we speak. But no way near your price tag. Let's make it, start making our way, um, chipping away towards your 12th birthday box celebration deal. Now, we have another very special guest joining you as well. And as Scott said, um, the perfect person to start negotiating your deal. That's the perfect word for Wayne, the negotiator. S negotiating. Now, he is responsible for purchasing many, if not all, of your amazing gemstones. He goes by many a name. I thought he was going to But I know him then. so fondly as... <laughs> the Vashasaurus. It's Wayne! Hello, everybody! Happy birthday! Happy birthday! You are Come right. on, Mark, bring it, in. bring it in. Bring yeah. it in, bring oh, it in. Oh, oh geez. Sorry. I know, he is really tall. <laughs> Hang on a minute. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like it. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Wait a minute. There you go. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. How amazing is this bundle? Uh, it's incredible. 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 The box is beautiful, mm. even. We've had to really work hard to get the price for this in because... You're so amazing. We thought we got to do something really special for the birthday. The price this is going to, you could just pay for yeah, the, the jade, jade, the pearl, 
I was going to say sexy. Anything. This box, what's not to love about this box? It is incredible. I Even think, the I box think it's, itself. It's, it's just poignant, isn't it? it it's, it's Jewelry Maker history in one little box. And all of the viewers that have joined us from the start or recently, they've all seen these products. They've, yeah. they've all probably got some type of product in yeah. their stash. And the fact that Aww. it's all been put together like it's like a memory box. It's it lovely. is. I love it's, that. It really I love is. That. Uh, S. Jane, sorry, saying we love you, Wayne. I mean, he's all right. <laughs> he's all right. Look at that Labradroid right there. Look at that Labradroid. It insane. is epic. Uh, hello to you, Margot, saying what a day it's going to be with the Bashasaurus at the helm for this box. Still wave my T-shirt. Yeah. Still wave my T-shirt. Yeah, I know. Sorry. I'm, like, I'll give yeah. up. This image has popped into my head of the Queen's Jubilee Day. The whole royal family stood on the balcony at Buckingham Palace and Wayne popping up and waving <laughs> over her shoulder. <laughs> <laughs> we do that. Yeah, and have a for the Jubilee. For the Jubilee? Yeah. <laughs> See if you can uh, photobomb the Queen. <laughs> how, no. many's got, how many gone? Do you know what we're going to do, right? We're going to take it to the gone. price that if we did everything as a dinner day special, mm. Dina's Day is always wicked. Yeah, which is an amazing deal. price. So yeah. we're going to go to a price where if we took all these to a Dina Day price, that's what it would add up to. Mm -hmm. okay. So let's do a minute clock and yeah. we'll, we'll show you. And it is, we've worked it out and this is the price that it would be. So if you're buying everything individually off our website. Yeah, like we did a Thursday's deal of the day, yeah. Sunday's deal of the day. Okay. We'll put them all together and this is the price you would pay individually. Okay. Which right. is an incredible price. Yeah, because the South Sea Pearl surely alone. Yeah. You know how much these are? You know how much the these are? Jadeite. Yeah, exactly. And only exactly. sell you. Tanzanites, Grandidiorite. Yeah, and, and I think you can definitely take, you know, take a bit of a bow for, uh, for what, well, as, as Scott just said, for the Grandidiorite. It was I you love, yeah. that, that, that really pioneered it and got it to yeah. us. Grandidiorite is actually my favourite, favourite. It's your it's baby, my isn't it? Number one, yeah. It is well, your I, baby. I've been in the industry for 25 years and I didn't see it. Till seven years ago, so it's Some new people to are me. saying you don't look old enough. <laughs> what are you after? Are you ready? Now this would be the price of everything combined. Everything combined. Okay. If you'd buy them individually. Individually on the other days would oh, be yeah. two hundred and forty-nine pounds. Gosh, that's amazing. For everything, that's how much you'd be paying. That's what all this is worth. Wow. One hundred percent. Okay. And that's a crazy thing. Well, well, it showcases it? how amazing our savings are on an ordinary day as well. And we've worked extra, extra special for this because we, because we want I've to seen those them. meetings. Honestly, yeah, you, come off, you come off here and there's literally cl closed meetings and you've got all the management <laughs> team literally heads down in their laptops. This is what you've been doing all those months. Yes, it takes a long time, a long, long mm. time to do this. Back and forth, no. We need a better deal than that. No, better deal than that. We need to get as low a cost as we can so we can do these great. So we're not going to make much money off this today. We're just going to give you a, a, a fabulous, fabulous and That's deal. what it's all about, yeah. though, isn't it? The it's celebration. Thank, so thank yeah, you. Absolutely. For 12 years. I've been here four years, I think. You've been here 12 years? No, not quite. 10 years. 11. Woo! Years. Mm. That, 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 that says a lot as well, doesn't it? They can't get rid of us once we start. <laughs> <laughs> Literally, once they start, no shaking us off. Um, yeah. £62.25 on split pay. That's pretty amazing. But not where let we me, are stopping. No, let me go see what's... We I can't hear nothing, can the, I? Oh. I could literally see yeah. the cogs literally turning then. Um, we had past tense 500. Now... 200 have gone. as many as that. That's amazing. I thought we had 350 mm, and I was right. excited about that quantity mm. mark. So imagine, I don't know, I, I mean, yeah, the jadeite could be that price tag and it would be elsewhere for the level of quality. And let me just put it on the back of my hand so you can see that it's quality. Stunning, isn't it? it really is. That I love quality. that dark veining running through it. It's just so beautiful. It's a river of imperial jade running through. You know that the you know the price that Type A Jade can and does fetch. We know. I said, I'd love to talk to you for hours one end about the history of Jade. I I simply don't have the time. But if you want to on any other occasion, then feel free to message us or tune in. No, I'm just showing you the other side. Right. Look at how beautiful this is. That alone for two hundred and forty nine pound would be amazing. Or <laughs> your South Sea Pearl. Or the diamond encrusted bale or all that sterling silver or 
your grand digerite. You know, we are talking about the box. The, I'm fairly sure if you go into places like, you're all loving the box, aren't you? <laughs> it's only available as part of the birthday box. No, you can't buy them individually. I get why you're asking there. I would too. But that, you know, if you go into, I don't know why Joe Malone keeps popping into my head, but if you go in there and, and, and they do like lovely, the scents basically and candles and things like that, you probably pay best part of a couple of hundred quid for the box. Things I'm hearing in my ear. I know. This is going to be Honestly. incredible. Honestly. Not stopping here. Leah, Pam, Cardiff, Linda, Agnes, Amanda, new customer, Penny, Wendy, Margaret, Linda, Pauline, Patricia, Elaine, Rachel, Judith, Barbara, Lynn, Tracy, Chrissy, Debbie, Rhonda, uh, hello to you, Linda, Suzanne, Danielle, and that's just literally a handful of those of you that I can see on those phone lines. Um, Caroline, is that you I hear? Are we about to make, <laughs> are we about to force you? Because let's be honest, yes. Ah, oh. oh, I thought it was going to be a debut. She was just saying in, mm. in, in the gallery, what would you sell a South Sea pearl oh, with a diamond bale? How much would you sell that for? Hopefully you're going for the high price points because it is South Sea, Akoya and Tahitian. These are of your freshwater pearls they are that legacy they are that pinnacle and you know what so perfect it's like it was it's like it's all planned we have yes oh, yeah, it's okay. the uh, amazing dave in the studio yes yeah, what round thank you uh, so uh wayne's just come in yeah uh and he's just said to me that you're doing a birthday box you're doing it right now yeah this is it okay so there's jadeite in here yeah. yes what else have you got we've got jadeite we have Grandid, you're right. Right, okay. In a cabochon. Do you want that? We've got a South Sea pearl with a diamond bale. Yeah. Sterling silver, lots of sterling silver, and a slider bracelet box class. Tanzanite. You've got more tanzanite. So, All oh, of this. You and I have bought one of these jadeite donuts before at what? $79.99? Yeah. Or $99.99? I don't know the carrot weight on that, but it looks big. Yeah. Um, this Grandid, you're right. In all my shows of being here at Jewelry Maker, and I know you guys have been here a lot longer, but. That's probably the most intense colour I've seen of a Grand Idea, right? Mm. Well, yeah, it's beautiful. <laughs> Look, and translucent. Right. And I mean, I'm not going to say anything, but already at the price on the screen, you're saving more than you're spending. Mm. South Sea Pearl, um, Jadeite, Grand Idea, right? It's one of the rarest gemstones, not just here at Jewelry Maker, but in the world. Mm -hmm. And Wayne's told me where you're going. I'm not going to let the cat out the bag. Well, it's but, all um, I'll tell you, I'm, I'm going to be honest with you, I don't even make jewellery and I'm going to go and order it. <laughs> so th that just shows you the kind of level of deals that Jewelry Maker are bringing you to, uh, as part of this birthday. I'm glad that I'm not a part of this. I don't want my name attached to it. After the show we did the other day, I know, I know, <laughs> where I know. we lost the company probably uh, a ton of money. <laughs> I don't want to be part of this, but I'll say to you guys, I know the price. Wayne's just told me, he came into the, the, the office. I'd say multi-buy. That's all I'm going to say. I can see Kim has, Sue has, uh, Elizabeth has. Many of you are multi buy When you start seeing the price that we're going to go to, I think you're going to be surprised. Sharon, you've got two as well. I'm going to love you and, uh, and leave you all. Aww. But I just wanted to come on and just, because Wayne said we're doing a birthday box. I said, well, what is the birthday box? He said, it's got jade in it. I was angry. Because <laughs> he told me the price. And then I come on and I see how big it you is. You can't be angry. So, um, Do you know what? Can I just, all right, well, on. I might as well fuel that. Um, you know, poke that bear. Yeah. Because right now, at the price on your screen at the moment, are you joining us tomorrow, by the way, Dave? Maybe not, not after this. Oh. Not after this, I probably won't. No, I've I, I'm seen what you've got tomorrow. I know, it's, oh it's, it's going to be incredible. So I am going to be with you tomorrow. I'm gonna, also going to be with you Sunday. I don't know if it is you, Al. No, not me Sunday. OK, so sorry. I'm going to be here on Sunday <laughs> as well. So, uh, uh, take care, guys. That's I hope it. you have an amazing Dave, that's, show. That's working out at £20 per item right there. I don't want to know. But don't worry about it. Oh, dear. <laughs> It's the birthday. If you can't do it on the birthday, when can yeah, you? Yeah, absolutely. When can you do it? South Sea Pearls for £20. When has that ever happened? Type A natural jadeite for £20. When has that ever happened? Bashasaurus is back. Are we ready? Yeah. One minute clock. Let's get this prize going. Love it. Where's the, We need... Um, 
Poppers. Yeah. Poppers and yeah. stuff, like. <laughs> not my birthday, is it? Like, come on. Yeah, let's pop a balloon. Oh, don't now. pop balloons because oh. they actually scare me. Where's Dave? Dave with his balloon. <laughs> Animal, yeah, where's Dave? <laughs> I don't think you're uh, ready for this, guys. No, I'm not. Oh, yeah. The box alone is pretty yeah. lovely. It Granted, is just... you're right. As Dave Love said, it. I mean, as Dave said, the grand did you write on its own is is what's on your screens. The jade, the pearls, it's all amazing. Tell Mark what you're taking it to. Because I don't know. No, because I might be wrong yeah. as well. So tell Mark. Oh. Well, that was close. Nearly give it away. Well, you, if you wait, yeah. Right. Twelve, 12 seconds. seconds. You find out. You will find out. Are you ready? I know. I know, I know, I know. How many's gone, Roscoe? Look at the phone lines. Oh, yeah. Two, one. Half the stock is gone. 120 pounds. Wow. 10 pound an item. 10 pounds. 10 pounds. <laughs> 10 pounds. I love how you're saying this, literally. 10, 10 pounds. pounds. You would never in a million years get that for 10 pounds. You wouldn't get the space to be for 10 pounds. 10 pounds, 10 pounds. The check, you know, slider bracelet. Yeah. 14.99. Yeah, all day long. Without beads. Fifty pound for yeah. the jade. Box clasps. Yeah, that is ridiculous. Twenty nine ninety nine. Tanzanite. The box. We haven't even included the price right. of the box. Oh yeah, and the box. No, I miss. I I, oh, I missed that. Lovely. There's a message lovely. coming through. Yeah. Hello to you, Sue. I managed to get one for my uh, daughter and one for my granddaughter. Thank you, jewelry maker. Happy birthday. Happy birthday to you as well, Sue. Split pay is thirty pounds. My favourite deal ever. I'd agree. Ever. Ever. I'd agree. I'm going to buy some of these. Yeah. If there's any left. Go, going back to going back to what I said earlier on, I bought Grand Digirite, one of the first ones you must have purchased. Um, mine doesn't... It's more opaque than what we're seeing in this birthday box. It's still lovely. Um, and I paid more than what's on your screens right now. For that it, individual stone. It's a good one. That lab just that blue from that labradorite from here. I know. Look, look I know, it's that. incredible, it's, isn't it? Unbelievable. It is That's amazing. ten pounds each. Ten pounds. Well, Less than actually, because you've got to in, you know, that's they, it's, it's, it's a nice box. They wouldn't have been cheap. No, they wouldn't. Um, I reckon this is a Caroline purchase. Caroline, did you buy the boxes? No, nah, it was me. Was it? No, it was Caroline. <laughs> yeah, I thought so. I knew it was a Caroline. It just looks like a, a lovely, yeah. luxurious Caroline. Not saying you wouldn't no. buy the luxurious no. box, of course. No, probably not. Uh, <laughs> that's my... Yeah. Yeah, yeah you'd, you'd probably like just... Yeah, maybe... I know the phone lines are gone Absolutely. Do you want to say... Shall I try and... If I can get out? Oh. Let me see if I can. <laughs> Hang on a minute. Christmas. Hang on a minute. Let's do a little showing everybody the call screen. Uh, oh, there we go. I was confused. Did you wonder where I was disappearing I'm off to? There we are. There you go. Look at all those names on the call screen. I'll make my way yeah. back. Um, if your hand is in the far right hand column, Wow. It's no good there. No, no, you've got to check them out. There's USA all... and UK getting involved. Wonderful and people multi-buying. I don't blame you at this kind of price tag. And by the way, it's not sustainable. You can't do this every day, even, no. even when... This took months and months and months in the making. Back and forth, back and forth. No, we need a better deal than that. Better you know, deal um, than that. At Christmas, Tiffany do an advent calendar, Ooh. which is 25 grand, wasn't it, the one this year just gone? Well, you could get two of these. Buy a, um, an advent calendar blank and make your own oh. advent calendars with these beautiful products. I think that would be an amazing idea. South yeah. Sea Pearls. What's your favourite yeah. item out of that yeah. whole thing? Oh, it's just hard to pick. What's your favourite, Mark? Well, for me, poignancy wise, it's the Tanzanite. Yeah. I know we've got all the jadeites and things, but I was here when we looked. That was the very first strand of Tanzanite that started the whole Tanzanite phenomena with Jewelry Maker. And for yeah. me, it's got, it was a big part of my heart, that strand. So that, that's that's it's my the Tanzanite thing. Yeah, view. Just purely through the that's that's jewelry maker <laughs> history in one strand. That's that strand. I totally, totally yeah. agree with you. Mm. Mine's got to be the Grand Digi, right? Mine's, the, just, mine's the South mm. Sea. <laughs> mine's all of it. I want all of it. Yeah, to be it's fair. All of it. And the jade, I, let's not, you know, it's seriously. Jade. It's a big old jade. It's it a is. beautiful it jade, yeah. and it has, like I said, those uh, the, that. Should I hold it up? Yeah, um, that I'll river of natural. Green running through. Where's he gone? I'll be back. This, he'll be back, he says. <laughs> he'll be back. Look how beautiful this type AJ is. With that cord we had in the kits earlier. That oh. cord. Just keep it really simple. That's Look at that. 
and uh, and lovely Claire. She's done demonstrations mm. with things like <coughs> gallery wire uh, and bezel. And I believe, <laughs> is it tomorrow that Hannah's on? It might be tomorrow. I think Hannah's on tomorrow, and she's she's showing you how to seed bead bezel around donuts. <gasps> I'm sure it's tomorrow. She's on. Do you know what else, Marcus? Some, something mm. that's just literally dawned on me. Mm -hmm. Take your, if um, you get the rounds, inside. take your tanzanite rounds uh, yeah. and literally drop that in the centre of your jadeite. And then do the bezeling. Immediately, straight away, you have made the most mm. luxurious piece of jewellery. Just dropping one of those tanzanites in the centre of the jadeite. How have we only yeah. just thought of this? What? I know. <laughs> Yeah, One, just drop yeah. it in the center, literally secure it in place. I mean, oh, look at them. Yes, <laughs> I love it. You know what? We've sold 250. There's 217 baskets. Yes, we want to sell them more. Give me a minute, clock. Who wants it loaded in 10 pounds an item? But you gotta go, they gotta go. We gotta sell them all. Didn't we have a lovely customer win £100 on the Wall of Fame this morning? Yes, we did. And someone won 50. Mm. Yeah, that's a nice little contribution towards it. Yeah. Um, yeah. Hello to you, Caroline. Happy birthday, jewellery maker. And thank you so much for the birthday box. I got three so far. Wow. The box must be £20 alone. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah, it must be. Exactly. I wonder if that, Caroline, are you the same Caroline from buying? Because she bought this. <laughs> I think that is so, you know, Tiffany's. He's I'm just imagining this is a Christmas present full of cosmetics and, Ooh, yeah. and things like and this little soaps and bubble baths and things. So recycle bath it without bombs. a doubt. Bath bombs. Bath bombs. <laughs> Absolutely, you could wow. put all of those. Um, if you could even bring yourself to part with it, because I do yeah. think that's absolutely amazing, even down to that lovely, beautiful ribbon. Um, okay, I can not enough. Another minute. Just see Wayne oh. bouncing. Another around there's three hundred in baskets. Three hundred. No good in your baskets. Okay. Trust us. Check out. Come on. Right. It's going to be crazy. Do it. It's what's crazy. It's now. birthday. <laughs> Woo! Come on. It's crazy oh, now. Dear. Hello, Mandy. Saying, uh, I feel like it's my birthday. What? What it is? Yeah, and it's all our birthday. It's everybody's. Yeah, it's everybody's. We're celebrating together. Twelve years of jewelry maker. I know. We've been popping a few yeah. things in that in there. I don't look. Oh, don't no, don't do it. Don't do it. Don't look in there. That's another for another day. <laughs> right now, it's not the main concern. We could put a box in. Let's if do there's it. any left. If there's any oh, left. There we go. Wow. Let if there's check. any of the birthday box left, we'll put one in the basket. If there are. There is a oh, big my if. Word. Yeah. I tell you what. Okay, okay. one is going in because right. we'll put the studio sample in there. There we go. Wow. Yes! Yes! <laughs> so we'll pop the sample box in there. And maybe some maybe the tanzanite that we're doing a little bit. 45 later on. in baskets! There's no good in but out. Oh, Ooh. Get them out of your baskets! <laughs> oh, <no>. <laughs> <laughs> Another minute, please. This is crazy. You need to be checking out. There's no good in your baskets. <laughs> Trust us. Just stubbed her toe. No, what happened? Oh, no. I think I just... What was that? I just... 62 bidders oh, no. press one. Stepped on what? a beaded needle. 62 <laughs> bidders, not press one. What's going on now? Um, <laughs> <laughs> no, no, it's OK. I just stepped on a beaded needle. That's not oh, ideal, oh. is it? There we go. All good now. I'll keep my shoes back on. <laughs> <laughs> All good. Sorry, Wayne. There it is. Literally, just go on tiptoes. <laughs> oh, what did you say, Wayne? Sorry, I was a little bit preoccupied. Sorry, we again. sorted it. We're good. That's all good. There's 62 Sorry people who haven't pressed one. There's over 370 in baskets. We've only got 500. Yep. So we're way over allocated. Yep. And now you know people are going to miss out. Let me, I'm, uh, one yeah, second. but Wayne, um, I was imagining this to be our stopping point. That's what I saw on my star by sheet. Is where you paid yeah, you which is you still amazing. Look at him; he's got he's all he's he's got he's, he's, all, he's all stompy and everything, isn't he? <laughs> very very excitable is our Bashasaurus Wayne. Um, oh, ten pounds per ten item. Right, are we going again? Let's do it. Should we do it? Should we take a fiver off? <laughs> So you take five pounder, five pounder. No, you know what we're going to do? 99 pound and 99 pence. How about that? Happy birthday, everybody. Uh, yeah. Oh. 
<laughs> How much is that an item now then, Roscoe? Oh, eight pound thirty-three. That's not even including the price of the box. We were already too low at, at ten pounds. Wait, let's that. just go through this again. I'm now, not, not being funny, but we can't bracelet. buy these individually at these kind of prices. No, I know so. you, you know can't. What I mean? That is actually a giveaway. We're just making a lot of friends today. And and that's not what it's a lot all about. Diamond encrusted sterling silver, a South Sea pearl at eight pounds eighty-eight, a chain at eight pounds eighty-eight, slider bracelet with gemstones. Your can you see that just there? Um, with your labradorite, two of your sterling silver box chains, uh, box class, sorry, your gorgeous labradorite, your tanzanite, the nostalgic yeah, tanzanite, yeah. um, has to be, you had to include, I'm so glad you included garnet in there. Beautiful. All your sterling silver spaces, where there's 40, by the way, a type A natural Burmese jadeite, donut, high goo pie, whichever way you look at it, grandidurite. That alone, <laughs> you could pay hundred pounds for eight that. Eight pound thirty-three. Ridiculous. And and tanzanite um, and the box. Let's not forget that. These space bees, they're in. They're out. They're just they never are. around. They're yeah. Like, well, Scott said like that gold exact dust. same thing. I haven't seen Scott. Those are sliders. Yeah. They're like gold dust. They're in. They're out. So yeah. this is just ridiculous. This is all your favourite items. Hundred percent. Caroline, look in the Channel Islands has bought five. I don't blame you, Caroline. That's I, I, and granddaughter, isn't it? Yeah, I don't blame you, my lovely. And you're not alone, by the way. Lots of people have chosen to multi-buy on this. We had 500. You can get this home on your split pay for £24.99. Uh, yeah, Maker have bought four. Uh, Essex has bought two. Another Essex has bought two. Lincolnshire's bought two. Berkshire's bought two. James in London's bought two. Um, yeah, so, oh, yeah, five. I can see you there with the, uh, those quantities. Um, every time I try and say a name, literally the call screen jumps. Zara, Julie, Margot, Jane, Leah, Gabrielle, James, Linda buying four, Glenda, Maria, Elizabeth, Judith, new customer, Louise, Alison, Michelle, Cumbria, Caroline, Gail, Helen, Neathport, Talbot, Catherine, Tracy, Paula, Lynn, uh, Tracy, Stacy, Jackie, Essex, Dagmar, hello to you, uh, Christina, Lane, Pauline, another Tracy, I can't keep up with you, I really can't. Um, there were, and, and I'm, only, I'm only literally reeling off a handful of names. Yeah. 500 12th birthday boxes are available and I kid you not literally when uh, you know when it come up we come off air mark and normally not every day they not but, but but normally you can see the management team and the production team and and our amazing buyers and everything in the background but just lately they've all been literally in that closed conference room that looks yeah. very important it's this that you've been sorting isn't it it is indeed it is indeed months and months and months of work this took £8.33 Ridiculous. Yeah. Twenty-four ah. ninety-nine split pay. Amazing. <laughs> Why are you saying like this for? Wayne, have you got top back in? Oh, he doesn't know anything about this. What? No. Ross no, has made the no, decision. No, no. This is the price, Roscoe. He's Ross going made, rogue. Apparently. He's gone rogue. You know he's gone rogue though. What? Ross has made a decision. What has happened to you, Roscoe? He's gone rogue. That is not Roscoe. He's brave, he says. Oh. Do it, do it, Ross. Of course I'll what back you. What are you doing? Of course I'll back you. Will you yeah, back him? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, yeah. Me and you after the show, Roscoe. We are. We stand by Ross. Ah, oh, Roscoe. <laughs> He's gone. We've gone lower than we were supposed to go in the first place. But he is also saying in my ear it, um, that it's it's his name is against it, so don't worry. Mine however, however, Mine oh yes, of course, yeah. I mean, <laughs> we did buy it, but. <laughs> oh dear. There are 211 still in baskets, and I know you want to hold this at 99.99. It's incredible. The price that... is ridiculous. So I'm assuming at that all of these items come individually, and then and then we have to then pack the boxes. Yep. And... Yep. Yep. So that exactly. Manpower. Yep. Manpower as well. Manpower. Didn't take that into account, did you, Roscoe? You can get over there and pack them after the show. <laughs> That's what you can do. That's all right. We can roll up our sleeves. It should have been ninety nine, ninety nine. This, I mean, that's lower than what I was told. I'm leaving. Oh, he's doing it. Oh, he's, oh, he's off. I'm leaving. Oh, oh no. I'm going to kick Roscoe out of the chair. No doubt. He can, oh. he can leave. He can leave. He can leave. Look at him muttering oh, no. under his voice. <gasps> uh.
seven pound fifty oh, now. Right. Yeah, yeah I, do you know? Uh, yeah, I like eighty nine ninety nine. That's a good price point. That's. I mean, it's amazing. Again, for the Grand Digerite, for the South Sea Pearl. Eighty-nine pounds and ninety-nine pence. Bit pearls in at that price, didn't yes. you? Yes. Yeah, thought he had. Mm. Yes, absolutely. For the Type A jadeite. I mean, where do we even go with this? Look, let me just just for a second imagine that this is all put together. So your diamond encrusted bale, your South Sea pearl, La Peregrina drop shape. Yeah. By the way, turn it round the right way. There we go. There we go. Stay there. Stay there. Here we go. Imagine that in a, you know, on Bond Street or in Hatton Garden. That literally that piece. It would not be eighty nine ninety nine for a South no, Sea pearl. You would not. be talking about at the very minimum three figures, and that's just one piece of jewellery. Hello to you, Mandy in Derbyshire. I cannot believe what you're doing, JM. Amazing, isn't it? <laughs> it's a big day. It's a it's really a big day. day. Yeah. Um, I, I, I'm actually. Ross, have you got us in trouble for when we go off air? No comment. No, he's in trouble no. now, he says. OK, fair enough. Because I know there's a few people that, you know, big bosses in today. Yeah. £22.50 oh, yeah. on split pay. £22.50 on split pay. That's working out at, what, £7 something per item for your natural grandage, right? For your natural uh, South Sea Pearl, for the diamond encrusted bale, for the £7.50 for the chain, £7.50 for the slider bracelet, £7.50 for your tanzanite. We've still got over 300 in baskets. And in terms of quantity, how many do we have left? Um, okay, we're down to 177 from the over 500 quantity that we actually started with. But again, take another little look at the call screen. That might seem like loads. You might think that you've got time, you know, ah, oh, quickly go make myself a cup of tea. I'm going to rush this. 177 when you can see like Stacey's just bought three, um, Margaret's bought three, uh, another Margaret's bought two, Rita, Sadie, Linda, Suzanne in Norfolk's bought two, Gabrielle's bought two, Leah's bought two. Um, that quantity doesn't hang around when you see, when you see people multi-buying. And why wouldn't you? <coughs> Excuse me. Why wouldn't you multi-buy? Oh, he's back again. He's, a bit, he's losing his bounce though, isn't he? Close the auction. No. Let's move on, we're done, finished. No. Yeah, do you know what? Whatever Ross can do, I can do better. Oh, Give a me a minute clock. Competition now. Oh, yeah. Anything you can but do there's only 115 better. left, so you need to check I out. So that's what, um, the, this next price drop for the final few people, or is yep. it for everybody? For everybody. Yes, everybody, everybody pays everybody. that final. Everybody. Oh, that's a bit Rock your body. <laughs> Can Mark space? <laughs> Rock your body right. No. You're singing the Backstreet Boys. Yeah, I was, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, what's wrong with that? Mm. Are we ready? Are they checking out? Uh, this, is got, this is insane. I'm intrigued. Price. You can't go insane. much lower, though, surely. You're not going to go much. Not much. No, but any, uh, you know. But once every single one. He's, he's honestly, do you think he's like this at home? Oh, he's very in and out, in and out, in and out, in there. Just stand still, Wayne. <laughs> um, £22.50. It's nice, isn't it? It's lovely. It is lovely. Right. It's beautiful. Another minute. He's I've decided back. I'm going to go even lower than what I was going to go to. Another minute. Is it? I'm going to go even lower than no, what I was going to go to. This is a one auction opportunity, isn't it? If you this can't is, do yeah. it today, then when well, can you? This is true. Come on. The For all, price... all of your precious sterling I, silver. The price we're going to is... Ridiculous. Makes me a bit... Queasy. Bit, yeah. But, like I say, it's our birthday. Let's do it. Why not? We're going to sell them all. <gasps> what are they, what are they say? No, you don't want to know. You don't want to know. Oh, you yeah. don't want to know. <gasps> <gasps> look, at, look. That's the other shaped hands tonight. Look. Oh, yeah. Beautiful. You might get you might get that. You might get these. So it's either the hearts or uh, sorry, either that. the circles or the yeah. or the pairs. Here we go. There you go. Oh yeah. And there you go. So one of the other uh, one one of those shapes. Anyway, I, I'm distracting. Are we ready? <gasps> are we steady? I think we are. 
There are 101 of these boxes left. Ooh! Oh, look at the Labradorite. 78 pound on the nose. Ooh, Six pound 50 a component. Six and the box 50. is free. Oh, How about that? Oh my goodness me. Look at these. See that from here. Look. Yeah. That's just another sample of your Labradorite. You wouldn't, pay, you wouldn't pay £6.50 for <gasps> one of those, let alone the two. Look at the split pie. I know, £19.50 oh, pence are. only. For the final 100, that is interest fee. You pay that over four months, by the way. So it's £19.50 per month for the next wow. four months. That's awesome. That's got to be one of the best deals of jewellery maker history. Got to be. Sure. Got to be. For sure. The Jade Donut. Should I say this out loud? It's six pounds fifty. Yeah. <laughs> I can't uh, buy it for that. I can't buy that for six pounds fifty. That grand did you right? You know your favourite, your oh, treasured, your prize, your sure. baby grand did you right, Wayne? You've just taken to six pounds. Must 50. be a little diddy diddy tiny little diddy no, one, it's yeah. No, not diddy. It's definitely not diddy. Oh my! And look it's at translucent. Wow, that is epic. That should oh. be seventy-eight pounds. That's a that is six pounds fifty for this. The slider bracelet, six pounds. You know they're fourteen ninety nine to twenty nineteen ninety nine. Yeah, the it box just... clasps, box oh, clasps, wow. Mark. Fifteen pound each, something like that, aren't they? Yeah, it's I sterling think. silver. Yeah. yeah. Isn't the pearl like seventy, eighty pound? Yeah. Well, I was, I was just saying, if you saw that in Hatton Garden or Bond Street, you'd be talking hundreds of pounds just for the, yeah. just for this, oh, for the South Sea pearl. Imagine this for a Christmas present. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. That would be please. amazing. Just for the South Sea Pearl on its own. Have we got any left? Um, I hope so. Less than 100, we're down to the final double figure quantity. Do you want to see the exact quantity that we have on our screens? Oh, 87 wow. of these nice. remain. Uh, remember, we started with 500. Oh, diamonds, sterling silver, South Sea, tanzanite, nostalgic tanzanite. Mm. Calibrated stones, grand digurite, sterling silver spaces, type A jade. Eye. And listen, let's not let's not sort of uh, overlook that beautiful berry red very garnet. Very red. It is very red. It's gorgeous. Nineteen pound fifty today on your split oh, pay. Amazing. Is it any wonder that people are choosing to get twos, threes, fours, fives even? Um, hello to you, Sue. <laughs> are you sure it's your birthday? Feels more like mine. Thank you, JM. We love you. Mwah. Bless you. You're we love ace. you. You're all ace. That's the. That's oh, is that what, what are you doing? Just hugging. Oh, hands. just hugging. Oh yeah, that's the emoji Just apparently hands. for a hug. Yeah. Okay. It is the emoji for oh. a hug. <laughs> <laughs> Spoke about emojis earlier. What's your favourite emoji? Oh, I can't tell you. <laughs> Sorry, right. Mark went out and said what. Said I did. What. Yeah. <laughs> I've, no idea what, I've no idea what it is. What one? The aubergine. <laughs> I don't know what it is. I don't know what it is or what it means or... It's just everyone talks about it and I've no idea. <laughs> I really, oh. No, I don't use emojis. I love you, Mark. I so love you. If you don't know, then you are so, so wonderful and innocent and, and pure too. Uh, the final 46 oh. of these remain. The box alone. Incredible, isn't it? Is, I mean, you can see the luxury within the box. There's 44 alone. left. There's over 400 in baskets still. Over 400. Uh, uh, well, listen, that, that, that quantity is not hanging around oh, because you only have to look. Look at the yeah. top screen. So these are the latest people that have made their confirmations. So Essex oh, yes. yeah. on the app has just got two. Linda in Nottinghamshire just got three. Joan, County Atrium, just got three. Oh. June, Julie, just bought two. Caroline's gone up to six now. Don't blame me, Caroline. Yeah, well done. Um, you can see it literally it doesn't necessarily go in order, but every time it moves, there's people jumping through. Alice, Elspeth, there we go, and Perth and Kinross. Every time that screen moves, it's somebody else making a confirmation. Now, we are... Oh. About to cut to a break, so we're going to allow our call centre um, to, uh, to catch their breaths. Out of 500, Amazing. we've got 29 of these left. Well um, done, everyone. Well um, done. I'm over 400 with it still in baskets. If you've got a phone in your hand, don't let that put you off. Stay where you are. Our call centre will get to you. You have been. It'll be allocated on a first-come, first-served basis. Now, coming up after the break, we have a jewellery maker exclusive for connoisseurs. 
Tammy is joining me. Um, and Mark, I understand uh, you're sloping I'm, off. I'm discreetly grabbing something from my bag, if I have 30 seconds. Yes, no, that's fine. I was going to say, don't slope off just yet. No, 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 no. Um, you're a big fan. Ooh! This is what I've got coming up on Saturday. This is, this is, this is, this is the mermaid quartz. This is oh. some of the mermaid quartz that we've got coming up on Saturday. Oh, my goodness Saturday. me, Mark. That's amazing. So there's pinks, blues, yellows, greens, all sorts of colours. It's going to be the most incredible show. So that's our show on Saturday. Saturday, I cannot wait. I literally yeah. cannot wait. Yeah. Mark, we love you so Happy much. Happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. I hope Happy you're hanging birthday. around for cake. I have. I've got work to do upstairs with Hannah now. Here we go. Honestly. No stopping. No stopping. Honestly. Um, now, here it is coming up. Very special, unique to jewellery maker collaboration. <laughs> With the amazing connoisseurs and jewellery maker, the perfect kit, the essential kit for your, all of your, uh, your jewellery creations um, and also pieces existing within Love your box. So, um, me too. This is coming up after this. Happy birthday, jewellery maker! 12 years old. Can't believe it. Almost a teenager. Jewelry Makers, it's our 12th birthday, and to celebrate, we're giving you the chance to win the week. If you spend £20 or more across any of the days during the birthday event, you'll be entered into a prize draw. Now, every day, the presenters and designers will be adding all the best products into a hamper, and you could win all the goodies inside. Come and join the celebrations on Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Makers Nationwide Birthday Bash is now available on the website to purchase for just $79.99. We want the event to be as inclusive as possible, so we are catering for sea beaders, wire workers, and knotters. Alison Tarry will be hosting Scandalous Sea Beading in Liverpool. Claire McDonald will be hosting Whimsical Wirework in Solly Hull. And Mark Smith will be hosting Macrame Mayhem in Bracknell. Each location will unite via a video call to kick off the day before heading into an interactive workshop led by jewellery makers, expert designers. At lunchtime, there will be an opportunity for our attendees to swap their stashes, also to purchase goodies at discount prices. The afternoon will start with an energising quiz with sparkly prizes, plus then the completion of your workshop. Every attendee will receive a lucky jade kit worth £69.99, plus use of all of your tools, threading materials and essentials. And once you've placed your order, your workshop coordinator will be in touch to confirm the details of the day. So pop on over to our website, all the W's at jewelrymaker.com to book your place. to the next. Happy birthday to you guys at Jewelry Maker. I'd love for you guys to join me. Uh, this showcase is going to be bringing you uh, maybe a variety of jadeite that you've never seen before. It is of course type A jadeite, which is uh, the material that is 100% natural from Ketchin State in Myanmar, but this time it's lavender very very limited so you're gonna to have to be on extremely quick this material is very very valuable in the market right now because it comes from the skin of the jade out boulder but we'll be talking about that in the show and i hope you guys can join us
Hello everyone, I hope you're enjoying our week of birthday celebrations. On Saturday the 7th, wow, it's got an amazing lineup. My nine o'clock kits, the most beautiful sterling silver macrame slider bracelets. Deal of the day are the most spectacular five meter spools of sterling silver chain. And at 12 o'clock, I've got a brand new launch. Two words mermaid quartz. So that's Saturday the 7th of May, continuation of the amazing jewellery maker birthday celebrations. See you then. Welcome back, Jewellery Maker, and another very special guest. And it's been quite some time since I've seen this gorgeous lady, Tammy from Connoisseurs. Hi there. Hello, Hi. darling. How are you? Good. How are you? We were just trying to work out how long ago it's been. It's been a while. It's, it's going to be two while. years, because I was Just pregnant. shy of. You were. You were heavily pregnant. Yeah, very heavily, heavily pregnant. pregnant. Yes. But yes. Um, well, what an amazing collaboration and thank yes. you so much for agreeing. Oh, you're so welcome. It was our pleasure. So would you mind just quickly for those yep. people that uh, um, who maybe haven't heard of Connoisseurs as a brand, most people would, yep. can, of course, because it yep. is very much widely respected. Um, but what is Connoisseurs? So Connoisseurs is what we call a beauty treatment for jewellery. Um, it was created in the States in Boston by two brothers whose sole purpose was to create a cleaning product specifically for jewellery. Mm -hmm. So we've all heard the old wives tales from gin, you'd rather drink the gin than use it for your jewellery, yeah. <laughs> the fairy liquid, the, the, the tin foil, the toothpaste, but you know you can go to a supermarket and there's a whole aisle of cleaning product for your floor, for your windows, specific purpose and that's what connoisseurs set out to do. But not just a cleaning product, the premium cleaning product yeah so really um everything is created designed and formulated in the factory in boston in the states and the element that they do is if you see in terms of connoisseurs everything has almost a cosmetic look mm -hmm. so that's why they say it's your beauty treatments for your jewelry our jewelry is probably one of the most expensive possessions that we have yet we don't seem to look after it as much so as we true. would yeah, you know? it's so true. Um, people don't, you, you wear your jeans, you wash your jeans. Yeah. You wash your clothes, you wash your face, you put your makeup on. True. But how often does anyone actually really clean their jewellery? And if you think that it's with us all the time. Yeah, it's so true. Um, I can remember you saying that actually last time we were together and I was yeah. like, oh, definitely guilty. Yeah. Yeah. I am 100% <laughs> guilty of that. <laughs> Um, but what I found, and again, I'm thinking back some two years yeah, ago now, yep. I remember what I found really exciting about connoisseurs is the fact that you haven't got to have something that is specific to one metal type or one gemstone. That's it. So some, some uh, cleaning solutions are specifically for diamonds yes. or specifically for maybe, uh, um, well, you don't really get ones for pearls, whereas this is safe for them all. Safe for them all. So that's, I mean, within the connoisseurs family, there is obviously the ones that are relative to a specific use, mm -hmm. um, which will do a better job. So for example, you really heavily tarnish silver, yep. there is a silver cleaner. Yep. However, because it's all about busy lives on the go, the next step that connoisseurs went in terms of the evolution was to create something that was almost a a one size fits all that you could really use, take no time at all, and just really, really clean whatever it is you've got in your jewelry box. Um, I'm loving this because also I can see uh, three, well, some, some pretty important key facts there biodegradable, absolutely safe, non toxic. So you can use this with absolute uh, yeah, confidence. You can, absolutely. Um, I mean, you can even read on the back here that it is non toxic, people, pets and the environment. Well, that's amazing. So I think that's around the home. 
Yeah, absolutely amazing. Now, this is a, a, a collaboration which is exclusive. It is. Very exciting to our jewellery maker family. To our jewellery maker family, yes it is. So, with connoisseurs, we always talk about a two-step approach. So, mm -hmm. one that's going to clean your jewellery mm -hmm. and one that's going to give it that luster and also put an anti-tarnish layer. So, just to give you that extra length in between mm -hmm. the cleans. Yep. So, we partnered up with Jewellery Maker to give you the two products but then jewelry maker's got a little something extra as well. Now I'm gonna I, I'm gonna show you this because it's so exciting. Comes perfectly packaged like this, which I love. Look how beautiful that is. Um, absolutely beautiful. So if I just for a second remove this ribbon, lift up that gorgeous box. Here is that little extra something that Tammy was talking about. Jewelry Maker Pro, the specialist's choice. Now, I'm gonna come back to that if I can. Yep. I'm gonna leave that just teasing you to one side because inside, I mean, this is, again, you can see the quality of connoisseurs. Um, literally perfectly packaged. You have two um, of connoisseurs' amazing products, which are, and, and Tammy, I'll lead, uh, I'll let you explain what they do. One's yep. the foam and one's the wipes. That's right. So your foam that you've got there, so if I've got my one here, it's exactly the same. So your foam is your cleaner. So like you were talking about earlier, you can see on the front, it's literally, it is an all purpose cleaner. Mm -hmm. So the beauty of that is it does, I've got a wide array here, um, everything from silver that is oxidized silver. So I know a lot of your fashion brands, your Pandora bracelets, Thomas Sabo, they come quite hip, um, that's Thomas Sabo. They are oxidized intentionally. Yeah. So the last thing you want to do is to dip that and remove that oxidization. Yeah. Um, pearls, emeralds, all of your softer stones, all of those things that we shouldn't clean yep. in the traditional sense of the word. So this is going to clean it. And then you've got your wipes, which are of course the dry wipes. Um, they are not wet. A lot of people say, oh goodness, they're not wet. But they are little dry wipes here. There's 25 of them in a pack and they are then impregnated with not only an additional cleaning solution, but a polish that's going to put an anti-tarnish layer onto the jewellery. So just to extend that lifespan in between your cleaning. So actually doing that process, the cleaning and then the, 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 the wipes polishing. afterward, it's a process, you know, that's but a it. bit like we would cleanse and tone Correct. and moisturise, you do this in that order Exactly well. that, exactly that. Perfect. So we have a couple of items here that we can demonstrate for you. Should, should we reveal now what this is? You can, you can reveal that. So how gorgeous, now again, exclusive to you all, comes within the pack, and as you can see, Jewelry Maker Pro, the specialist choice. Now if I turn it round, you can see, you have a little bit of a, a product card just there, information. Yep. But if I just open this up, you can see your exclusive jewellery maker cleaning cloth. That's it. Amazing. That's it. Because yep. our wonderful viewers, they obviously have jewellery, which yes. they'll, they'll want to keep clean, but also That's their it. creations. Yes. You know, it's really important to look after those. Yep. Anyway, so this is a little bit extra bonus, you said. Extra bonus. In your, in your pack. Yep. Um, and again, you've got some directions just there. Over yep. to you, Tammy, because I think yep. you were about to show us the, yes. so the, the cloth, process. The jewellery maker cloth, um, just for your viewers, is it is the double cleaning sides of the cloth. Uh -huh. So you've got the one side, again, which cleans, which is impregnated with the cleaning. Mm -hmm. And then you have the second side, which polishes and protects. Yep. So it's a smaller version, basically, of the cloth that I'm using here today. Okay. So we will start off. Is there something here that you like the look of what shall we go Ooh, for here um, i don't i mean You've any of the ricky around there well let's go for a, well let's do let's let's show a before first yes, so yes. which one should we show that right yes. yeah let's show that so let's show a, a before there mm -hmm. okay so looking Lovely. there right so what we're going to do we don't need to wet the product can at i all sorry let me just show it again yes that's okay just so everybody can we're going to 
There we, I mean, it looks beautiful. It looks beautiful. Looks yes. absolutely gorgeous. But if you look around the sides and you look within the grooves and within the settings, that's where you're going to find that build up. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. A bit of dust gathering. Yep. Yep. Okay. Let's pass okay. that back. Okay. Thank I you. I think it's going to look brand new yes. after you've had your hands on it. So what's nice with the foam is you get at least 200 pumps of mm -hmm. the foam per bottle. So it really is good value for money. Yep. And it doesn't take a lot to do the job. So because it's a foaming solution, you literally pop it on top of the item and you can just leave it to do its thing. Okay. So, so you just so leave that fizz away? Leave that to fizz away so the foam is doing all of the work. Uh -huh. So the little bubbles are getting in there and obviously the solution is got its cleaning mechanism inside and you can see how it's oh, yes. bubbling and fizzing there. Yeah. Is that sort of reacting to the dirt? That's it. That's okay. It. So it's just building away. This is where we, 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 we find out, you know, yeah, I mean, it does naturally gather, doesn't it? it Dust does. and dirt. Absolutely. And a lot of people are horrified by the state of what it looks like, yeah. you know, but it, it is, it's just natural elements day that of day. day to day, that's all it is. It's Even, do you know, there was a lady that I used to work with in the jewellers and she um, had lots of beautiful diamond rings and hers used to look all constantly dirty because of soap. Yeah, that's it. Soap used to just build up. So many of us don't take off when we wash our hands. Yeah, I'm guilty. Because, you, you know, we, we've all heard somebody who's left it on the side of the mm. basin. So we, they don't do it for fear of that happening. Yep. So then it is full of soap and full of hand cream. Yeah. Because you wash your hands and then you put your hand cream on. Yeah, totally. So, fizzing right. Fizzing away. Fizzing away. So 30 to 60 seconds obviously depends on how dirty it is, how much um, dust and particles are ingrained in there. Now, you can even see oh, just straight away. straight away without doing anything else how that lao looks just from sitting there in that foam. And that's just one step. Wow, so there's the before and after look. Yep. So that's just yeah, the first away, step. Yeah, straight the diamonds are brighter. Brighter, that's it. And because you've now gone inside those little settings, so you're allowing that light to radiate through. So from there, just simply dip it off, plain water, Mm -hmm. Doesn't need to be warm, doesn't need to be cold. It's up to you, just whatever straight out, out the, the tap. Whatever comes out the tap. And then we're going to dry it off, obviously on the lint-free cloth, which you will now have in your Jewelry Maker gift set. And then this is our side there. Okay, just, so you use the cloth before you use so the So I'm just drying it off slightly so that I can get the full effects here of our wipes. Okay. So then with the wipes, you'll have a look here. And as I rub it, you can see what's coming wow. there. Wow. So we are giving it all along there. Now, obviously, this is a platinum ring. So in terms of scratches, obviously, that's not going to help. What it does do is it does leave a slight filament that allows those scratches to look less noticeable. Yeah. So. Oh my goodness me. And we see that there. Okay, if we just hold that super still, there we go. Amazing. It literally looks brand new. Yeah. Wow. All in a few seconds. In a few seconds. All in a few seconds. So that oh, we have wow. there. So that's in your platinum. <clears throat> well, let's. There's a few of you queuing up for this, so let's get the auction open, everybody. We've got 300, and then we'll have some more fun. Yep. Um, clean them. Now they are limited edition. You get this beautiful pack with connoisseurs. 25 gone in less than 10 seconds. Excellent. Yeah, it speaks volumes, doesn't it? Um, plus, then you get your amazing. Uh, cloth as well for specifically polishing as well limited edition there were 300 of these available I want one of these desperately <laughs> because uh, I'll be honest I've, I've had probably the same cleaning solution under my cup uh, my kitchen cupboard for far too long yes. um, and it looks dirtier than yeah, probably most, the most people <laughs> have that, that situation do not worry yes yes 
Yeah. Um, but yeah, again, yeah, every time a connoisseur comes to it, it always flies out though, Tammy, yeah. doesn't it? Yeah, it's, it's something that people do trust. Um, so as I said, it is the premium of the jewellery cleaning solutions mm -hmm. and people have come to recognise, number one, the red. Um, yeah. and uh, you know the, the the look and the feel that whole cosmetic beauty and again I need to mention this is not just for diamonds because no. actually many people think that it is always a question how do I clean it yeah you know how do I clean exactly. my fluorites how do I clean my pearls you can yes. clean those gemstones with with, with connoisseurs because they that which I don't That's know it. for any other no. any other brand where you can do that no, no. that's amazing that's it it's that it's that's that that gentle that gentle so it it really is you can see it so even on your fashion jewelry which you know a lot of it is plated yeah so it's it really can go from one end of the spectrum through to the other end mm -hmm. of the spectrum absolutely um so well um hello to Chantal in suffolk she's saying i love connoisseur's products uh, once I tried them, I haven't gone back to my old cleaners. One dry wipe does loads of pieces. Absolutely. Lovely. Um, and, and yeah, there was a time when we used to actually have, it was probably following our last show together, <laughs> and there was like a little a little pack of connoisseurs next to me, and I was just, just, like, just have, have a, a good wipe. sparkle before yeah, you don't. went on. And you would be horrified at how grubby yeah. they get. They yes, do get. They do. They do. But it's it's natural because, as I said, it's it's with us all the time. Yeah, we don't in, even realise it. It's in it. the sink it is. when you're washing up. Yeah, washing in up. the garden. Exactly. Oh, that's true. I do that as well. <laughs> I do that. Pop my plant, pot, potting plants with all my jewellery <laughs> on. Um, now, we're not stopping at 99.99. Not stopping there. It's a birthday special. Yep. The whole set, limited edition, comes with the uh, specialist jewellery making class. Forty-nine pounds and ninety-nine pence, and you said what? Two hundred? Yeah, two hundred pumps of your foam. Wow! So it really does last you a long time. The the wipes, as there are twenty-five of them, and and that's not finished. No. So you can utilise that over and over yeah, again. Yeah, pop it back in. That's it. So you pop it back in, use it the next time, and the beauty of those as well is because it does look like a something cosmetic -y. pop it in your handbag and take it with you yeah totally. so it's really on the go solution as well <clears throat> um, it's just it's just dawned on me as well tammy that the fact that this because it is like a pump dispenser yep. you're not dropping the dirt no. into the solution no. are you that's it so as you said the jar underneath your sink is it, probably yeah, dirtier than the jewellery and that's what happens gross. with your traditional cleaning solutions. Yes, there is still a need for them, mm. but this, because it's giving you that multifaceted, you don't want to mix if it's taking off tarnish, if it's taking mm -hmm. off just plain dust. So that is giving you that option of just keeping it onto the jewellery and not putting it into the cleaning solution. So shall we, shall we clean a couple more pieces yes, then? Yes, let's for kicks? clean I something else. I never thought cleaning else. could be so satisfying. Oh, it really um, it By really the way, is. we are not stopping here. Not stopping at £49.99 pence again. We have 300 quantity. We have to stagger the auction. This is going to be not only for your jewellery collection, you know, your exi you know, the ones that maybe you've had for many years or, or you purchased, but for your jewellery makes as well. So so this will work for your silver wires. I mean, Debbie, you're you're with us, my darling. Hello. Um, you know, silver wires and things like that. I'm sorry, I'm throwing to you, and and you probably weren't, you weren't you weren't expecting me. Your mic's not on. Don't worry. But you'd use this with wire work, right? Yeah. Yeah. Can you hear me? No, you have to shout. Um, yeah, I've got my connoisseur cloth, and I wouldn't use any other brand. There we go. Lovely. That's our lovely Debbie. That's Kershaw. our lovely Debbie. Thank you. Um, <laughs> it is, and I agree with the jewellers that I worked at some twenty odd years ago. It was connoisseurs. That's it. The that's, it. that's how long it's been going for. It mm -hmm. really has. Mm -hmm. So it's it is a tried and tested and and well loved product. Yeah, respected. That's okay, it. let's do. Some so things. here we've got so some silver something that is oxidized something that is looking if we tarnished. keep it still just for a second so we can do a before and after so we can show everybody there we go lovely just adam will tell me when okay there we, there go. we go right so we're just so going satisfying to, is so satisfying so I'm not concerned about the stones. I'm not concerned about the oxidization. I'm not concerned about the abalone that's in there. I am just popping 
It's amazing um, that you can use this with every single gemstone. Every you know, single. You pearls you wouldn't dream of putting in some no. solutions. And the beauty with the pearls is what a lot of people, not a lot of people, what part of the problem is, obviously, because of the, um, the stringing, because of the, you can't get the string wet. Yeah. With this, you do not have to wash it off. So if you're cleaning your pearls, you can pop it on, let it do its thing, and then just wipe it off with your cloth. Amazing. So you're not saturating. No, yeah, exactly. It's not being soaked. No. Which no. then is going to potentially cause stretching. That's it. Uh -huh. That's it. All yep. those things. Yep. Straight away, I can see a difference. You can straight away see that. Straight, you can see that difference immediately. Um, I, 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 I need to get these des desperately. It's one of those just desperate to clean all your lovely jewellery, aren't you? <laughs> Whenever uh, you see this action, nobody is paying forty nine ninety nine. We had three hundred of these available, so it goes a long way. It I mean, does that go was a, a long way. Pendant. Today, yep. limited edition, two jewellery maker, and we're not even stopping at thirty nine ninety nine. So it comes with that three step process. It does. It does completely. So it gives you all of the steps to your cleaning products. I know, Tammy, there's going to be our sister channel watching right now going, oh, we want one of those. Yeah, totally. <laughs> I know there will be presenters literally step off air going, literally glued to the screens right now watching this because you know, we, I, I can't be the only person that's guilty of, uh, of not cleaning their jewellery no, frequently. No, not at all. Not um, at as all. As we should. Look at that, just dipping it off, rinsing it off, and that's silver. That's, that's silver. Silver, it's oxidized, so you can see already how clean that is compared the fact that it to what take it the was. Oxidization off. No. Wow. Okay. So again, I'm just going to Next take process. my cloth. Just dry it off. It can be any lint-free cloth. Okay. So it doesn't have to be, but obviously the jewelry makers are going to get their jewelry maker cloth in yes. there. So it just really is the added benefit for them. Uh huh. And then we're going to go with our wipe. So this is what gives you a, a sort of almost a, a pigment, not pigment, anti-tarnish anti -tarnish layer. layer. So you can see now how that. Wow. So again, obviously you can see the scratches in there, but in terms of the cleanliness, and there you can see. Yeah, that's that's incredible. So that really gives you there. And if we go to the little oxidized disc here. And we just give him a little sparkle with that. It makes such a difference, doesn't it, to it your jewelry? It really, really does. It really does. Oh, wow. Well, yeah, and I can see the abalone now. At yeah. first, I wasn't sure where you were. Oh, yeah, yeah, in the actual in wings. In little itself. wings there. There's the abalone, yeah. Um, £29.99 pence only to get hold of these. Wow, and, and you get everything here. Uh, so it's a one off collaboration. One-off collaboration between connoisseurs and jewellery makers. Well, it, well, we're delighted to have you. Birthday I, present. A little birthday present deal. And it's super important. You know, you're right. You know, we, we invest in our jewellery. We take time That's to it. create it. You know, it's, we should be looking after it as well. We should. We should. I remember the first time, when, you know, when, uh, not long after my husband proposed to me, literally I wouldn't, I wouldn't do anything. Yeah. I was like literally walking around like, okay, just... just Take it, like you said, taking the ring <laughs> off and everything. Off, and then it. all of a sudden you're like, well, come on. Yeah, you, just you can't it. do that. You can't, you can't do that do for the that. rest of your life. It's not no. practical. No, it's not but practical. But at the same time also, I need to have the cleaning solutions too. Because I'm sure if I took these off, if I actually did this test, it would be quite horrifying. <laughs> um, but that's just life, isn't that it? Is like it. you said. It's that's just part of it. I mean, the thing is as well, with this product that you've got, you don't have to even use... The foam all the time as I said the little wipes pop in your handbag take them with you as you go as you say you never know when you might just need a little quick polish up so if you take just a plain yellow gold band now so we've had the different metals but can you see oh my gosh that was instant <laughs> instant so you can see straight away what's coming off there if I turn it around you can see how dull yeah yeah that yeah. is and um, Literally, oh, I'm intrigued. I'm gonna have a go. Two seconds, can I have you a go? can have a go. There we go. Okay, there we are. There we go. So you can see it's dry. It's yeah, literally 29 pounds. Oh, I'm, this is gonna be awful because I, I like I literally haven't cleaned. <laughs> 
<laughs> really absolutely ages. <laughs> Twenty nine ninety nine, and like you said, the pump is what two hundred yep. dispensers. That's it. These cloths could potentially look at that. It's come up brand new. Brand it's what new. you would actually imagine <laughs> to see in the jewelry shop. shop. That's it. Oh That's gosh, it. look at that. <laughs> this is a. Uh, Hmm. Remember, it's tarnish as well. It's okay. not just dirt. Not people just, are I'm horrified. Just not, I'm just not ultra grubby. Yeah, you know, when people see that, they are absolutely <laughs> horrified. But it is tarnish that is on there. Okay. Oh my goodness me! I don't think I've ever seen it look so sparkly. Look at that. And that's just here for a couple of seconds in your Literally studio a of, without even using without the foam. even using the foam. Now, if you added the foam to that step. Yeah, it's going to come all the, it's, uh, all the yep. more. Now, you know what? Twenty nine ninety nine for the whole set is amazing. But it is the birthday. It is a birthday. And I understand, Tammy, you have agreed something extra special. Um, extra birthday savings. In 60 seconds, we're going to take it to your final limited edition collaboration between the amazing brand that is Connoisseurs and Jewelry Maker. And it includes this beautiful gift box, your jewelry making cloth, which is, I mean, yeah, you, they're always here. They're always next to me in the studio. So like if ever we have a particular stone that might have a big fingerprint on it. and things like That's that. It. Especially, as you said, your jewelry makers who are actually creating their jewellery at home. Yeah. It's, it's an ideal quick polish with your jewellery maker cloth before it goes out, before you gift box it up, just to make sure that those fingerprints are off and give it that additional anti-tarnish. Well, absolutely. I suppose, if, especially if you're doing things like, gosh, my hands now. Um, you, if you are actually silver smithing and That's things it. like that, it's going to yep. pick up rouge, I guess, it gathers, yep. doesn't it? Yeah. This should be your last process of when you make a silver piece of jewellery. Uh-huh. So after you put it in the, you know, the pickle, you polished it, you, maybe you put it in your ultrasonic cleaner, then you want to polish it with this. That's what I do every time. It's my very last stage. Oh. <laughs> She's a right rotter. <laughs> what a rotter. <laughs> yeah, it is, that is off my jewellery, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> you can clean pearls, absolutely. Is there anything you can. I can't clean with this? No. Nothing. Nothing. Any gemstone. Any gemstone from pearls, as we said. So from the top end of the spectrum. Opal. Right down. You can clean your opals. You can clean your emeralds. emeralds anything. Your softer stones. Your hard Florals. stones. All of it. That's amazing. And I've never known a, a, a you know a product where you can literally say that. No. It cleans absolutely That's everything. Absolutely and all metals. everything. It's all on there for you. Amazing. And on top of that. Oh, they're all sparkly now. You can have a... Oh! Smell, <coughs> smell that. Oh, it smells lovely. It smells lovely. And it is completely harmless. So it's not one of those, you know... So if I literally rub that yeah, in your yeah. skin, it wouldn't do anything? No, it doesn't do anything. <laughs> it's actually... <laughs> it smells beautiful. Yeah. yeah. It's like a fragrance. It's like a soft fragrance, so it doesn't have that pungent smell that no. a lot of your traditional cleaners have. So it just shows you, for, from what we've just done here, in terms of it being biodegradable, in terms of it being safe for everybody around the house, including your pets, including the environment. Well, that's, I mean, that's really important, and that's one of the things I actually zoned in on, the fact that this is, yep. you know, something that... If, if heaven forbid, you That's know, uh, children, animals or anything like yep. that did get hold of it, then yep. um, it's not going to cause them any harm. No. Um, over 100 in baskets for the final, how many? 60 left. Wow. Um, so we had 300 and this was literally exclusive for your birthday deal. Again, for all of your silver smithing, and we were going to be doing some uh, wonderful uh, smithing with our lovely Debbie in the next hour. Um, in your masterclass, that's going to be incredible. But also things down to copper sheets it's going to work with. Yep. Um, all of your engraving and, I mean, uh, all your wire work. You, I mean, it speaks volumes if Debbie is, uh, is literally saying, this is the only brand that I will actually gravitate to. That speaks volumes. It's, yeah, and it doesn't harm anything, which is what I really like. And uh, the smell is important. And it's not going to affect your, your metal afterwards. Yeah. 
yeah, negatively, which some of the solutions do. I'd never say to put it in some solutions, but th this one is so kind to you. Yeah, family. yeah, and certainly gemstones as well. Yeah. The fact I can literally put this directly onto a pearl. Yes. Is amazing. Yes. Oh, Tammy, thank you so much. You it's are so, so wonderful welcome. to see you again. Thank you, and you. Um, we have just 50, did you say? Less than 50 now, as you can Excellent. see. Very well, popular amongst our viewers. Lovely. There's rows upon rows of you. If you've got it in your baskets, you will need to check it out because literally, as soon as we cut to a break, I'm running out to get mine because <laughs> <laughs> I need. <laughs> clearly, I needed it as well um, <laughs> to keep. Uh, yeah, to keep everything. You buy these beautiful treasures. You make these beautiful treasures. You want them to always you look your best. You want to look after them. You want them to really stand out. Yeah. It is part of our outfit. It's part of our statement. You want people to stop and say. Wow, I love your ring. That's yeah. what we do it for. Not go, yeah. Yeah, it, you <laughs> don't want your jewellery to be insignificant on your body. Absolutely. It needs to be there for sentimental reason, for precious reasons. Want it to stand out. Oh, Tammy, you're wonderful. It's so lovely to see Thank you again. Thank you. It's so lovely to be here. We hope to see you again very, Thank very, you. very soon. Thank you. Tammy from Connors. Thank you, everybody. everybody. But do not go anywhere because coming up after the break, final hour of your birthday celebration, and we have an absolute radiant beauty <laughs> with so much talent. I could only dream. It's the gorgeous. <laughs> Look at that lovely face. It's Debbie Kershaw coming up after the break <laughs> for your masterclass. Jewellery Makers Nationwide Birthday Bash is now available on the website to purchase for just £79.99. We want the event to be as inclusive as possible, so we are catering for sea beaders, wire workers and knotters. Alison Tarry will be hosting Scandalous Sea Beading in Liverpool. Claire MacDonald will be hosting Whimsical Wirework in Solly Hull. And Mark Smith will be hosting Macrame Mayhem in Bracknell. Each location will unite via a video call to kick off the day before heading into an interactive workshop led by jewellery makers, expert designers. At lunchtime, there will be an opportunity for our attendees to swap their stashes, also to purchase goodies at discount prices. The afternoon will start with an energising quiz with sparkly prizes, plus then the completion of your workshop. Every attendee will receive a lucky jade kit worth £69.99, plus use of all of your tools, threading materials and essentials. And once you've placed your order, your workshop coordinator will be in touch to confirm the details of the day. So pop on over to our website, all the W's at jewelrymaker.com to book your place. Happy birthday to you guys at Jewelry Maker. I'd love for you guys to join me. Uh, this showcase is going to be bringing you uh, maybe a variety of jadeite that you've never seen before. It is of course Taipei jadeite, which is uh, the material that is 100% natural from Kachin State in Myanmar, but this time it's lavender. Very, very limited, so you're going to have to be on extremely quick. This material is very, very valuable in the market right now because it comes from the skin of the jade out boulder, but we'll be talking about that in the show and I hope you guys can join us. Jewelry makers, it is your 12th birthday. I wanted to say happy birthday to everyone. 12 years of jewelry making chaos. Most importantly, for everyone that's been watching for the last 12 years, happy birthday to you guys. But more importantly, I just wanted to say happy birthday to Jewelry Maker. It has been an absolutely amazing 
dozen of years that we have had and may it long continue. For everyone that's watching over the next few days, just sit back, relax and enjoy some of the ridiculous birthday deals that we have for you. But nonetheless, I wish you all a fabulous birthday period here at Jewelry Maker. And once again, 12 years of absolutely beautiful jewelry. Look at that, it's amazing. So I can You've done the mala necklace and everything. <laughs> um, <laughs> <laughs> Seriously, that is absolutely incredible. Well, of course, I, I mean, I feel like, Scott, yeah. you should be oh. here right now. Come on. They see enough of me. No, we don't. You say they see enough of me. I feel like you should be here because 12 amazing, amazing <laughs> years. <laughs> This is the, I mean, just a fraction of the jewelry maker crew. Hello. Hello. I'm going to duck down. There we are. Um, oh, sorry, I'm Claire. Gonna, I, I, I am most certainly not cutting that cake. I am not having that. No, I think Emily, who yeah, made Emily, the cake, is going to do it. Yeah, the amazing Emily made this cake. If you can see, Emily is only hiding behind the balloons. Oh, she's here. Yeah. She is. Yeah. 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 It is incredible. Thank you so much for doing it. Thank I've never seen anything like that cake no. before. I'm speechless. No words. Like, it literally looks like leather. Doesn't it? Yeah. want to eat it. <laughs> I'm sure it will taste delicious. Mm. Yeah. I'm, I'm, no doubt. No doubt at all. But 12 years. As if. Where did that, where did that time go? Flown by. Flown by. It really has. And it's been 12 wonderful years as well. And I'm sure here's to the next 12. 12. 24. 24. <laughs> what cake are we having for 24 years? You might then have to wheel us on screen, though. <laughs> Can you imagine that if you've still got the same crew? Because none of us go. That's the thing. Um, well, I think it's time to cut the cake, isn't it? Oh, yeah. Let's go for it, Emily. Come Let's on. do it. Um, Nobody else can do this. There we are. Little <laughs> shuffle, little shuffle. I'm squatting down so you can see everybody behind. Now, um, yes. We need you to cut the cake. Okay, I've got a plate ready. Uh-huh. I might need a bigger plate. There's a lot of us here. Yes, there is. <laughs> There's loads of us here. We can divvy so, it out afterwards. Does anybody like chocolate sponge? Yes. yes. Hey, that's what we like to hear. So I'm just going to take... <laughs> I like the chorus of... Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Do we like chocolate? Unless we said no. Put back <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I cake. Where should we go? Should we go for, for, go for a shoulder? Oh, yeah. why not? Wherever. Oh, Look at this. Can we go? Oh, are we going to sing happy birthday? Yeah, we should really. Ready? Yeah. Happy, happy birthday, birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear jewelry maker. Happy birthday to you. That is some <laughs> slice. Okay. Oh, wow. That's amazing. That's my bit. What are the <laughs> <laughs> If I go this way, oh. there's a technique to it. Do you want me to support the board, maybe? That was really go wrong. Put into it. Oh, gosh. Don't drop it. <laughs> <laughs> it is a work of art. Oh, it's oh. <laughs> oh, that looks immense. Oh, look at that. Go on, I'll have a bite. I mean, so I'll wait till afterwards for this. I'll see you later. <laughs> <laughs> Emily, absolutely incredible. Wow. You've still got more to bring, haven't you, Al? Yeah, we still have. We've still got an amazing masterclass with Debbie Kershaw. Fantastic. Hello, Debbie. I'm, She's showing, I'm showing how to set confetti into bezels. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, there'll be a lot of confetti sweeping. A bit of cake squished yeah. in the top. Yeah, That's all right. It's all good. It's all good. That cannon was very loud. Oh, no. Sorry, I should have warned you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we've got a message coming through. Um, can I see it? 
There we go. Wow. Well done, lovely Emily, says yeah. Surrey. Oh. Yeah. I know. Wow. <laughs> I, try, I, I mentioned actually cake making the other day. I, tr I attempted one of my, my little girl's birthday cakes. Never again. My unicorn looked like a puddle. <laughs> so that really is a work of art. It is, it's incredible. It's amazing. It's, it's definitely yeah. definitely. <laughs> <laughs> My unicorn melted. Let's just put it that way. Okay, just the icing. Just the icing. The icing. The icing. It was it's a hot a, day. It was a thought. It was a thought. It was, it was, Literally, she still has delicious. nightmares about it now. It's a delicious puddle. <laughs> Not really. <laughs> <laughs> Not so much. Well, what do we do now, Scott? Masterclass. Masterclass with Debbie Kershaw. Yeah, look, yeah. look, look, yeah. Weaving you don't confetti often, into jewellery. You don't <laughs> often see happened. these lovely faces, but they are the very heartbeat of the jewellery maker family that Everyone's keep... Everyone's escaping now. Yeah, that keep this wonderful channel on our screen. So, well done, jewellery maker team. Bye, everyone. Bye. They're awesome. They really are awesome. Caroline, and I do notice you stand at the very back. One day I'll get her on air. One day. Now, I tell you what, we're just going to cut to a little break so we can just get rid of the oh, confetti. Um, Hello, everyone. I'm waiting in an ordinary queue. <laughs> Such a British thing to do. <laughs> <laughs>Happy birthday to you guys at Jewelry Maker. I'd love for you guys to join me. Uh, this showcase is going to be bringing you uh, maybe a variety of jadeite that you've never seen before. It is, of course, type A jadeite, which is uh, the material that is 100% natural from Ketchin State in Myanmar, but this time it's lavender. Very, very limited, so you're going to have to be on extremely quick. This material is very, very valuable in the market right now because it comes from the skin of the jade out boulder. But we'll be talking about that in the show, and I hope you guys can join us. jewelry maker 12 years 12 days of fun it's going to be amazing jewelry makers nationwide birthday bash is now available on the website to purchase for just 79.99 we want the event to be as inclusive as possible so we are catering for sea beaders wire workers and knotters Alison Tarry will be hosting Scandalous Sea Beading in Liverpool. Claire McDonald will be hosting Whimsical Wirework in Solly Hull. And Mark Smith will be hosting Macrame Mayhem in Bracknell. Each location will unite via a video call to kick off the day before heading into an interactive workshop led by jewellery makers, expert designers. At lunchtime, there will be an opportunity for our attendees to swap their stashes, also to purchase goodies at discount prices. The afternoon will start with an energising quiz with sparkly prizes, plus then the completion of your workshop. Every attendee will receive a lucky jade kit worth £69.99, plus use of all of your tools threading materials and essentials. And once you've placed your order, your workshop coordinator will be in touch to confirm the details of the day. So pop on over to our website, all the W's at jewelrymaker.com to book your place. My goodness, and I just realised who Emily was. Yeah, I know. She's not even a professional cake maker, she's a Gemporio presenter. Yeah, she, works on, she presents on Gem Collector. That is the most amazing cake. Yeah, she did it. last minute too. And she's bringing us the pieces now. Yay! Right? I love okay. her more now for bringing cake. Do you know who else I love?
this gorgeous lady. Um. You're like a ray of sunshine, <laughs> are Deb. Oh my goodness me. Oh, I love these, you know, very elegant, very sophisticated. Um, if you have a look and see that not many places do these, you know, I think we're a bit cutting edge. Yeah. Um, donut settings. So they're those beautiful settings that you put a chain straight through and they kind of move. So I've set one at a time, but you could put three on if you wanted to but i was saying in my social media i think the beauty of these is in the simplicity yeah in the elegance and That's the beauty gorgeous. of a donut setting is you can get different size gemstones in here just with a few little tweaks which i'm going to show you look at that i love it i love that that's my kind of jewelry that is you, and you can stack it uh, ultra high end yeah it does ultra it? ultra high end um, we've got three kits to bring you in three different colours. So if you're a silver or a rose or a yellow, we'll start with a the silver. They all come with three of the stones. Yes. And three of the donuts. Yes. And chain. Yeah. So you can make three necklaces. Yes, yeah. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. yes. So let me just show you. In the stones in the silver kit, you've got Ratnakiri Zircon. Yes which I put in the silver because I thought it looked like a diamond. It will, yeah, but it's rarer. It's shinier. More refractive, more fiery. Look at the quality I of know. that Ratnakiri Zircon. It's beautiful. Which is like, by the way, Mogok to a ruby, Ratnakiri. It's, it, it's considered the best in the world. Wow. Rajasthan garnet and then a Sakota emerald. Woo! That's us leaning on the desk. The break's not on. All right. <laughs> We end up in the gem studio. Yeah, Ooh. literally. Can you imagine? Um, oh my goodness me! Then the star of the show, really. Oh, do you want to show me the gemstones first? Let's show you the stones. Which stones you're actually getting? They're all available on pre-order, so you can check out. Um, in the rose, you're getting a rose de Maroc. How rare! It's currently not even being oh, mined. It's so beautiful. The Isn't color. It? The color of it. Isn't it? Um, citrine, these are flipped over by the way, sorry, then you've, uh, sorry, Peridot, and then you've got Ratnakiri, they have been flipped over on those, and then in the gold colour, oh my goodness, I, I think I can tell you, you've got Ratnakiri Zircon, Rose de Maroc, and I think that last one, could be Demantoid. Praise the light. Um, mm -hmm. What is it? Kyanite? Really? I didn't know Never that. in a million years would I have guessed that. No, me neither. I'd have been so far off guessing Kyanite. Oh my goodness. So there we go. There are the stones. They all come. They are all natural, by the way, those three. Um, they're all available on pre-order. You can shop ahead. We're going to start with the silver kits. Now, I tell you what, you don't just get a little bit of chain here, do you? No, you get three different uh, lengths of chain. And the great thing about this is the beauty of them is they sort of float. So you just pop the chain through the two holes in the mount mm -hmm. and they just float float they're so elegant and beautiful so beautiful mm -hmm. three different styles of chain um and this is the same by the way the same links um in uh in your different colors so if you are a silverware then i would be dialing through nice and early the only way to get hold of the gemstones is uh, within uh, debbie's masterclass kit three chains all of which measure 18 inches 18 inches you get your three four millimeter stones um, and you're getting those lovely little donuts which would you mind debbie just explaining how 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 these work um, yeah. in fact you're going to dive into the demo aren't you well there's um sort of three seats inside that little donut which means that i've managed to set um, a three mil and a four mil into there and you could possibly set a larger stone so one of those you'll be able to just set straight in you might need to use a setting burr but i'll go through that if you want to do the next size up so they're actually designed so that you can set different size stones depending on what, on what you know within reason um and if you look inside you'll see the little setting and then mm -hmm. it's just a rub over setting mm -hmm. so 
you just um, set the stone in a rub over way, which I'll show you, um, and it's got enough room at the back to just pop your chain through. So that's why when you said about floating, it's lit it is floating, it's floating almost within. on the chain. Very high end, um, yeah. very, very elegant. I tend to go with my jewellery either really statement or really small and elegant, and I yeah. really love this design. Me too. Oh, the beautiful, beautiful kit and so much precious metal, such high-end gemstones. Yep. Um, and here you can see Debbie's amazing finished creation. There it is. So you, yeah, I mean, look at that. But you could make that three times over with different gemstones, couldn't you? Absolutely. Um, you've got the gemstones to choose from, or maybe you've got some already in your stash, some three mils that you'd like to set um, as well, or instead of, you can certainly do that. Wow. Um, so the kit's basically the same components, maybe slight variation on your gemstones, but with your different precious metals. Today, £59.99. pence. So that means you can make three ultra high end, as you just said, yep. necklaces, yep. genuine gemstone necklaces for twenty pound each. That will do. That's madness. It's, it is because it. I mean, I suppose if I was selling this on my uh, stall to be competitive, I'd probably sell it for about forty pounds. Gosh, well, I think that's a very good price. I know, but you know, you could, depending where you are, if you are a very high end craft fair, you could sell them for more. But remember, if you undersell your pieces, you undersell your reputation, you undersell what you've made. So, I mean, you probably make, you would can make your money back on one. Really yeah, sorry, can't you? Absolutely. Um, they're so beautiful, and I'm really intrigued. I've never seen this donut setting before. No, um, I have seen them, not work with them, um, but only in one other place, um, and it's sort of quite a high end jeweler's supplier. So. Um, it's not something that I've seen across the board anywhere. Also, you've got the plated versions, whereas you usually get these in your golds. Um, and of course, if you're buying it in solid gold, well, for me, it's out of my price range. So this is gold plated sterling silver, rose gold plated sterling silver and sterling silver. So you've got the benefit of having that wonderful color without the price tag to match for the gold and the rose gold. Um, you, your jaw hit the floor, didn't it? <laughs> Yeah, I, I was good you I wasn't on camera then. What about all of them? That's like, yeah, the silver. Okay. That's that. very, 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 very. Oh, that's very good. Start dialing through. I'm, I, I genuinely thought this was the price tag. And of course I prepped for the shows, but I don't, my brain doesn't hold on to so much information. So what? You're going to do what? Oh my goodness me, it's going even lower. Do I need to be an accomplished silversmith to do this? No, I mean, if you want to set the stones that easily go in, no. If you want to set different size stones, you'll need a few tools, but I can show you those um, and you can decide for yourself if you think you can do it. But it's certainly not something that you need to spend hours over, no. Today, per necklace, imagine if you, so you said you sold it you would sell it at forty pounds, yeah. and they would fly at that price. So, how about if I told you then you could make it for what? Fifteen pounds. That's amazing. Each. So you're looking at a hundred percent profit already. Yeah. You did sell them for forty. On and I one. think forty for a genuine Ratnakiri zircon and sterling silver. Oh, oh! Another clock. Yeah. <laughs> You know what to do. We've got quantity of this one. We know that sterling silver is actually the most po uh, popular of your precious metal. It's the most commer uh, commercially purchased. If you are thinking, right, I'm, I'm, I'm not a silversmith or I've only just started, get the silver. And I'll tell you why, because you don't have to be as careful with the silver. And if you make any slips or any marks while you're setting the stone, you can file them out. Oh, that's a good if point. If you do that on the rose gold or the gold, you could take the coating off if you're using a heavy file. So if you're thinking, I want to have a go with this, um, I'm maybe not as confident, I haven't done many things before, go for the silver. Yeah, it's more forgiving. Go for silver, more forgiving. You can polish it, you can sand out any marks that you might make if you slip. Um, yeah. Well... I think people are going to be absolutely stunned, shocked at what you're about to see. £29, that's £10 per necklace. 
Ten, you Love get that. three. That's so good. You get it? three stones, three chains, and three of those beautiful donut settings. The phone lines have literally <laughs> lit up. I ten, They're not base metal. Ten quid a necklace, that is. Yeah. That's like less than the high street place where you get costume jewellery and it's plastic. Yeah. Well, the ones like sort of my five-year-old would go in. Well, any of them, really. Well, yeah. yeah. Any, any of them, Any really. of them. Uh, accessories place. I mean, or... £10, you've got a genuine gemstone, you've got an unusual setting, you've got the chain, and you've got that three times over. Do you like know what? £10 you know, each. For, for the gram weight of sterling silver alone, that's amazing. Yeah. Oh, for the loose stones, that's amazing. What? Do we know what are? Oh, it didn't say that on the sheet. No, it didn't. It, it, it didn't. Okay, Ross says because it's the birthday and we've He's got silly hats swing on. of things. It's the birthday, <laughs> he says. Um, okay, this is literally the lo lowest we can possibly go. Not stopping at twenty nine ninety nine. Um, we have excitingly a big quantity. So, oh good. Listen, I've never done silversmithing before. I'm desperate to have a go at these. I will show you. You show me how. I'll show you how. And I will definitely have a go. And it's not breaking the bank. Let's be honest. No, definitely. And I think sometimes people are scared of working with these kits. They're like, I'm, you know, I've, I've spent out fifty pound or forty pounds, and I might ruin it. And, you know, with this, it's amazing. And get the silver. If you want to have a bash, get the silver because you can just polish it up, clean up any mistakes, and you're good to go. Forgiving. Very forgiving. Like my husband. <laughs> <laughs> He's lovely. He is lovely. Twenty nine ninety nine, but not stopping there. OK, what, what are you doing? I, don't, I genuinely don't know either. No. I genuinely don't know. We will bring the other two colours on your pre-order as well if you are... Ah, oh, that's Woo! unbelievable. That's what... My oh, math is rubbish. 797 something? It's good. <laughs> yeah. 833. 8 oh, my goodness. Look at everyone's going crazy. Her necklace, effectively. Or... No, it shouldn't be 24.99 for all that sterling silver. And it shouldn't be 24.99 for those genuine stones. Eight. Sorry. £8.33, we're breaking it down to it being three finished pieces of jewellery. £8.33 per necklace. Yes. Yeah. You've got sterling silver chain. Yeah. Sterling silver mount. Yeah. Genuine and lovely gemstones. Yes. For eight quid. Yeah. Don't you just love jewellery? I do, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> absolutely. Now, Woo. just so you know, we had a big quantity of these, but... Big quantity, but... There's already half the stock have been, uh, have been snapped up. Well done. That's, do you want to know something? Yeah, you say that out loud. Go okay. on, Debbie. Um, Ross just said it's £2.77 a component. So, frankly, he is insulting those little baby gemstones. All the way from Ratnakiri and Sakota and Rajasthan. Oh. All that way. How lovely. That's £2 so £2.33. That's oh. what the gemstones are saying right now. They're going, have you seen me? <laughs> Um, rose gold and the yellow gold are coming up in a few moments time you can actually shop ahead and pre-order Deb over to you though my lovely oh, I've had too much excitement I've had no cake no now cake they yeah, want I me know. to work without cake they've shown me cake they haven't given me any I know I can't wait I love chocolate cake I'm oh. very excited it helps oh if God. I'm actually in frame there we are they better save us a slice you know no she said she would and I trust her Elle yes I trust, I trust her. Too. Right, in this kit, you get your four mil gemstones. And I just wanted to talk a little bit about setting gemstones, if I may, seeing as it's a masterclass. So even though you're getting four mil gemstones, and you can go now and get all your four mil gemstones, well, not now, but after the show, you can go and get your four mil gemstones out and you can measure them. And you will find that within a sort of a tenth of a millimetre, all of these gemstones will differ. And they'll differ because it's a natural gemstone and it, you know, it's just a known thing in the industry. So let's just prove this point so I've got my calipers here and I'm just going to measure this one so I'd usually do it not on a map but we'll get an idea right hold on that's not quite right just let me right so that's 3.8 is slightly under four mil and this one I can already see is different I'm making a point here I'll show you And that one's 3.9, so that's four. So the point I'm making is that you could get any gemstone with a ready-made mount and you might have to do something to it. Okay. Now, the beauty of these uh, mounts is that they will fit different gemstones. So I'm going to get a silver one. 
to show you. So I don't know if we can get this if I show it to the camera. Um, can, I don't know if we can see inside it. Do you think that's possible? Yeah. Now, yeah. in there are three seats, like little lines, where the gemstone can sit. Whereas in a usual mount, I'm trying to keep still, in a usual mount, got the shakes, it's all that coffee. Um, inside a usual mount, you would have one seat or you would um, bezel down one seat with a, with a burr, with a gem setting burr. Now, I managed to get three mil gemstones in here and some of the four mil in the kits, no problem. Okay, so I'll show you back at my mat. Right, so this, which I'll show you if the overhead can get this, this one went in so beautifully that it literally snapped into place. So I'm going to still need to set that, but it's in there. Now that came from the kit that was four millimetre. Now then in the kit, the same gemstone, this um, was, I could see by looking at it, was larger and that wouldn't fit in. So you might find that some will fit in, some won't fit in. Mm -hmm. You will get some of your three mils that you've got in your stash and they'll fit in, is what I'm saying. It's very, very um, versatile is the word I'm looking for. So what I needed to do to get this gemstone to fit into this mount is burr it out. So now that fits in. Now let's talk a little bit about what I mean by fitting a gemstone in the mount. Now the widest part of the gemstone, is that called the girdle? It is the girdle. <laughs> the widest part of the gemstone needs to be just underneath the lip of the silver so that you've got some silver to push over the top. Now, if you popped a three mil gemstone straight in there, you might find you had even more silver. You could still set it, but you just have more of a silver halo around the gemstone. Okay. Does that make sense? Yeah. Now, what I'm going to show you, what, sorry, I dropped it. What I've done to actually get this to fit in here, and I did ask Ross um, for upsells of these, so depending on stock. Everything, Thank yeah. you, Ross. I love you. He's, a, he's uploading so, goodies for what you. I need, what you're going to need is your four mil setting burr. Okay. Mm -hmm. And it looks like this. So if you've got a pendant drill, any sort of Dremel or you use any sort of rotary tool, this is really, I would say, a must have. Having these in various sizes. This is your four millimeter setting burr. Now, sometimes all your... Um, mount will need and I know this sounds crazy but I've done it I'm not just saying this just let me get the uh, lubrication this is quite important as well I don't know if we've got this as well we're just putting the, your burr um burr is this is a Bosch burr uh yes it is Bush burr rather and these are really good quality so I've got these in various sizes in my studio and I pop them into my rotary tool so if you're making your own mounts, or of course, when you have ready-made mounts, because of the kind of difference in sizes of a gemstone, I will sometimes need this. Now, sometimes I don't even need a rotary tool. You can just add your burr just into your lubrication, and that just means that it works easier and it, it, it prolongs the life of your, of your setting burr. So I'm just going to pop my glasses on. Mm -hmm. And sometimes all I need to do is... Pop the burr in. You want to be straight down and just twist it with my fingers. And that sometimes will be the difference between getting a stone in or not getting a stone in. And it might just be like a tenth of a millimetre that you were out. And what I mean by that is the bottom of your stone could be in, but the top is too, is too far out. You haven't got that girdle underneath the outside lips of the actual um, mount now sometimes that won't work you'll have done it it's a, a, a process of trial and error you would have done this and thought no no I need to get my rotary tool in which case I haven't obviously with birthday had time to set up my Dremel but I'm going to talk you through it um, you would pop this into your Dremel now these do tend to be quite um, a different size uh, sort of um, mandrel and you might need a multi-chuck in your Dremel tool to actually be able to use this. So I know we've got multi-chucks on the website as well that, that you can buy and, and add in. And it will just you just set that into your rotary tool as usual. Now, the things you need to bear in mind while you're burring down is with your tool, you're always going to want to go so that it's straight down. 
and you don't want to sort of go for it straight down to the bottom just do it in little increments try the stone if it doesn't fit do a bit more maybe your stone's a bit wonky and you need to burn down slightly on the top or slightly on the bottom and that's how you make this um, fit any stone really sort of that you've got between I've I've set four I've set three and I would think that you could probably set a bit bigger than a four as well mm. with a larger burr mm. okay so it's as simple as gentle that gentle coaxing gentle coaxing okay okay so then once you have got your stone to fit into your mount the way that I tend to do it and I'm just going to move this out of the way but I'm going to stay here is I pop my stone on my bench with your pointy side up and then I pop my mount on the top and I give it a push and you can usually hear a satisfying click and if that goes in I'm going to move it out of shot if that goes in comfortably then um, you, you asked know. for that lubricant it yes. is it is uh, available so we've just put it on your screen um the lubricant is an absolute must for a lot of your tools um for your saw for your piercing piercing saw if you drill um it will just make things go a lot smoother and your tool blades and burrs last a lot longer i can't i can't be without mine you can see that i've um I've used it a lot. So there, now that fits in perfectly. So once that's in, you've then got to set the stone. Now I can't be without my ball vise, and I had this the other day with you, and I'm gonna use it again. So I'm just gonna move out my ball vise into shot. Mm -hmm. okay. okay, so just let me, let me move these. So once you've used your rotary tool, or you've literally just sort of taken that burr. Ooh, that looks heavy. It is heavy. It's got um, streamers all over it. Yeah. Whee! <laughs> now, this is my um, beloved tool. <laughs> This is my uh, ball vice. I actually said to Georgia a good while ago, I'm sure other people did too, C can we sell the ball vice because it's something that I can't live without. Now you'll see like I've, it's very messy because I've shoved on a load of blue tack on there and it's the pegs that you get with the ball vice. Now this is an actual setting vice. It's used for stone setting because uh -huh. if you think about these little things here, what we're doing is we're setting a little tiny component and it hasn't got a ring band, it hasn't got a jump ring on it, so how are you going to hold it? You can't pop the, the ring shank in the vise. Yes, this is the stone setting. Have you got it? Fantastic. So, what I've done, when you get this vise, you will get pegs that go into the vise. And what they do is they can hold something in place while you work on it. Now, usually I wouldn't use blue tack because I wouldn't need to, but because this, as I said, has got nothing to hold on to, yeah. I've just popped the blue tack so that these don't move. Now, you can get some products on the market. Um, Thermalock is one, and it, you, you heat it up, you pop it on, you put your, your piece in, and then when it gets cold, it holds it. Quite expensive, quite considered. Blue tack will do the job. If you've got this vice, it makes both of your hands free to do the work especially if you're going to be setting a lot of stones if you're going to be metal working quite a lot it's a very worthwhile couldn't live without it buy once purchase yeah okay right so let's set one of these stones shall we just let me grab okay i'm going to go for this one so what you do is you oh, pop no. the piece that you want to set onto your block now i've already done this just for time and then you pop in whatever pegs you get all these pegs in with the tool and you find the pegs that works the best so this is now completely supported so that when i go in to rub over set this i've got equal pressure on this side so i'm not going to misshape my setting i'm not going to pop my stone out and i've got far more control the beautiful thing about this tool as well is it moves that's why it's heavy. I can move it towards me. I can move it away from me. I can turn it around so that I don't have to change my working position. Now, there's a couple of ways that we can set this stone, and I'll show you my favourite ways. And it really is down to comfort, practice, and what you find the most um, comfortable to work with. Now, the main tool that I would use is a bezel pusher. And the bezel pusher is the one with the flat 
end. Mm -hmm. Now this one is sort of a bit more of a coarse end and I do tend to use this mostly actually, but you can get another one as well, which has more of a, a shiny round end. So if I was setting my rose gold or my gold, I would use this one because I don't want to make marks in that no. because I can't file them out. Yeah. Because um, if I file them out, I run the risk of actually filing off my coating. But that's why I said, if you're not sure, get the silver because it, it doesn't matter. Mm -hmm. The other way that you can set it is with um, a bezel rocker. And this is exactly the same. You just rock it that way. And these are all quite inexpensive tools. So I'd suggest if you can, you get all of them because there's going to be projects that you feel more comfortable with one yeah. rather than the other. And then to finish off... I always use a burnisher. Now, JM do several burnishers. Um, this is the curved burnisher. You can get a straight burnisher or an agate burnisher. And this is my agate burnisher and my curved burnisher. Now, I've actually um, got a, a short one because I broke my finger a couple of years ago and I find this one easier to hold, but it's just the same. Uh, I'll tell you what's wonderful about agate burnishers. They're far less likely, even if you slip, to mark the metal. Yeah, yeah it's just because they're softer. Because they're softer and they're mm. round and they've got that sort of highly polished kind yeah. of feel. Right, so let's get to setting. Now, I need to put my Back to the Future... Um, I love this. Oh, um, it's, it, well, you, well, we were channeling our, our, what was his name? Oh, it's May the 4th. May the 4th be with you. Dun, 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 <laughs> dun, 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 So, I don't know. I, I will be one. There I am. <laughs> I've never looked so gorgeous again, and this is what I come on television today, showing myself up. <laughs> So, if you've got a magnifier, it's quite important with stone setting. You might have that JM one, that wonderful one that you put over your ears yeah. or, you know, whatever. So, this is what I need. Now, I'm going to try not to get my head in the way of the camera, but obviously with stone setting, you'd usually be right over the top. Okay. So, what I'm going to use to start off with is just uh, my burnisher. Now, what you want to do, just let me check I'm in frame, yes, I am, is hold your setting against your pins so that you've got that really great purchase there so when I start to use this it's not going to go flying off mm -hmm. okay and then I'm going to just take my nail and hold that stone just until it starts to be squeezed in another way of doing it if you're not comfortable doing it with your hands is getting a cotton budge and holding a cotton bud on there because it won't mark the stone and then all I'm going to do is apply a bit of pressure and rock. Now, the hardest part is the beginning because you just need to get that stone squeezed in there. Now, once I've done this side, I'm going to go directly to the opposite side. So, all I need to do is swivel that around, hold on to it, and then rock it over. So, I've done 12 o'clock and 6 o'clock, say. I need to go to 3 o'clock. So, I'm going to 3 o'clock. If you've got a Fordham handpiece, you can use your... Um, your Fordham pendant handpiece, that works too, of course. And then I'm doing the same again. I'm just going to give that a push. Now, I am actually putting quite yeah, a bit of pressure. Sorry. <laughs> the desk went. So sorry. <laughs> and then I'm going to go opposite again. Now, if you get down on the level of your stone, you'll be able to see by peering over the top of it whether the lip of your metal has gone over your gemstone. And as you work round, you'll be able to see the pieces that you need to work on. So I'm just going to now continue to just set this. Now, let me just do a bit of troubleshooting here about the most common mistakes I see people make when they're setting gemstones. They do a really great push with here, but they forget to go over the top because they're scared of damaging that gemstone. Now, if that gemstone is underneath the lip, then it should be fine. So what you need to remember, once you've gone round a couple of times, and this isn't a process to rush, it's a process you want to do in short bursts, gently and just problem solving as you go along. You might have your stone pop out, pop it back in, start again. It needs to be patient. It's not something you want to do if you're feeling stressed. It's a nice, mindful, relaxing... You can hammer when you're stressed. Yeah. Just hammer when you're stressed. So if you watch my positioning here, I'm rocking, but then for the final rotation, I have to go over the top of the stone 
and press down and you'll start to see that metal flaring out and hugging the stone there and that's what we mean by rub over and then you've got to keep moving around and then once I've rocked I need to go over the top I'm really am popping on some pressure there and this is holding my um, little bezel in place I'm just going to go around doing that and you might find you've gone around a couple of times and your stone still is is wobbling about that just keep going and after a while your stone will be in a little bit and you won't need to sort of hold it with your finger. You can really apply the pressure over the top. So I'm just going to go. If you've got any questions, by the way, while I'm here. Yeah, feel, feel free, free to, message. To, to message in or find me on Facebook, JM Guest Designer Debbie Kershaw. I'm always answering people's questions, quite happy to do so. And yeah, again, do text in. Um, our, text, our text number, if you want to... Uh, text live in the studio. Make sure you start your text with JM Studios. The number is 78070. Any questions that you have for Debbie? I'll uh, carry on. Make sure you message through. Um, setting this. Okay. And then I'll move on to the next bit after Elle's done the next kit. Okay. Well, let's talk about the rose then. This is the kind of jewellery that you can create from this kit. Debbie, it's absolutely stunning. I love this. You know, that? yeah, that one. <gasps> that gemstone. Oh, rose de Maroc. It's lilac it's yeah. that like the pantone color of the year it's actually one color. of the rarest colors oh, of, of amethyst do you know less that particularly as well because it's natural i just it's a very unusual color even when i get it in a kit i'm, I'm always like that isn't amethyst that's not rose de france there's something in between mm. something in between it's lilac I love totally lilac. natural now this is the rose gold sterling silver again you get three of those beautiful donut settings you get three of your 18 inch lengths of rose gold plated 925 sterling silver chain um, and then you have the beautiful genuine gemstones which let me just take them off this and flip them over because for some reason these have uh, Jiggled their way out of their little 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 grooves, haven't they? They have. So, and we need to see them in all their splendour. So you're getting an amazing peridot. Come on, don't be naughty. <laughs> a really beautiful rose de Maroc, which again I heard the other day is not being mined. Really? No. For, so it's from the very rare Moroccan amethyst mine. And then you have that Ratnakiri zircon. Here we go. Here we are. Don't want them being shy. I want to show you the quality of the gemstones. Um, Ratnakiri Zircon, Natural Peridot, Natural Rose de Maroc, um, all that sterling silver. I mean, I would fully expect, Debbie, to pay what the price that's on your screen for one of those necklaces. Yeah, yeah, because you've got that rose gold plating. If you go and look on, um, I know we were saying Monica Venada. I really like Monica Venada. Me too. I think it's beautiful. If you go and look on Monica Venada, uh, Clobo, who else can I think of? Thomas Sabo. If you look at anything that is rose gold plated or gold plated, mm. the, the okay. price goes woof. Massively. So, you know, it's something that in a setting like this, you might not be able to work with because usually it would be gold or rose gold fully. And then you're looking at a lot of money. Well, you've just said, yes, absolutely agree with you. You go to any of those jewellery design houses, if you want something gold plated or rose gold plated, you pay a premium for it. Yeah. And so then to make with it and if you're making to sell, is it worth your while? Because by the time you've made it, you think, well, I, you know, I can't sell it for much more than that because I've spent so much. So I guess, setting. so I guess we shouldn't match the price then. <laughs> Not really. But that's what we're doing. You can shop ahead on the gold too because we're going to be doing exactly the same deal, um, which is absolutely amazing. Love these kits. If there are any of them left, I'm going to have a go at this. I, you could definitely do this. Al. It's it's beautiful. I love the simplicity of a rubbed over setting. Plus, it protects the gemstone once you've done all this process. It's Absolutely. protected, isn't it? And I like th the fact that you can then just pop. I'll show you in a minute. Just pop the chain through, and it's yes. and then you just pop a clasp on. So, yeah, yeah, because they're literally what. If I turn it that way, Debbie, is that going to ah? See what I mean? You just like gently drop the chain through, and it, it moves like that. Will move along the chain very gently. Oh it's my goodness! Literally elegant. floating. Like an Elsa Peretti. Yes. Beautiful, Debbie. £24.99. And you can see, look, 
Don't be fearful of using the plated or uh, the no. rose gold plated no, no, no. or the yellow gold plated. What I would just say, just takes a bit more time. You need to be more gentle, mm -hmm. and you need to take more time. Yeah. Um, so, you know, and you're not going to ruin it by sort of slipping. But what I'm saying is, if you want to file it afterwards, yeah. You can buff it, but I wouldn't file it. I wouldn't file any plated no, jewellery no, no, because no. you've got that coarse file that can just takes the top few layers of metal off. Yeah. So, I mean, the rose gold is just beautiful. And then you can polish it up to a really lovely shine That's with those stunning. connoisseur wipes. Lovely. Yes! That foam stuff, I didn't even know they did that. Yeah, it's good, isn't it? You've got some now. Well, I've got the big cloth, and um, that is the last part of my jewelry making process so after I did this and I put it on the chain I put it in my ultrasonic cleaner and then I I get my connoisseur yeah I do it every time now you've got the pump she's given me she money. did she bless her heart she gave a long ego so kind no excuse for us to have grubby jewelry now Debbie is there I know no excuse <laughs> um back to you right so once you've gone round and you're completely happy, so I'm not completely happy, but you know, I haven't got time. And then what you do, you might find, the thing slip, you might find that you've got some sort of little marks. I don't know how close we can come in on that, but you might have some little marks where, where you've set it. Now I don't mind that to be fair, hmm. because it kind of adds to that organic feel. Authenticity. Of, yeah, and it doesn't look like a machine made it. Yeah, I agree. Know, I don't make jewellery to make it look like a machine made it. Yeah. I want that love that I've put into it to show. But if you want to sort of get out some of those little dents that you've caused, then this is where your agate, burnisher, or or your other burnisher come into play um, and you can just rub over the top with this and it will do two things it will add a lovely shine to the top it will it'll do three things actually it will help to splay that metal even further over the top my head's not in the way is it no of the gemstone and if you've got any like little creases little dents then this will iron them out as it were and i'm not putting a lot of pressure on here but can you see again this ball vice is just holding, holding this so i've just need my thumb and i can just turn it around there debbie would you use the a burnisher on the gold plated and the rose gold as well uh hmm. is it gonna is it gonna scrape off the plating it, i would use an agate burnisher very <laughs> oh that's good because there's one on the screen oh yeah yeah. Very gently. I would use agate, not metal. Yeah. And I would just go around very gently and it will bring up that shine. The plating's lovely on our findings, so that'll be absolutely fine. I just wouldn't use a file or sandpaper. Yeah. That's what I wouldn't Stroke use. Stroke it. Stroke it gently. And okay. because you've got that beautiful, round, soft surface in an agate burnisher that you can't achieve on metal. Yeah. Because sometimes you need it to be a bit harsher. Yeah. Um, that agate burnisher will bring it up really beautifully. And then when you've finished setting, and, you know, as I said, it's not a quick process. It's quite mindful, quite relaxing. You know, keep getting your magnifiers out, having a look at it, making sure that you're happy. And then when you're finished, you've just got to add your chain and give it a bit of a polish. So I'm going to move all these out of the way again. You need muscles to move this tool. It's very heavy. <laughs> Did we take it to £249? Yeah, it's, re it's really good. It's a really good one. Your one's better than mine. <laughs> I may be buying it. Wow. Um, I why did I have it on? I wasn't with you last time, was it? I think it was a time before. Yeah. And we had to get more stock because so many people got them. Yeah. I think they thought, oh. We only had six left. Yeah. So we've only got a few left now. And that is still crazily £3.50 postage and packaging. Do you know, that makes such a difference. And I was saying last time I was on, um, I bought a heavy tool. It was a rolling mill. And... Um, it cost me ten pounds postage and packaging, yeah. which is fine. But you know, it adds. It does make a difference, it doesn't adds. it? it? Does make a difference. Right. So once you finish setting, um, what have we done with that? Was still on the thing. We'll bring the okay. graphics on your screens for the gold, which you can see a Debbie's finished piece. You know the price tag. This is the most limited of the custard filled. I know. I love the names of these. They're so the cute. Jam filled. Jam filled. Custard filled. And what was the other one? Cream filled. See, they're still talking Not about many. food. Oh, sorry, sugar coated. <laughs> so I've got a little tiny cloth here just because I, um, I wanted to fit it in my tool box. And 
what I'm doing is just giving that a little polish. So isn't that lovely? It's gorgeous. It's really pretty. So then you need to just add your chain. So uh, you've got three different types of chains in this kit. And what you do is you just find the hole and then just give it a little... Use gravity. Use gravity, that's it. And then just give it a turn. And it comes out the other side like... I'll show you oh, look like this so don't try and um, pop your chain through in a straight line do what I just did so you sort of drop the chain down and then sort of turn your bezel a little bit okay. and it just goes through Ooh. like that I mean look at that isn't it pretty that's my granddaughter's birthstone that garnet isn't oh you lovely? need to keep that now for Clemmy um, I will be giving the one with the um, Ratnakiri into the bumper. <gasps> for That's the viewers. very nice of you. So that um, one of you can get one of the, this one. I think silver's probably best because we don't, even when you don't know people's. Uh, Hang on, we're going to put that in. I'll wait till you finish okay. the demonstration as well. I am going to put the birthday box in. <gasps> the studio sample. I'm just checking this stuff I've in there. I've not seen this. Ooh. Yeah. And we've got something else to go in. But you need a bigger hamper. We're going to need considerably bigger buns. <laughs> or boats. <laughs> and oh. one of those. Let's drop one of those in there. And how will Dippy's people, necklace. How will people every win Every 20 that? pounds that you pay, we're going to have to get a bigger basket, aren't we? Yeah. Um, every 20 pounds that you spend over the birthday event automatically enters you. Into the drawer. So if you spend 40, it's two. So on. Ooh. So on, so on. <coughs> wow, that's amazing. That, imagine getting that through the post. Yeah, I know. Yes, please. Um, I will put the box in and I will put Debbie's necklace in. So there's various ways that you can finish this chain off depending on which chain um, you've used. And I'll show you on the finished pieces. So on the silver one, I'll pop it down um, for the overhead to see. I've just popped on... Um, a toggle clasp and what I've used is 0.4 wire and I've just done a little loop and then added that onto there mm -hmm. now another way that you could do it you know the ribbon uh, crimps that we used to do back in the day they're like little um, findings where you sort of squeeze the chain you can put that on um, if you're a silver worker you could actually solder on solder, together, yeah. solder on your jump rings so that's really easy if you are if you don't want to solder add any heat just pop some 0.4 wire through the link yep. and add your your um, clasp that way so, and then a little bit of buff a little bit of a polish with the connoisseurs with your connoisseurs and and you're good to go and i think it makes a really high-end <sighs> elegant looking necklace really really pretty they're absolutely beautiful debbie i love those and as if you can make them for what did we work it out to be eight pound thirty something yeah yeah £8.33 each. That's the green kyanite that you can see. That's gorgeous. It's, it's so beautiful. That'd go with your outfit, you know. It would. It might have to go around ooh, my neck ooh, in a minute. Oh, oh, So that's the rose gold one, which the lilac has to be my favourite. I think it's just... Yeah, that is amazing. And rose gold doesn't tend to be my favourite, but with this gemstone, I think it's... It amazing. works. Oh. It works. And I love it with morganite too. Yeah, rose gold. There oh, are certain yeah. gemstones that really, really, really work. Um, we're going to do what? Oh, yes. Ooh. Yes. I'm just going to pop. It's going to have to be super quick. Now, we have we have literally been um, wanting to include this strand within the birthday shows. And there's just not been enough minutes in the, uh, in the show. Well, it's coming up. It's going to be quite fast and furious. Make sure you're ready. Usain Bolt, you've got to channel that right now. <laughs> there are 100 of these tans nights, and they are sublime. One minute, 60 second clock. On your screens. Debbie, look at this. I know. 
look at the quality of that tan tonight. Oh, pinks and purples. I know. We were saying a few uh, when Scott was in the studio, it's like you know, and uh, and when Mark was with us, it, the quality just seemed to be getting better and better and better. Yeah. Listen, I don't want to credit Wayne any more than I already <laughs> have today. But let's be fair, he is awesome. He is awesome. He is absolutely awesome. Um, look at the quality. It's our finale birthday deal. You will not believe how incredible our, our, our final auction is going to be. Mm -hmm. I know. I mean, something like this, I would have expected. Again, I'm sorry to sound like a broken record, but five six years ago it would have been about 129 pounds yep wouldn't it yeah, when yeah. i was under the when we were under the immediate umbrella yeah. they didn't have quite the buying power no disrespect to them but no, they no. you know we didn't they didn't have the buying power that jemporia have no you that's know. the beauty that's the beauty this is the closing auction of the day vanadium rich you know you mentioned the pantone color yeah that's that Pantone colour. It is gorgeous. It's just like a peri. I don't even know how to describe it. It's, it's my birthstone, this. That is a beautiful strand. Is it your birthstone, yeah. is it, Debbie? Yeah. Well, I, I tell you what, because you're here on the birthday, yeah. and it is your birthstone, yeah. do you know what I'm going to do with this studio sample? What? Yeah! Pop that in that basket. Wow. How amazing is that? Ignore the first price crash, because we are nowhere near. It's your finale. 4th of May, 12th year of jewellery maker, That's birthday funny. deal. Not paying that. No, no, no. Like I said, that would have been an immediate deal. Don't I sound like I'm being really disrespectful and I don't intend it to be. No, but not were. at all. It's we about, want to melt the phone lines. I mean, it's about the buying power, isn't it? Totally. Totally. That's not even your price tag. Okay, so this is going to be a real gift. It's going to be on and gone. The next price tag is your finale deal. Look at that. Literally consistent uh, colour matching, full of vanadium rich, those beautiful Pantone colours. You're very peri. You said you can see, of course, your gorgeous pinks and purples. That's the nature of this gemstone as a triachroic gem. Tanzanite, there's not many people out there that don't recognise no. and appreciate, firstly, the history, the legacy, the sentiment behind the gemstone, but also the fact that it's quite an investment. Yes, and something that you keep, something that you, you know, have in your special box. You'd be happy at 29.99, wouldn't you? Yeah, I made my, my shocked face when I saw that. Yeah. I, I, I can't wait to see your flabbergasted face <laughs> then. It's not attractive. <laughs> Neither's mine, but it's all good. <laughs> it's all good. Um, it is going to be a sellout. Um, Rossi's got... I tell you what, Ross, I've loved the, the, the spring in your step, um, especially when he goes rogue with auctions like this. He's filled with love and joy, he says. <laughs> Aww. Isn't that nice? £19.99. pence. He's 20 got quid. Yeah, That's exactly. amazing. Yeah, you could have, you could have, we could have, a hundred pounds would have been on top of that a few oh, years ago. That's beautiful, I love it. And me. That's so, wow, that doesn't look at all like a 1999 strand. Like when you see it in real life, you're going to love it. Get it in the sunlight. Yeah. Well, you're right, it's not a 20, uh, a 20 pound strand, is it? No. We had, come on now, half the stock's gone, this needs to be an on-screen sellout. I, 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 you've got 45 seconds and then literally Debbie and I say a bon voyage. Um, bon voyage. Do you know what this would look amazing with? Something we're launching tomorrow. Right. Lavender jadeite. Ooh, natural. Yes. Natural, oh, I'm gonna natural watch. Lavender, lavender jadeite. Yeah, tomorrow coming up with Dave. You've got to make sure you check out your baskets because we are literally seconds away. 30 of these are left from the 100 that we actually had. Debbie, I love you. I love you too. Um, can't wait to see you. When are you back next? 11th next Wednesday. Oh, it might be me. Um, more coming your way. I'll see you tomorrow.